green, we've got the gold in there, you've got the rose gold as well, you've got the white and the silver as well. You're saving £7 on these, the price, £17.99 for any two of 25 metres in length. 426152 is your item number and any purchase during the live hour, you will also receive a free gift as well. Terms and conditions are all on the website. Don't miss out on another cracking little birthday present. Now, which one shall I have? Did you know you can watch Hochanda 24 hours a day, seven days a week, using the Hochanda app on your Amazon Fire Stick for free? Just like your smartphone accesses an app store to add new applications, your Amazon Fire Stick accesses the Amazon App Store to add new applications. By downloading the Hochanda app, you'll be able to access your favourite craft channel on your TV anytime you want to watch. Here's how to do it. Simply turn on your TV and connect your Amazon Fire Stick. If this is your first time using the device, follow the on-screen instructions to connect to the internet and log into your Amazon account. Once set up, you'll need to open the search bar. To do so, simply use your remote circular directional dial to scroll to the search icon and select it. Now simply type Hochanda into the search bar and this will take you to the Hochanda app. All you need to do now is select download and remember it's free. Once this is added to your Fire Stick, you can move the app for easy access. Press and hold your home button on any app and then select apps from the menu that appears. Scroll down to the Hochanda app and press the button with the three horizontal lines on your remote and select Move to Front. And that's it. You can now watch, purchase and catch up with your favourite shows 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. Hi, my name is Blanche Siegmann. I'm the owner of the company La Blanche. The company La Blanche is a crafting company located in Germany. For over 20 years, I'm designing and selling stamps, paper crafting products, and home decoration. As a passionate crafter myself, I make sure all our products are of highest quality and easy to use. We produce a whole range of products. We produce paper products. We have also shrink sleeves for your jars, glasses. We have home decoration products, paints and wall decals. Everything, the whole range of crafting we produce for you. I hope you enjoy watching us at Hochanda and Crafting with La Blanche. Stone the crows, or is it scare the crows? Good morning, everyone, and happy fifth birthday, Ho Chanda. It's great to have your company. Here I am. <laughs> great to have your company this morning, and it's lovely to have the company of your good selves and our oh, Hayley Smith. All right, Hi. Hayley. I'm just busy cutting stuff out. That's all right. It's always it's okay. good to hear that you're busy. Yes, I, I've got demos to prep. I've got demos to prep. Excellent. Yes, we've got lots of <laughs> demos on the show today. But let's tell you about the one-day special that we've got for you. We were very busy last night. Nearly 40% of the stock has gone. Now, this is issue number three of your Fabazine, full of inspiration and fabulous projects for you to start as soon as you get this home. Because alongside the magazine and all the hints and tips that you get inside, you're also getting the project panel to start making and creating your projects. You've got 12 projects in here in total. Here's the panel. As you can see at the top, you've got the cushion. Now that is remarkable what you can do with that. And we'll talk you through that in a moment's time. You've got a panel so that you can sort out maybe your pens, your makeup brushes. You've got some panels to make a pinny. Yes, a pinny. So if you're crafting or baking, that will be absolutely excellent. You can see it just there. We've also got projects in here to make a bag. Now, in that bag, you could put your crafty goodies. You could put your makeup bits and bobs in there if you want to, or maybe your overnight bag. 
There is a pattern to make this lovely mug holder here. So that's going to keep your mugs nice and warm and make them look rather nice. You've also got the pattern to make the flowers as well, which is beautiful. Love that. Uh, the duck, yeah, you've got the panel to make the duck. Now, is this Frank? This is Boris. Uh, Boris likes to drink. <laughs> so we'll put Boris there, drinking away the, the and nibbling the flowers as well. was inspired by the uh, Frank Meets Cup video that we have on Frank's Instagram. If you see that video, then th it explains that duck a lot more. <laughs> right. Right. Can we talk about who Frank is? Okay. Um, so if anyone at home doesn't know who Frank is, can we talk who Frank is? Yes, Frank is uh, my pet duck. <clears throat> and, uh, Your pet duck, not yes. dog. No, it's a duck. Yes. He's very nice and very friendly and now has his own collection as well. Well, he certainly does. Um, now, we're calling him a he, but I heard yeah, earlier... Yeah, girl. Yeah, you think, you think Frank might be Frankie. Well, do you know what? They said the same about me at school, actually. <laughs> She might be a girl, she might not be. <laughs> might not be. <laughs> Who knows? Matter. I'm still confused. Um, <laughs> but with your Moving projects. <laughs> <laughs> Moving swiftly on. Uh, we've also got a project. Now, I love this. I'm just going to pick this up and show you because this is your collapsible storage. So you can have this on your counter. You can put your pins in there and your bits and bobs, and then you just pull that up and you're not going to lose. Oh, it actually slots right into the bottom. We did that one as a demonstration last night. If you twist it and squish it flat and we showed cutting the base last night so it actually pops in the base the base will pop into that frame on the top there you go don't keep popping that's enough I Steady. Like, I'd like to push <laughs> it a little bit more than most <laughs> I think you push it quite enough young lady <laughs> um, so you've got your little pattern to make that um, you've also got your wire work as well and with that you get your yes, MDF. This is a, a, a string art so you're getting the MDF backing, you're actually getting a bigger MDF backing than that. We made the samples and decided we wanted to be a bit taller so you've got a bigger piece than that and um, you've got the white thread that comes with it as well. You get the nails so you can put everything in so there's um, that's the one that we've done is just a basic sample but then obviously the design team have to take it further and there's one that you should have down there somewhere that Patty's done oh it's on the other side it's beside the cushion which that's is just here that's not is that in glitter thread yeah yeah she swapped it out for glitter thread and put a piece of acetate in there to make it look like it's got um water in yeah it's nice very different I like it reminds me of an episode of Dexter if you watch oh. Dexter, you'll know exactly yeah. what I'm talking about. <laughs> Say no more. Say no more. Uh, there's also included in the kit, you also get the templates to make and create a fantastic cushion. You do. Now, um, the temp we always put one project in there that's either template based or something where you can use up your stash. So this is designed to be a clamshell template. So the uh, big quilt that's on the front of the, the um, counter there, that's done in the kind of as we intended in the traditional kind of clamshell fashion so that really bright one that you can see on the front there but there are lots of other ways that you can use this because essentially you've got two parts of the template and those two parts um, uh, kind of fit on a charm square so there's um, the quarter circle bit and then there's the bit that is on the side okay that's kind of like a little archway so what you do is the uh, working with clamshells and curves the worst bit is always having to sew that big kind of semicircle curve and get it right so we split it down you're sewing the quarters and then all you're doing is you're taking those squares that you've created and sewing the squares together which is dead easy okay so that you've got the the, the more difficult bit on a much smaller scale and then you've got the uh, easier bit of sewing all the squares together which will make your whatever pattern you like because there's a just on the corner there come this way on the corner uh, behind the behind the magazine I've given yes. you some extra samples not that magazine the other magazine what mag oh what? this one yes yes there I've given you more samples oh, just to that. show you so that's your traditional clamshell shape that you can make and thank you to Claire for doing these for me so there's your traditional clamshell then you can make circles Oh, that's nice. As well. I like that. That's clever. And uh, there's another one as yes, well. Yes, there is. You can put them together in a, Ooh. another pattern. And that pattern can continue to repeat. So those curved bits will kind of go into the other curved bits. And you can 
keep that going on and on and on. That's interesting. Very good. Very good. Um, you also get this beautiful panel to make and create an embroidery as well. I know that's something that you are uh, a champion of. Yes. Uh, this is one of our little embroidery doodles, and that's our little toucan one, which is very, very cute. So if you don't want to embroider it, you can always use your uh, fabric markers and, and things like that and just colour it in. Um, I think it's a great idea to have a magazine like this full of inspiration. Now, this is issue number three, yes, isn't it, Hayley? Yes, it is. uh, so, full of inspiration. This is the cushion we were telling you about. We're going to have a demonstration on the cushion today. Uh, we did the cushion last night, so uh, if you look at 8 o'clock, that will okay. show you how to do the cushion. Uh, we did the thread catcher last night. We, did, we started the little um, pouch last night, so we'll finish that one this morning. And the first hour, we did the duck and something else something oh, else mug rug mug rug and duck so we're five in at the minute brilliant brilliant five and hopefully 12. we'll get through all of them well, by the end of I'll, today i'll try my best 12 projects in total now it works out to be three pounds and 33 pence per project now because we are celebrating our fifth birthday you're getting a free gift with a purchase on the show and it is a panel to make and create this beautiful teddy bear so the panel itself has the template on there and then you do the embroidery work to build your teddy bear isn't that fabulous i think we've got the panel just here to show you there you go uh, so that's your panel so you've got all of those areas for you to embroider with whatever color thread or embroidery thread you want to do so um, that's going to be bespoke with you so two payments of 20 pounds for your one day special and your fabazine contains 127 pounds and 91 pence worth of projects that is value for money it really is so if you want to get hold of your one day special 507152 however we've got a superb bundle for you this is frank's Friends. Now, I love this. First of all, I love the colour. Uh, I think it's very modern, but it's got that retro vibe to it with the beautiful teal and grey colours here. Uh, but this is superb value for money as well because you get 13 appliques on top of your panels here to build and create that great little picnic bag. So you've got 13 ducks, appliqué ducks. Yes, you've got 13 extra appliqué elements. So you get your bag, you get everything with this. You get your zip, you get your felt to put in the inside of your scissor keep, you get your super stiff batting to create the bag. So you're not going to need anything for this apart from thread to put it together. There's Frank. There's <laughs> Frank. There he is. It took me a lot of peas to get him there. I do you know, I love peas. That's something that Frank and I have in common. Peas and sweet corn is anybody's. <laughs> anybody's for peas and sweet corn. Uh, but this is, this is a great magazine, £21.99. It's not just a magazine, of course. It's your projects to build and create with those extra 13 appliques. You can put those onto any projects you want to. So that's going to make your bag, your zippy pouch and your scissors keep. Uh, and there you go. So there's your, for your scissors, which is perfect. Also looks like so we can put popcorn in. And then you've got your little purse as well as your bag. And I guess with the bag, Hayley, if you wanted to, you could put some um, like thermal lining in there. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, so, we've, I've done it more as a, a, a sewing bag. It's just a nice size for all yeah. the bits and pieces that I kind of cart back and forth to here. Yeah. Um, and I've used a kind of faux binding technique on the top whereby we've um, squared off the edge of the super stiff batting that you get and instead of kind of rolling everything all the way back to top stitch the top I've actually allowed that lining to come up and over the top of the edge of the batting to create that kind of false binding effect I like that which is quite cute isn't it yeah it is it is very cute uh so you've also got your wadding as well you've got your zip in there and then you've got the brown to do your that um, goes in between the scissor keep the one the sample that i did there i originally did it with um uh, batting i did it with our super soft batting it's a little bit bulky so what we've done is for the kit we've replaced it with a, a felt so a really nice strong felt Perfect. so it's just a little bit easier to sew uh, it's a great deal at 21.99 but what you can do is get both of the magazines together if you want to so your one day special and your frank and friends if you want to go for these together you're making an incredible saving so keep your saving for your one day special that's your 10 pound keep your saving of three pounds for your frank and friends and then you can divide the cost. Yes, you can.
uh, on Flexi, there you go, £29.49. pence. If you want to go for both of these, you get that extra £3 saving on top of that. So it's a great saving of £16. 032376 is your item number. Think of all the projects, think of all the gifts that you're making and creating, whether they be for yourself or whether this is your Christmas list for your friends and family this year, which makes it extra extraordinarily affordable so and Hayley just wants to say something they come, uh, we've got new packaging for them so they come in beautiful boxes so they're far more giftable the boxes now match the magazines perfect on the front perfect yeah, yeah. so you could Snazzy. give this as a gift or you could make your projects and give those as a gift if you want to so going for uh, your one day special or of course you can go for the combination of frank and friends and your one day special which is where the the real value for money lies because you get lots for your money now we've also got a happy hour deal for you 14 pounds and 99 pence this is going to allow you to store your fabric in uh, a beautiful box that you get to put together and then make and design because you can put your papers on there your rice papers you can put some fabric panels on there if you want to but it's all about keeping your fabric stored within so you get 23 mdf bolts inside so you can store those fabrics around there making it easy to take them in and out of the box saving four pounds on that it's a happy hour deal for this hour 14 pounds and 99 pence five seven one one six nine right it's now time to go over to Haley the wonderful wizard <laughs> don't, don't, of demonstrations. Don't. <laughs> just, just don't. <laughs> you are. Okay, so um, we started this last night. This is the uh, one of the smallest projects in there, actually. It's the little card pouch. So this is designed to be the size of a kind of, you know, a credit card kind of size just so if you either got business cards or you've just you just want to nip out to the shops and you just want a card that you can attach to your key rings that's nice and secure could be a bus pass it could be a bus pass driving that's a license. good point mm. these are all excellent points so within there you get one of these or you actually get two because you get one for this project see invisible Visible press studs, and on your panels, you've actually got little circles so you can see exactly where to put them. So, you're going to attach these first before you sew everything together. So, that one just hand stitch it on, and then there'll be another point to hand stitch the other piece on at the top there. Um, and I would do this first, so while they're like that, before you assemble it together, and then your stitches will all be hidden on the inside. Once you've got those on, then you're going to press that in half because that's going to be our pocket at the bottom and rather than the internal seams where we stitch it and then we turn it right side out these are all based on having the kind of visible uh, stitching seams on the outside so we're going to grab a machine and oh steady I've got um, red thread top and bottom on this but before I actually put that in I just want to grab a little scrap of fabric and just test exactly where my needle's going um, number 10 and we'll just test that out and see what we've got okay so from this I can see that my needle is um, kind of hitting on the right hand side exactly where this mark is here and on the left hand side it's coming in between these two so I can use that now as a guide when I come to use my proper fabric and you'll see I've got a little tab hanging out the side here that is the one that's going to attach the key rings. This is not the proper tab. You get some proper tape in yours. Where are you off to with all that? I'm going nowhere. Mm hmm I'm going nowhere. Okay. You, you just carry on. She's, she's up to monkey business. I can see it from here. Muggy business. Monkey I'm business. I'm holding a mug, but I'm not getting up to any muggy business. It's so weird some days, Janice. Always. <laughs> always weird. <laughs> and wonderful. Okay. I agree. That'll do. Okay, so we are going to use uh, the zigzag stitch or the satin stitch on here to just completely encase all of those ends and the seam will still be visible on the outside so it's just going to give you a, a kind of a different version, a more kind of rustic version of the seam. Obviously it will still hold absolutely everything together, be perfectly secure but it's just something that's, it's just another technique and that's what Fabazines are all about. They're about techniques, they're about showing you different ways that you can do things and giving you a little project to have a play with it on and then you may take that further and use it on different projects elsewhere but it's the same satin stitch that you'd use to um, add applique on or 
if I, let me see if I can swap it out to a blanket stitch. Um, now you can get, I don't know what I was going to say. All of the projects individually. You can, you can get all the projects individually you if you want to. And that's to. where we come up with the, the value the, of, of uh, like 120 something pounds worth of projects. What we do is we create the project individually first uh, and say, well, well, you know, what would that be? What would that be? And some of them we bundle together because some of them, like just the embroidoodle, may not be a whole project in its own right. So we do that first and then we try and squidge as many as we can onto one panel. And when you actually count the individual flowers and the individual mug rugs you can make, there's a lot more than 12 projects on Yeah, there. I think there is. I what think are you there doing? Is. What are you laughing at? I'm laughing at you being weird and stealing all the I'm stuff. I'm not being weird. I am multitasking. Oh, OK. I am multitasking. I'm helping my director as you do your demonstrations, but okay. also watching you intently and mm -hmm. uh, learning a lot. <laughs> oh, hello. What? <laughs> stealing stuff. Just oh, don't touch that. Oh, dear. That took quite a long time to balance on there, sorry. <laughs> okay, so I've swapped stitches on here just so you can see uh, some, some different ones that we've been using and different ways that you can... Oh, that's not the one I want. I want that one. Sorry, I'm beeping loads. I'm very sorry. There we go, that one's better. So you can use the different stitches on here as well. So I'm using now a, um, what would be an overcast stitch, one that you'd use to hem trousers, but it will work equally well as an external hem on this. I'm just going to squeeze that back into position there. <laughs> I can see it out of the corner of my eye. <laughs> yes each page which means if you've yes, got there um, so a smartphone if you have got a smartphone you can scan that it will take you to our YouTube channel and there are videos for if not all then most of the projects on there so you've got um, all these stitches that you use in the embroidedles there are videos for all of those there are uh, videos for everything now I will confess um, when we were putting the ones up for uh, the last I think couple of number one and the couple of number two videos our account got hacked because somebody was posting naughty things Ooh. in the comments and we got uh, got kind of taken off until we could sort it out so I'm a few videos behind in my posting but they will all get there because we are now uh, officially allowed what again. were they saying uh, they were posting things of was it naughty naughty I mean clearly we won't go there but Ooh. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but it's all fixed now. It's all good. You're not going to come across anything you shouldn't. <laughs> I'm just logging in now <laughs> and leaving some comments. <laughs> so, I've got a couple of different stitches on here. I'm not going to go all the way around because I want to get onto other demonstrations. But you've got um, uh, a satin stitch down the side there, and then I've switched it to uh, overcast stitches around here. You can use all sorts of different things, but your seams are going to be visible, and that's going to create your little pocket. And obviously your press studs are on there as well. And that's your little complete project. Oh, fantastic. So, uh, can I move on to another one? Uh, yes, please. Okay, <laughs> no problem. So <laughs> we'll have a quick look. <laughs> so, just as well, I had something else ready, isn't it, Janice? <laughs> it is a good uh -huh. <laughs> Just so, to well, clarify at home, <laughs> I just want everyone to know that I'm not mucking about not no being um, I, I now having know my attention doing, on you and i'm just fine. doing some i'm just <laughs> helping my director out at the same time okay we're taking little so, pictures of everything just to let pictures. everyone know at home right so this is your clamshell template and this will come uh, as, as two separate pieces and if all of these sections aren't out you need to pull these out because they are designed so that you can get a pen through if i show you that one there You've got, you can use, these are thick enough to use with your rotary cutter because these are 100 and uh, 500 micron mylar, so you can easily use these with your rotary cutter. But the slots that we've left in the centre there are so that you can mark them out with a pen. So you've got your kind of sew, seam lines and sew lines on there. So if you're sewing by hand, absolutely fine. You can use that guideline to make a paper template and wrap your fabrics around them. If you're not doing that and you wanted to sew them by machine, then this is a much easier way than doing the whole clamshells in one piece. So I think what we might do is follow this on. So what I would normally do is take all of my pieces and cut those out first because 
Uh, that's what we, we need initially, is we need all of our pieces ready to go. And well, the great thing about the templates, Hayley, is that uh, you can use them for so many different projects yeah. as well. It's not just for this project. Absolutely. You can use them over and over again. So with the, uh, the clamshell, that's what you're aiming for. You, that's the, how we kind of designed it. Obviously, we've seen some different options on it before. But if you're wanting to create straight edges, if you cut out your clamshell pieces traditionally, you'd have a lot of waste. But with this, because they come as separate pieces, you can just move them to fill the gaps in. Perfect. So it's very, very kind of clever system. So what we're going to do is we'll maybe attach, uh, let's have a green one down there, shall we? Okay. Yeah, let's have a green one down there. So we're going to attach these together. So when I've added the uh, slots on here for you to mark them out, there's actually a center point on each of them where I've left a little gap. So if I leave those two together for a second, hopefully Magical Jimmy will fix it. Here he comes. Here he there comes. You go. There you go. So you can just see the lines that I've added on there. And there's a gap in the center of each one. And that's to help you line them up. So we'll put these back to back. Line up that center point. There you go. And we'll pin that first. And then we're going to work our way around. And because these have both been cut on the curve, that there'll be a tiny bit of stretch within them. Sorry, I'll move my pins across so I'm not stretching as much. And you're just going to line those up all the way around. Now, if you're you know, more experienced, you'll be able to get away without this and just do it by eye with the, the seam allowance. But for the, for the purposes of illustration, we are going to pin it all in place. So we're going to... And it's just about kind of teasing it around. And you can see that now matches up with its bottom end. Glad you said that. Sorry. Glad you clarified for everyone this morning. All about the clarifying today, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and one last one so that that matches up on that end. And then we're going to repeat that same process coming down the other side. So we're going to twist that. And because the seam allowance is the same, I mean, you would think when you had the two templates that were supposed to fit together that they would fit together once they're in that kind of template format but because this line has to fit with the inner line on that one that's where they come and have that slightly different shape because to keep that consistent seam allowance they have to be just a slightly different shape but you can see out of a, a charm square there's a tiny bit of waste from the middle and then just those two corners so you're not going to be losing a lot at all so i've got the last of this in place and then we're going to take to the sewing machine and pop this together so have you ever slept on a bed of nails Hayley? I, uh, uh, no janice I haven't why, why would i have done well, that well i'm just holding this nail art at the moment okay. whilst we get some pictures and it's like it's it's starting to hurt now okay yes well, maybe put it on the floor then uh, well i could but I, I, um, it's like an episode of cabbage and kings back here oh. do you remember cabbage and kings no. who remembers cabbage and kings at home Five to five, Cracker Jack, Cabbage and Kings. Mm. If you do, email him, please. No. Studio at hochanda.com. Do you not remember Cabbage and Kings? No. Oh, it was on Cracker Jack, five to five. It's Cracker Jack. No. Tell me you remember Cracker Jack. No. <gasps> oh, oh, Am it? I alone here? I no, you I'm, see, they, I they might know. just be a few, a few years younger than you. They used to. It used to be a game where they used to hold prizes and cabbages cabbages okay. and kings and they couldn't drop it and they used to build up and build up and build up hold everything or are they allowed to drop the cabbages yes you're Pardon? allowed to drop the cabbages no don't drop the cabbages okay. don't drop the cabbages right so anyway pinned together ready to go and uh, now i'm just going to sew this in place so you can sew it from either side whichever's easy for you i personally find it easier to sew with the smaller piece on the top and um, because I've already drawn those lines in, you can just use a quilting foot, which I have one in here somewhere, or I had one last night. Maybe I don't have it. Ah, here it is. So you can use a quilting foot like that with a guide on the side, which will give you your quarter inch seam allowance as you sew. Or you can do it kind of manually by hand. Um, oh, let's just do it. Let's just do it, shall we? All right, let's put it back onto a straight stitch because that's a good start. Um, and 
then we're going to start right on the end. I'm just going to twist this last one round just a tiny bit more. So I've got it joining straight at the bottom there. <laughs> You're making some funny noises, Janice. You're right. I'm sorry, but... <laughs> Are you suffering for your art? I'm, I'm very much suffering for my art. Okay. Right. I am just going to step that across. So I'm getting my quarter inch, but I'm, I'm using the edge of the foot as a guide. So... And this one does need to be sewn with a quarter inch seam allowance. Uh, it's quite important that it's done with that because um, that's kind of how it's designed. If you're going to go a bit further over, then you're going you're gonna to end up in trouble when it comes to later on. So we're going to take it nice and slow, take the pins out as we go, and just work our way all the way around that curve. Good job I had extra demos today, isn't it? Well, it, I mean, if everybody could see me now. Well, they probably can. If it's telly, you can, can just, I just press a button. <laughs> can I just come round? I just want to show you. I just want to show everyone at home because just, just, this is, this is how I'm... This is, this, <laughs> this is my current situation at the moment whilst trying to seriously present so I just just need it's all right, you to I'll see crack that on. I you, just want people to know you, you do that this is what I'm up to anyway back to Hayley there she is hi okay I'm barely round this so we, we are all right so that one out and then I've got three more pins to take out two and this last one again just slipped slightly so I'm gonna move that back into position I'm just gonna hold this one in position actually because we're almost there um, and we'll take that right to the end there we go and I'll just put a little fixed stitch on that so it doesn't come out and then you have your curved seam so I would press these all flat at this point and then you can start joining them back together but that nice. takes a lot of the headache out because just doing that quarter of uh, a circle rather than trying to do that full semicircle is going to make it easier so if we wanted to join them now we're just joining with those straight edges easy as that perfect and I guess you could use the clam shell template to make the quilt you can yeah, make you cushions can make, you, you can, can make, make anything, anything you, you like want with it it's it's your clamshell template is your starting point so we've given you instructions on how to put it together in that clamshell format that you can see there but um, I know that you have some other bits and pieces over there that you can um, you can you loads of different formats you can do you can do drunkard's path with it you can do all sorts of things. let's have a look at the projects that you can make with your fabazine so that's the quilt with the clamshell this that's... is the penny yeah. this is very cute there's a picture on our Facebook with Scott wearing it very now funny. isn't there a story behind the penny from one of your work colleagues oh yeah um, uh, the, not the not the one in the mannequin that was done by a tractor from our uh, design team but the other penny sample that you've got there that was actually made by Josh. Josh is uh, one of the guys who works, <coughs> works for Craft Yourself Silly. And I wanted him to be able to do more for us in terms of uh, helping with instructions and things like that. So um, he came down for a couple of days and after lockdown, it's all yes. fine, it's all above board. Um, and we kind of had a, a three day sewing lesson with him. And the other penny that you've got over there somewhere, that's the very first piece of sewing that he ever did. Really? Oh, that is amazing. And this is something that you can do at home as well. This could be your very first project. All you need to do is decide which project to start with. And in fact, that's quite a good question, Hayley. For somebody perhaps who's a beginner, that's not done a lot of sewing, but would like to get this fabazine yeah. to start those projects because it's great value for money, which project would you start with to give you the most confidence? Oh, I think that one's a good one yes. to start with because initially you think, oh, there's a lot in there, like there's the bias binding, there's making the ties. Um, so I would, I would say probably start with the apron because it's, a, it's all the mug rugs actually. Yes. Mug rugs are super simple. We did one of those in 10 minutes last night. Yeah. Uh, so the, that bag there. Now, 
it looks pretty boring there, but on the inside, it's, it's completely reversible. So um, in the next hour, in 12 o'clock, we're going to make the bag and we're going to make it the other side out so you can see the... See? Oh, -ho. yep. Fancy. And then on the bottom as well. I do mm. like a flat bottom. Yes. I think that's very good. It's got very good. Much, much, much easier to fill it with things. Yes, and there you go. You can just turn that inside out and it looks completely different. There's your... Um, Mug rug. Ah, the mug rug and the flowers. We haven't done the flowers yet either. Yeah, the flowers so are gorgeous. You're actually getting enough for seven flowers in there. So although we say twelve projects, yes, um, that's twelve plus another six flowers plus another mug rug. And those flowers are on the panel, so it's not something you have to go out and source. No, you no, don't no, have to get that there. fabric. The straws are included as well to create the stems. So there should be a pile of straws yes, over there. Yes, you've got yep, straws in got there. Them. Yes. Um, uh, absolutely everything's in there. We, we try and include absolutely everything. So these were quite fun and because we had the string art vase, that's why we put the, the flowers with it because they thought they kind of went together. Yeah, I think they do. It makes sense. It makes complete sense. Um, and then you've got that little, little twisty part. Yeah, I like that. So you can twist that down so it makes yes, it smaller. So what it does is um, when you put all your kind of leftover threads and things in, by twisting it down, you create kind of a little spiral of fabric in the yeah. middle, which kind of traps in anything yeah. that's in the bottom of it. Yeah. So it kind of keeps everything, keeps everything tidy, keeps everything in place. So the only thing that you are going to add to that would be something on the inside to make that quite hard. No, it's that's already in. It's already included. It's on the mylar sheet. Perfect. Yes. So you've got that mylar strip for the top, and you've got your bits for the bottom as well. Excellent, excellent. So it's all included. And then we've got the card holder as well, yes, which that's is a so card handy. Holder. That is really, really yeah. cute. And it's just one that's a, a kind of nice size that you could add onto a key ring and, or even, you know, dog bags if you're walking. Yeah, definitely. Just two or three in there, that'd be perfect. You know, I think it's a requirement that you've got to have at least three um, yeah, poop bags when you go walking. Mm -hmm. So it's important. And, so, you know, if you forget, what happens if you forget? It's not a good thing. Not a good thing. There's oh. not always a crisp packet to help you. It, oh. So it's a good idea to have one of those to take with you right. for a little car. Thanks for sharing that. <laughs> That's all right. That's all right. Oh. I'm a dog walker. I know these things. Uh, the clamshell quilt as well. Yes, the clamshell quilt. This is um, uh, based on the clamshell template, and there is always one project in there which is kind of designed to use up your stash. And I know that uh, we have those kind of batik style fabrics on as well as I think a fat quarter pick in there. Uh, possibly, uh, maybe not. We'll find out. And um, there's also a fabric freedom uh, barley batik pick and mix as well, which would work perfectly with all of these because um, they they just fit so nicely together. So that's your um, string art jar and one of the flowers in there. But you do get enough to make seven within there. Together. Yeah, perfect. Perfect. Um, and then once you've learnt how to make the flowers, if you've got your own stash, you can make even absolutely, more. Absolutely, absolutely. So you've got the mug rugs. Um, this is one that Attractor's done. She's taken the four panels that were in the, um, the fabric and she's added her own little bit of red and she's added a couple of buttons to make four out of them rather than the two but in the in the in the actual magazine it just it does say make two yeah, but if you add two, more fabric we've made two double-sided ones but if you want to add a little bit of your stash in you Perfect. can get them all to go further so that's the embroidered doodle i do like that that is gorgeous the hoop isn't included no it isn't that's just for display uh, but in number fabazine number two we did actually do an mdf hoop which is designed to fit all the um, perfect and they're cost effective to buy anyway. Yes. And it might not go into a hoop. You might want to put it as an applique onto a cushion or something yep. like that. That's another one using the clamshell uh, template. So rather than making them into actual clamshells, that one's just using them as, um, as kind of a piece. It almost creates kind of a wave effect on that one. And then that is our um, cotton bowl flower cushion. Now, could you just explain so what we do? I've got the cushion here. Um, it's very tactile, and when I first saw this, I was like, oh, hang on, how did you do that? Because it's not something you sew onto the panel, it's something no, you do to the isn't. panel. You're kind of taking fabric away rather than adding fabric for this one. So what you do is you've got uh, two panels, and you can see on that bottom one, that's the kind of starting point. So on the bottom one there, that's what you do. You have lines printed on the fabric, and you stitch all of those lines in place. And then you take a seam ripper or tiny scissors and you rip 
lines up in between all of those lines that you stitched. I really and like that. And then rough it up. Yeah. And that's what creates that kind of fluffy, faux chenille texture. I like that. That's a great technique to learn bits, because you can apply that to other projects. Yeah, you can. And the bits that go behind that, because it's all white fabric, um, you've actually got another uh, cotton flower panel, which is a white one. Yeah. So if you want a white front rather than a brown front, you can, you can do that. Uh, or you can use it so one is behind the other, like the other sample of it, which is the towards me on the corner yep there you go um, and this is one that Heather from our design team has done um, oh wow and she has taken the the white panel see that and then put the darker panel behind it and then slashed all the way through so when if you kind of just part the um, the bits on there a little bit you'll be able to see that there's the brown fabric behind so you can kind of see it oh yeah hang on. I've got it there you go there's that brown fabric Oh, I like that. That so, is very clever. That's an, I mean, we, in the instructions, it shows you how to do the, the first one that you saw, but you can obviously always take it further. Yeah, perfect. Did we mention, I don't think we mentioned, just a quick mention of... Oh, the um, little organiser. Yes. Yeah, your yes. organiser. Okay, so I need to put stiffer cardboard in that one because I've left it open at the side exactly for that reason, but we'll come to that in a later show. That's why I've left it as a half... Uh, not quite half done, more I, than half done. I do like the pattern you've got on there. Thanks. Do, yeah, it matches the bag. Yeah, and it's included. It's included. So, um, your deal today with your one day special, we've been busy this morning, 39 99 but you know what? We'll spread that cost over two months, making it even more affordable for you this month. Only £20, but we'll send everything out together. You've got £127.91 worth of projects within that deal. It's your Fabazine, it's number three, issue number three, and it's available on Flexibuy, it's 507-152. And if you are a Freedom member, there's no PMP to pay. Talking of Freedom membership, my word, everyone, go and check that out. Freedom membership has been reduced, making it even more affordable now to be part of the Hochanda family. And of course, it does mean that with your Freedom membership, you don't pay for any P&P. And if you buy anything off today's show, you will get your bear panel. And with your bear panel, you can embroider any colour you like. So yours might look like this, with beautiful gold and brown, or you might have red and black, you might have white, you might have pink. It's going to be entirely I've up to you, but you've got that lovely hexagonal pattern on there that you can start to embroider round. And there you go, that is your free gift. So you do need to make that, but it's going to be your free gift with any purchase today. Now, we've spoken about Fabazine issue number three. We've got a bundle with issues number one and two for you. Now, you can buy them individually if you want to, uh, but the bundle, the bundle, there's a new word, the bundle. The bundle is $39.99. We'll divide the cost of that into two as well. It's available on two flexi buys. So $39.99 is your first payment, and then $39.99 in a month's time. Um, and that gets you both of those issues and all of the projects worth over £240. That is incredible value for money. Uh, you've got the bunting there, that beautiful bunting as you can see there with the little Scotty dogs. How cute is that? Use them individually if you want it. It doesn't have to be bunting. Uh, they could be little key rings if you want. Um, it could be a doggy advent calendar. That's a good idea. It could be an applique. Um, to a dog lead or a dog collar or a dog bag, for example. Uh, so that's just one of the projects that you're getting included. A whole host of other projects as well that you can work on instantly as soon as you get to your magazine's home. Available individually or if you want to, go for that bundle. It's great value for money. Two payments of £39.99. We're getting busy for this. I think at the moment, Hayley, people want projects to do. They want inspiration. We've been at home now for quite some time. Some of us not being able to leave our home for a number of months now. So we're looking for that inspiration, aren't we? We're looking for some new projects to do. And there's lots you can do with these uh, Fabazines. Obviously, we're giving you the projects, we're giving you the starting point, but it also is teaching you different techniques because there's always like a different kind of seam in one of them and there's always a different kind of, you know, half a dozen different embroidery stitches and there's lots to kind of build up your, your knowledge as well as the actual projects themselves. I mean, you're, you're kind of learning and you're building up that knowledge, even if you would think about it as um, uh, kind of classes. 
Okay, so if you went to a class, which is still slowly getting kind of back online with things like that, yeah. um, you would kind of pay a certain amount to go to the class and then you'd have your materials on top. This is doing all of it in one and we can bring you, because we are the manufacturer and we're printing it ourselves, we can bring you that amazing saving as well by putting everything together because it's one twelfth of the time for us yes. to package it it's one twelfth of the materials because it's one box that it comes in it's one twelfth of the um the printing because it all comes in one magazine rather than us having to do 12 times over so it's much much more cost effective way for for us to put the the panels together and fabazine is always a little bit of a mixed bag you're gonna get lots of different projects and hopefully there'll be two or three in there that will just kind of inspire you and everything is kind of thought through so We've done um, all sorts of different things. We try to mix it up as much as we can. I like that because you're learning new techniques, but you're also making and creating lots yeah. of different things. Absolutely. So, for example, in uh, the Fabazine, you get to make, uh, I've got it written down here, you've got your applique rose pouch, you've got uh, your embroidered doodle, you've also got your cuddly hippo, you've seen that, your Scotty dog bunting, you've seen that, a pencil case, a feather notebook cover in there, you've got your owl cross stitch, your camper van, turned edge applique which is there your countryside landscape bag which you've got there there's your fantastic and i'll just drop that one in there because it makes a great cushion you're also getting your cat tessa patch cushion your land girl organizer and your bespoke buttons that's just in one oh my word and then if you're going for the bundle you're also getting in there your mug tidy organizer your beach applique panel your weaving loom which i've got just here so you get your weaving loom this is something uh, that you make and create just by simply putting your um not your threads it's more Do you of know your... what i've left we had some uh, beautiful weaving samples but i have uh, left them in the shed That's this all right. morning. uh you get your hedgehog pin cushion you've seen that your jelly bean lunch bag your quilted tile cushion your knots and crosses your forest sewing patch your embroider doodle your excuse me for reading this your flappy turtle your lotus storage box and your spiral cabbing foundation backing um can i just grab that floppy turtle look at that there you go <laughs> So that's your floppy turtle. So if you're going for the two magazines, number one and number two, my goodness, that's a lot of things to make and a lot of techniques as well. And what's lovely about it is that you're learning, you're learning, but you're also creating as well. So either refurnish your whole house <laughs> um, or you can give these away as gifts once you've made them. And I think that is a wonderful idea. So if you want to go for issue number one and number two, we're getting really busy. Two payments of $39.99 um, and then your PMP on top, unless you're a Freedom member, go and check out those Freedom deals. Now we do have a deal for you. It's a happy hour deal for this hour and this hour only. Here it is. 571169 is your item number. It's only $14.99. And this is going to allow you to store your bolts of fabric on the 23 MDF bolts that you get included. So that's designed to hold fat quarters on those little bolts. And there's actually a tray that goes on top of there as well. So you can get uh, 23 fat quarters in there and a little tray for your fabric on the uh, for your little kind of sewing bits and pieces on the top i love that and as crafters you can decorate that however you like um excellent that's your happy hour deal five seven one one six nine is your item number now we also have some seven day savers for you as well and here's the lovely yanis to tell you more What do you mean? What do you mean they can't see me? It's seven day savers, it's the fifth, but what? I've got to do the special click. Oh, Scott taught me this, and Yanis, ready? Three, two, one. Yes, here we are. Seven day savers is what we're looking at. Happy fifth birthday, Hachanda. This time it's a haberdashery bundle. 13 items in total for £13.99. 271594. You've got all your sorts in there from threads to bobbins to pins to needles to buttons to scissors and a tape as well. £13.99. Remember, with every purchase that you get, you will also receive that free gift as well. Oh, buttons galore. You can't go wrong. 271594 is your item number. That free gift, by the way, any live purchase 
All the terms and conditions are on the website. Right, how do I do this again? Click with the left, click with the right, jump up, jump down, let's give it a go. It kind of worked. It kind of worked. Um, hello, everyone. Good morning. Happy fifth birthday to Hochanda. We've got birthday celebrations all weekend and throughout the bank holiday. And we've got a superb deal for the one day special for you right now. Proving to be very busy this morning. You're waking up and seeing the projects and thinking, do you know what? This is something that's going to fill my weeks to come. You may do this in a week, two weeks. You might have a project every day that you want to make and create, but it gives you something to do. And you're saving £10 on the deal. You've got nearly £130 worth of projects to put and to make when you get your Fabazine issue number three home. Two payments of £20, 507152 is your item number and it's all about variety and it's all about learning as well. You've got tutorials and videos online but you also have your Fabazine with those excellent, excellent tutorials within and of course you're getting the panel for your project. So you don't necessarily have to go out and buy any fabric apart from if you're making your um, quilt if you want to do that but here's your panel with all the projects on you've got your cushion in there you've got your organizer you've got your pinny you've got your uh, mug hugs in there or your mug rugs you've also got your flowers and boris the duck yes boris the drinking duck um, right 507152 is your item number we're off to see Haley, the wonderful wizard of sewing next wow thanks yeah. for that because, 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 <laughs> because of the wonderful demos you do. We do, we do, okay. we do. So, I have just sewn an extra couple of these together so we can start to join them. Now, one of the things you need to be a bit careful of is making sure that you leave yourself um, an, a straight piece on this edge because that's going to then come off um, when you sew it together and that's what's going to create your really nice sharp point because on this one, I've been a bit giddy and I've gone a bit too far so I think I would go actually back and unpick that just up to there twist that back out a bit and then press it back but what we are going to do is join these together the same way as uh, Patty's done on her cushion because on her cushion she's got these kind of wave shapes but then you could if you've got more orange you can go back and have it coming back on itself and creating all sorts of wiggly patterns or coming this way you see and creating kind of all sorts of fun patterns so to join these together it is as simple as just folding them face to face and then stitching that straight line down the center well, not down the center down the edge like a normal seam don't put it down the center that would be ludicrous <laughs> and you're gonna just make sure that you've got all your seams kind of pressed out of the way and I'm just gonna Make sure that's flat before I come down here. And I'm wanting my seam that I'm putting down here to kind of match up with the seam that I've got at the bottom there. Just take that one off. And then, because we've got that extra little bit, that's what's making it go away to kind of absolute nothing on the bottom, which is creating those kind of perfect, perfect oh, curves. So it's a it's a much simpler way to create it. Now you do need a bit of space because obviously you need to kind of once you've got all of your bits, you need to have everything laid out and everything prepped to be able to to work this properly. So what I would advise is having it all laid out. Take a picture of what you're doing and where you're doing it from. Join all of your pieces together to make squares and then come back and start to stitch it together to make your whole design and at this point you know you can still move them around because I can go back to a normal kind of clamshell pattern there if I wanted to you can still move things around it could be completely random yeah. if you wanted it to it doesn't have to be shapes no it no. doesn't have to be shapes you could have complete complete randomness if you wanted to so I could put that one in there you can just create completely kind of yeah, go for it. Why and what's really nice, you can play with your colours as well and play yes. with the stash that you've got. And maybe even, I think, what would be nice with this, if you were to use different fabrics, if you're going for a random pattern, use different fabrics, like some felt maybe and then some cotton. Yeah, I mean, yes, in theory, you, you can quilt with felt things. Uh, that will only become a problem uh, when you're washing. 
yeah. and things like that. Because if you've got lots of different fabrics and different weights, then they can wash differently. I'm thinking more like wall art. Oh, because wall you can art, make a crack crack quilt, yeah, and then yeah, do some nice wall art. That would be, <laughs> yeah, a little bit of mixed media for her. I think that would be fabulous. And the great thing about having those templates is that you can then, as Hayley said, start to make and create some great patterns. Here's some patterns that the design team have put together. Um, nice circular design there, and I think the more you play with these, yes, the, the more, more you creative play, the more you will get with these ones. Yeah, and the more, like you say, the more you see, the more you sew. The more you see, the more you sew. Oh, there the you more go. you sew, the more you Are see. You creating catchphrases. I am, I am, I am, I am, I am, I am. Um, <laughs> right, let's pick those up. With your magazine, inside the magazine as well to help you. Of course, you've got your pictures in there you've got your text that's very very easy to follow but you've also got a qr code as well so if you've got a smart device then you can allow that let me <laughs> you just can't find, find one, one now can i know you? i can't find one now there's there loads you go. in there <laughs> uh, there you go uh, we're off to find the qr code do, 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 do. Um, they're there and then you can head online and you can watch a tutorial as well but you can also watch all the shows because Hayley you're going to try and get through all 12 projects i am i am um i think we've still got Seven. Does Still got seven? seven? No. Five. Seven. No, six. 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 Still six to do. projects to go. I don't know why That's I said that with lots of punchy, in but I'll give it a go. Okay. okay go uh, well, we've got, got two shows left. We've got then. another show Quick. at 12 o'clock <laughs> and another show at 4 o'clock. Um, if you have any special requests, do email in in between the shows. We'll get your request to Hayley. Uh, but if you do want to get your Fabazine, two payments of £20 is going to allow you to make and create all those wonderful projects, uh, 12 projects in total. And you've got your panel, which makes it £3.33 per project. Oh, my word. If you wanted to, you could make that into a doorstep. Three pounds, not that, all that into a doorstep. But I suppose you could do. I meant the duck. Um, if you want to make the apron into a doorstop, you can do. But there you go, there's the duck. Um, and that would be really nice. Three pounds and 33 pence for a doorstop. It's incredible value for money. Uh, but lots of different inspirational projects to put together. And it's going to teach you some new techniques. So you're going to learn some new ways of sewing and stitching and putting together the projects and maybe putting together a project that you didn't even know about before like for example the string art which was pretty cool and also your cushion as well cushion with a difference now we also have uh, another bundle for you and you can get issue three with frank and friends there you go there you go, £58.98, and that contains just shy of £150 worth of projects. So that's issue number three, and Frank and Friends bundle. So you've got this superb bag, I love this. Uh, you also have your scissor organiser, which is brilliant, and then you get your little purse, all with Frank, Frank being the main character right there, uh, and friends, and then you get your wadding in there, you get your zip, and you get your felt, and of course, you get your superb magazine with all of the details in there. 032376 is your item number. Um, hopefully, maybe, if enough people request it, we could play a video of Frank in the 12 o'clock show. I've got some new ones. I'll see if we can get some, some new, new ones. ones. We'll yeah. see what we can do for you. Uh, okay. But don't delay. Check out your baskets. Make sure you get what you want. Have a peruse on the website as well. That's where you can find all of the items. And just Hayley, busy thank cutting you. stuff out for the next one. Okay. Thank you, Hayley. Thank Always you. a pleasure. Never a sure <laughs> um, but stay where you are everyone because we've got more coming up and the wonderful world of her chanda yes we carry on the celebrations now with crafty devils mdf delights a birthday party with white gecko after that and then sentimentally yours birthday shenanigans weekend wow Hi, we're the team from Daisy B Stamps. My name's Nina. This is Josie. And this is my dad, Roy. And we design and manufacture our very own polymer stamps. So three years ago, we decided to embark on turning our own designs into polymer stamps. We're really excited about where this is going to take us in the future. 
and how we can evolve those designs and keep bringing you something that's just so, so different. So we wanted to add an extra element to our stamp collection and this was down to Josie using her iPad and hand drawing the amazing sentiments that we now have in our collection. All our designs complement each other so that you can use them again and again to create something new. So make sure you don't miss the Daisy V shows on Hachanda. Well, I've just got a few minutes to tell you about some of the new seven day savers. It's a Chanda's fifth birthday. Oh, I know. And this one is one not to be missed out on. £14.49 is what we're looking at for all six of the fat quarters that I've got in front of me. You've got white and you've got off-white as well. Uh, this is Ada, 16 count Ada, 100% cotton fat quarters. You get includes three of the white, as I said, and three of the off-white. Let me open one out so you can see what you can use them for. Beautiful, beautiful quality for £14.49, £23. Pounds is what you're saving with these as well. Also remember, anyone purchased during a live hour, you will also be established for that free gift. All the terms and conditions are currently on the website. Your item number again, 847 pounds £14.49. Now, where's that cake? Hmm. Hi, I'm John Lockwood from John Next Door. I'm lucky enough to have been a guest on Hachanda since day one. I like to pack my shows with lots of hints, tips and techniques and my idea is to give the experience that I've got and I've gained to everyone at home and show as many things as I possibly can. The John Next Door brand is designed to bring high quality innovative products to the crafting market. The range includes stamps, dyes and new products such as the media plates. I'm also looking to expand the brand and bring you lots of new techniques, new ideas and new products into the next few years. I hope you can join me on my crafting journey and learn some tips and techniques from me that I share with you. So don't forget to tune in and watch the John Next Door shows on Hachanda. Hi, I'm Nikki Hassan. I've been working with Heartfelt Creations for about nine years now. Heartfelt Creations as a company launched the company back in 1994. They have been in the industry for a very, very long time. They are crafters, so they know what you crafters want and they listen to us crafters too. Their products range from stamps that coordinate with dyes that then coordinate with a paper pad. But then we also have storage folders, we have decorative dies, we have colouring daubers, we have Insta albums. One of the products that really make Heartfelt unique are their flower shaping moulds, where you can make easy, quick, three-dimensional flowers, which are absolutely stunning. So I hope you can join Heartfelt Creations here on the Chanda. Very good morning to you. Yes, we're still celebrating our birthday, aren't we? It's the fifth birthday of Achanda here. Have you spent your credit yet? Maybe you have, maybe you haven't. If you haven't, you might be wanting to spend it in this hour. Let's have a look what we've got. Well, of course, it is Crafty Devils. That means Crafty Devils, we think of the wonderful Mel, don't we? And I'm pleased to say she is here in the studio. Good morning, Mel. How are you? Morning. I'm good, thank you. Are you wide awake? Just. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is actually the first of two shows you've got today, isn't it? Yeah, I'm back on at two. You are. We've got a different focus as well this afternoon. So uh, when we're looking at the products this morning as well, we've got happy hour prizes for you. So don't miss out on some bargains. Everything is on a happy hour price. We'll just have a look at the website there. You can see some great products. We've got all sorts. We've got MDF. We've got stamps. We've got papers. We've got, uh, oh, something I need actually, those magnets, those platform magnets. I still haven't found mine. We've got all sorts of different mediums for you as well. Some really good bargains we've had. Some great five-star review reviews I've just noticed there as well on the MDF for you. We've got grey board for you as well. All sorts of different shapes and sizes with bundles. Oh, the LED lights, always popular. Blackboard paint. Oh, I've not seen that with Crafty Devils before. Must have missed that one. Double-sided tape. Some more MDF, seven day savers for you there as well. Don't forget the freedom price has come down by a pound as well. If you're not a freedom member, well, we're thinking about that as well. Well, let's have a look at our first bundle now. What we've got here is for you, this is actually really, really good. You've got 12 of the blending smoothies, but not only that, you've got a box that you can create from MDF as well. So I've got one here. I think, Mel, you're going to demonstrate this, aren't I you, am, this morning? Yeah. So let's just open it. Of course, you can decorate the box however you wish. You can make it very ornate. You can keep it quite simple. But there you can see all your smoothies are going to pop inside. This is really nice, actually, because if you are keeping your, your smoothies for different colour inks as well, you're going to be able to see exactly where they are, which colour is which. You're not going to get mixed up. It's just a lovely way of storing them. I like that a lot. That's really a brand lovely. new product as well for is us. Is it? For the happy hour, yeah. Well, what a great price as well. Remember, saving £6. Don't forget, you are getting those 12 smoothies as well. You do get instructions, but I think very self-explanatory. But you do get the instructions as well. 19 99 is the price. If I was to break this down, the blending sponges on their own would be £12.99. So the box is just £7. And you've got the fun of uh, decorating that up, haven't you? That would make a lovely gift for someone as well if you wanted to do that. Now, we have got a bundle as well. So we're looking at the same thing. We're looking at the smoothie boxes here. Now, two of the boxes, you're not getting the smoothies in this one, but you are getting the boxes. £14.99 for two. Item number 582725. Nothing to stop you going for both of those, so you get the, the sponges, and then you'd have three boxes, wouldn't you? Let's have a look at the next item, though. We've got lots more for you. We've got some background stamps for you here. And these are a really good size as well. We've got A5 stamps for you. Let's have a look at the detail of these. These are, wow, ooh, crikey, look at that, £23 saving. I always say on these shows, look at the yellow box. That's the important one because that's the saving that you're making. All three of these for £9.97. They are background stamps, but you don't have to use them in their entirety. What does that work out at three pounds and thirty-two pence per stamp? Not only that, you get the little folders with them as well. So if you want to pop them into a file, you can do. So there's going to be a folder for each of the stamps there. Do save on those. Look at that. Great price, great product. Zero five four eight four three. Lovely. Wonderful. Now, we have got papers for you as well. Oh, you know I love my spots. We've got spots and we've got stripes for you as well. Let's have a look at these. Now, 120 sheets is what you're getting here. Eight by eight is the size. 160 GSM. Do you know I'm going to say multi-buy on this one. You're saving five pounds, just 9.99 for 120 sheets. Really lovely colours in here as well. Let me just pick this whole bundle up so you can see just some of the colours there. Aren't they pretty? Do you know, Mel, I love spots and I love stripes simply because they work with everything, don't they? They do, and I really love the colours in these because they're quite muted. They're not too bright, so they're, they and they all go with each other. They do, don't they? So are we getting 80 of this? Is this one bundle, then? We're getting 80 of each? 120. So that, that's not 80, is it? That's, 100, that's 60 each, isn't it? Choose it. Oh, you get to choose it from spotty or stripy. So it's 120 of the spots or 120 of the stripes. So if you want to go for both and multi-buy, you can get 120 of each. Uh, yes, great saving, £5 saving. Let me just show you the stripes there as well. There is a bonus gift as well, a gift with purchase for you, of course, because it's part of the birthday event. 
five tags, MDF tags, we'll show you those in a little while as well. Very your stripes, beautiful. Lovely to have eight by eights as well, really nice size to work with. Item number 439168 is the item number for your papers. Let's just have a look at that gift with purchase. There it is, so you're going to get those five MDF tags. It's one per customer. You can order anything on the show and you will get those included. Uh, so you don't have to add those on separately, they will be automatically sent out to you with your purchases, of course. Let's have a look at the next item. Oh, now what's so special about this? We've got 300 GSM as a weight. This is A3 and A4. This is your smooth stamping card. So you're looking at the A4 there. So what we're actually getting is 50 of the A3 sheets and 100 of the A4. So of course, A3 is double the size of your A4. But the fact that you've got different sizes there, Mel, it does allow you, if you want to cut into different sizes, you kind of can stretch it even further, can't you? Because you've got such a big size to you start can. with. And also, if you... Um don't want to just stamp on it the, the a3 is really good for making boxes it because is it's, it's that good weight. weight isn't it yeah. as well a3 as well if you're thinking about your albums and your journals that sort of thing and you want to go for the larger size it opens up more options but a4 is a great size and probably the most typical size that people will work with so 100 sheets of the a4 50 sheets of the a3 amazing value again saving five pounds and it is lovely and smooth as well 19 pounds and 99 pence 099622 now something that's busy i think everybody must be like me then losing your magnets for your your stamping platforms well we've got the magnets here for you a whole bunch of them in fact you've got 12 stamping platform magnets here they measure 1.8 centimeters each so you know they are worth having aren't they just to keep to one side i will give you a little bit of a tip though check all your dies to see if any magnets have got stuck to them because that's where i usually find them yeah if you've got any bracelets that are made of metal could they be there or Bottom of your tote bags, if they've got metal casters and things like that, who knows? Uh, do have a look for them. But, you know, well worth stocking up on those, and you are doing as well. Do make sure you save that £8, because that's what we're giving you here. Just £11.99 for 12 of those. So essentially a pound each, aren't they? Great value, £7.99, Then we have some glossy effects, and we're giving you two of these as well. So an awful lot to go at. Great for adding on to your, your decoupage, if you want to bring a little bit of gloss or shine. There's lots of uses for these, actually, isn't there, Mel? There this is. is a if, good if, you're, if you're stamping and you want to enhance the colour, yeah. once you've coloured them in, just a bit of glossy effects on the top just draws that colour out, makes it a bit shiny. It, it looks does, really doesn't nice. it? Lovely to pick out certain bits of detail, thinking about the seasonal time as well, maybe the berries on your holly, that sort of thing. It could be the eyes on a character or, or an animal. It could be whatever you want it to be. Just glossy leaves would look beautiful. Entirely up to you how you work with it, but you're going to get two of these, 82 millilitres each. So that's a, a lot for your money there again, because just £9.98, saving that £4, item number 121675. Now we've got some masking paper for you next. Now I'm going to ask Mel how we work with this because we've got a lot of it for you as well. 25 sheets, this is A5 in size. I do have a wonderful little sample at the side as well which has got one of those lights in that we've seen on the website. Look at that. Tell us how we work with this then Mel. So you can stamp onto it and um, cut it out and use it on your glass and then glitter and then peel it off and it leaves the shape underneath. Or you can, when you're stamping, if you want to layer up your stamps to make it look like someone stood in a puddle, something like that, you can use it for that. And also, if you want a certain shape, you can put it in your printer ah. and print onto it and oh, then cut handy. the shape out. Oh, that is handy. Oh, I've multibound this one as well. Saving five pounds, just nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Remember, you're getting twenty-five sheets of that. Item number one three three nine nine four. And if you do want those lights, check out the website as well because we have got those available as well, and they are always popular. Oh, this is one of my favourite things actually. I know it doesn't look much, but you know, this is such a good buy once again. You've got your double-sided tape. Now these are really nice because you've got two of them. One is 210 millimetres and you've got 10 metres of it and the other is 105 millimetres and you've got 20 metres of it. So one is kind of double the width of the other. Being 210 mil, that is the width of an A4, isn't it? That is, so you can cover a whole A4 sheet in it. Yeah. 
So you can do all sorts of different effects. Yeah. We can die cut through this as well. Definitely. Yeah. 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 Perfect. So those intricate dies that you get glue everywhere. Yes. Use that. Peels off. Lovely. And then you could glitter them or put your gilding yeah. flakes on. I adore double sided, especially when you get it in a roll like that. What a great buy this one is. £17 saving. Look at this price. Just twelve ninety eight for both of those. Do stock up on that. I think when it comes to Christmas as well and using lots of glitter and those beautiful dyes, uh, you know, it does much more than that as well. But this is now the time to be getting this. In total, wow, you're getting an awful lot because let's have a think about this. You're getting 30 metres in total. One is wider than the other, remember, as well. But 30 metres in total. If you break it down per meter, it makes it just 43 pence per meter. That really is good value. 925-792 is the item number. Now, we've got some more MDF for you. Don't forget, you get in your gift with purchase, which is five MDF tags. But you've got large tags here. Now, the gift with purchase are extra large. Yeah. So they're bigger than these, aren't yes. they? Yeah. So you're still going to get those if you go for this bundle. Yes. Which is going to give you two sizes. Well, these are your large and they're a great size so just think of the size of the extra large lovely aren't they now great for your bases for your mixed media art here you could use them for your parcels perhaps if you've got a big parcel to give who knows 9.99 is going to get you 20 of these well i'm just thinking will be somebody lucky enough to get to receive a car perhaps that will make a great gift tag for a car some people do don't they or maybe just it might be a children's car, one of those uh, battery-powered ones. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? £9.99 is the price for the tags. You're getting 20 of them. The size, as you can see, there is 100 millimetres by 200 millimetres, or if you want to convert it, 10 centimetres by 20 centimetres. 377789 is the item number. Then, Gesso. Now, these, I've used these, Mel. These are great. They really, really are. Look what you get in here. 500 millilitres of the black, 500 of the white as well. Both of those for £14.98. That is a fraction less than half price. So, you, you know, we use gesso all the time. It's not just for priming. You can use it for many other reasons as well. Item number 423665. That's the item number for those. Don't miss out on that bargain. Just amazing. Don't forget you're going to get those tags again with those as well. Now we've got something else to show you. We've got some more magnetic items for you, but these are clasps. Let's have a look at these. Saving seven pounds. You've got 25 of them. Oh, 25 pairs, in fact. So that is it 25 pairs then? So that's yes. 15 total. Yeah. Wow. All for 12.99. Saving seven pounds. Six seven seven four two five. We've got some Christmas stickers for you as well. Let's have a little look at those. There we are, lots of these as well, gold and silver. You're getting 30 packs in total, saving a whopping 29.26, just 9.99 for those. 175133. Now I did mention those LED lights. We have got those available. We'll bring up the details for those to save you having to look. Let's have a look at the strings first of all. There we are. Now these already come with their batteries as well. So you can see you've got six of those. Oh, we haven't got the details up yet, but they are on the website. We'll see if we can get them. £14.99. We are very busy on those, so uh, do keep looking at the website. Mel, you've got a demonstration for us. What are we going to see? I have. We've got the new smoothie um, box and um, because I love it. Because if anyone's like me, I like to be organised and I like everything in its place. So I don't want to go hunting. You, well, not for your smoothies, you don't. <laughs> you know, I'm a little bit bad at that. I've now got the deflecto to put mine in, but it's, they're still all kind of mixed up and all over the place in the different parts. I love the fact that you've got those little holes to sit them in so they sit neatly and the footprint that you, that's going to take up on your desk is going to be very very small isn't it exactly and if you don't decorate the top of your box you just stack them up of course yeah so um, but everything comes with instructions as normal mm -hmm. um, so you get nice um, instructions with it and everything comes so and it's easy to pop out I've just popped a load out as you see just while I'm chatting and they've just popped out straight away so I'm going to get rid of that piece okay. and any of your glue um, so a nice strong PVA will stick it together and um, as with all our MDF we try and make it so that it just slots nicely in place so you're not fiddling about too much with it 
Lovely. And they're laser cut as well, so precision cutting there. Yeah. Uh, nice finish on them. So. Lovely. You can see that fits beautifully. Just slots right in. And I would say when we're doing... Oh, that's how easy it slots in and it falls off. So when we're doing um, boxes, it's really good to glue and then just sellotape the corners yeah. so that your box doesn't fall inwards. Your, your lid's put an not elastic gonna... band around the whole thing once it's all together. Yeah, I would be a bit worried well. that it would go inwards a little bit if it's because it's tight, got to it slot on top yeah. um, of your um, bottom of your box, hasn't it? So you'll have to excuse me if I look a bit fit, f strange because I've um, forgot my glasses. <laughs> so <come> on. <laughs> oh, can, can we lend you a pair from anywhere? I don't think we have. I don't think you've got them in the studio at all, have you, Mel? Have you left no, them home? No, no. Well, I thought I'd put them in my car, but I haven't. Oh. So I don't know where they are. They're usually on top of my head. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah, I've just taped the corner just while the glue's drying. But it's so easy to put together. And it's a nice project to decorate awesome. because you've got that wonderful smooth surface of the MDF. It means you can decorate in any sort of design that you want. You can go grungy, you can go very pretty. You could put photos on the top of the boxes if you wanted to. You can do whatever you That's like. That's it. You can use all your mediums. And I would say if you're going to paint it, make sure you gesso it first. Um, just because it's like with everything, isn't it? All our expensive products, we don't want to use too much of it. Um, so if you gesso first, you're going to save on your expensive. Yeah, it gives a great base. Definitely. And don't forget the gesso. We've got the black and the white together, 500 millilitres of each. We are busy on that, actually. Look at this. It is a fraction under half price. You're saving £15. You can see the size of the pot, so with the 500 millilitre on the label there. Just a great buy, 423665. The black's really good if you're using dark colours. Yeah. Um, and your whites are, your white's just good for all your pale colours and your normal colours. So that, that's your lid done. Easy, easy. So we're going to, I'm just going to do, I've done the lid first because I want to let that dry a bit because I'm going to decorate that bit okay. for you. And you'll see there's some bits that are straight and you're thinking, what are they for? But I'll show you in a minute. Because they're you not. You do get the full instructions as well though, Mel. You do, you? yeah, yeah. They're really easy to follow as well. Um, that's that's if you know, because some women, your glasses on. yeah, and your glasses <laughs> on, and and like you know, some women don't do instructions, do they? They just look at it and think, oh, I could put that together. Oh, is, is that the women that don't do instructions? I, don't, I, I never do instructions. <laughs> <laughs> never. No, I'm we terrible. like to think we can work everything out for yeah. ourselves, don't we? We usually do. A good we job do. We at usually it, don't do. We? It's very yeah. True. So, I'm just gonna. Hold that there. There we go. Now, is it advisable to always put the parts together in its entirety before decorating? I would, because with MDF, if you decorate it first, if you're painting it, it tends to swell a little bit because it's quite absorbent. Yeah. Um, and then if you are papering, um, it's you're obviously making... Oh, fall into bits, look. Um, you're obviously making it thicker, so it might not slot together as easily. Do you, course, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Especially where those tabs are. Yeah. So I just want to put this together because I need to show you the inside. Yeah. So if you're um, if you're decorating with paper, if you're covering this bit, you're going to make it thicker to go into the join. Well, that's the thing. Although you you might think your paper's very thin. These are so precisely cut. That yeah, it it's like allow, it's mill. You, know, you, you yeah. know, it's it's that precise that you haven't got a gap there really to put anything else in it. And it's uh, you know you've, if you're trying to work around tabs and things and things are in pieces, it's much more difficult to uh, work to size. It is, and I, I quite like when, if you're using papers. Um, to decorate it after because it covers up the yeah. little joins. Of course it does. So this is why we use sellotape to stop it to keep the joins nice and secure and to stop it falling apart really. 
while your glue's drying. And the tape doesn't affect the MDF. So there's that bit. So this bit goes in here, but you don't want it flapped on the bottom because you want your smoothies to sit course, yeah. in there. So you'll see that there's these little pieces here. Now, some are for the over the top and some are for under the, underneath. But what I would say is do your ends first, don't do your sides. So your shortest ends, shortest ends first. And they just slip in there like that. Okay. Because then you'll cut out your circles. It's a bit like a egg storage, isn't it? <laughs> these, <laughs> these bits will sit on top of here. Do you know what I'm actually thinking now? With the double pack that doesn't come with the smoothies. I know we're a way off yet, we've got Christmas yet, but some of those little mini chocolate eggs might fit into here. Oh, oh great yes. way to gift. You know, if you want some to make chocolates. an Easter gift. Yeah, Easter, Christmas. Yes. Yeah. Oh, decorate the box personalize it oh no there's other things that would fit in there other chocolates isn't there do you know what i wonder if you put a bit of tissue around around a really luxury round chocolate that's in that foil that's I know silky smooth yes and if you put a little bit of tissue paper that would sit in there i bet there's a few things you could find to sit in there beautifully what a lovely gift box. Oh, that's the double. Go for the double. In fact, go for both if you can afford to. Go for the, the, the set that you can see on the screen with the smoothies because you're getting the 12 smoothies. They're worth $12.99 on their own. You do get one of the boxes with it. And then, as a second purchase, if you like that idea, go for this item number as well, 582725, because you're getting two more of the boxes. That takes up your purchase price to so over 25 pounds so if you've still got your five pound credit to spend you can spend that and have that taken off the total price as well so it's a win-win and you get those five tags as well don't you the extra large, large tax as well with the gift with purchase so then you can make your tag to go with your box as you gift it you really have got a really good um, oh you could couldn't you you could, you could even make your own eggs to go in there if you're very clever if you're really clever, I think I prefer the chocolate idea. Well, I'm not not chocolate ones. ones. <laughs> if I'm honest. Chocolate ones. I'm a bit ones, of a chocolate Marzipan. girl. But um, yeah, so that would be really good. So if you went for both items, you could gift one, have a smoothie storage, and then with your leftover chocolates, you could have one for yourself, couldn't you? You could, couldn't you? <laughs> oh, can you imagine a box of these chocolate eggs sat on your coffee table? Or in you your crash sure. room? Or in your craft room, yeah, but when your visitors come or your family come home and you've got them there and it's all nice and full. But what they don't know is you've got a huge bag of spare eggs and what you've been doing is really eating them and just replacing them as you go along. <laughs> so it just looks like you've got a whole new box every time. You could just have one in your craft room. Everyone would think it was smoothies, but you know there's chocolate in there. Yes. <laughs> Hide it from the kids. <laughs> So I've put my top pieces in as well. Okay. And you'll notice this creates like a little ridge. Oh, it just doesn't it? Which means the lid slots on perfectly. Ah, so you don't have the overhang of the so lid. So you don't have any overhang, so it's a nice flush and a nice tight finish. Yeah. So if they get knocked off or anything, your lid's not going to come off and your smoothies aren't going to roll everywhere. Perfect. Or your chocolates. You won't lose them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm obsessed about chocolates now. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cover the lid and I'm going to use our dotty papers. Oh, lovely. I love these papers. They are gorgeous. Now, you do get an awful lot of your paper. You've got a choice of spots or stripes, 120 sheets. So you can go for both if you like. Just put multiples of two in. You're saving five pounds per set here. So we can see the spots there, first of all. Five pounds saving, 9.99. So 120 sheets of those beautiful colours as well, as Mel said earlier. They're lovely colours, but they're quite muted as well, so not too bright, not too pastel, kind of in the middle there, which works with so many different other colours and papers as well. Uh, 439168 is the item number. The stripes are just as beautiful as the spots, so do take advantage once again of the saving. So I worked out that one sheet will cover your lid. Just the one sheet? Just one sheet will cover your lid. If, as long as you're careful. So 120 sheets for 9 99 so that would be 12 pence per sheet then. 
Yeah, that's, I mean, that's good for nice quality paper. Yeah, that really is. Eight by eight, and you've still got the leftovers as well, which would come in for decorating other bits of MDF. We've got other MDF bundles available as well. If you've been on the website, you've probably spotted a lot of those. Great, great papers for covering your tags and your... Um... There we go. Plaques. So you, yep. I'm just a little bit worried about you're not having your glasses there, Mel. You all right? I know, yeah, no, I've got my fingers are out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> just while Mel's cutting that, she's almost ready to go, but we have got a bumper pack of MDF as well that we've not shown you yet. It's very busy, so we'll just let you see this. 20 plaques with five different designs. You've got door hangers in there. You've got round tags in there. There's 30 of those. You've got 50. 15 door hangers and you've got three different uh, designs there so five of each of those I think there you've got the plaques in there as well of different shapes you've got hearts in there as well you see one or two samples dotted around what an amazing buy that is 19.99 you have found these but for anyone that hasn't 15 pounds saving 921271 what a great buy that is that's a really good buy so you see I'm not I'm not measuring anything I'm using my MDF to oh so when you said one sheet of paper covers the lid that includes the sides of it yeah yeah so, so and you're I'm not just... really seeing any ways whatsoever there no are you? no so, and I'm using so I'm not having to measure anything because my MDF is so good I'm not having to measure anything I'm just cutting so you're using that as a guide. Yeah. I, ha I, d I really Just don't like measuring. the blade along the edge of the MDF because it's nice and straight. Of course, because it's laser cut, it's cut to perfection. No sort of uh, fluffy edges on there at all that needs sanding. And it's it's all um, done in down in Devon as well. So it's all made in the UK. Lovely. So no importing, which I love. Now we are very busy and I know a lot of you have already been to the website, you've been visiting there. If you're ringing up the customer services, of course, if there's any wait time, we will get to you. Um, we'll just keep you posted. There, if there was any significant wait time, we'd let you know about that. But the quickest and easiest way to shop is the website. I know we're busy across the board. Certain items, as always, are busier than others. I know we've got some star buys on here today. In fact, we've got a whole counter full because these are happy hour prices. There are more different deals for you at 2 o'clock as well. Mel's back, so a different focus, but just the same thing. It's just amazing prices right across the board. Um, a little bit of an update, actually, on the smoothies and the box that Mel's working with. A third of the stock has gone on those. That's for the smoothies and the box that you can see on the screen. And almost a third of the double pack of the two boxes has also gone. I think you're all liking that chocolate <laughs> idea now. It's lovely, though, isn't it, Mel? Because you can decorate the boxes in so many different ways. Really make them personal to people if you know who you're gifting to. It's just or so Or if you just versatile. want to keep for yourself, then exactly. you, know, you can make it to match your home decor. Yeah, which You've is what i would do yeah you've yes, got the fun of doing that haven't you that's so it it's it's not only a very useful item but you've got the creative creativity side of it as well mel is that all you've got left so that's what's From a left whole sheet of eight by eight that's it just and that's covered my whole lid do you know and if you've got somebody with the name tommy you can personalize the lid <laughs> with what's left over there <laughs> you can, you can. <laughs> And you've still got a tiny little strip spare. You have, yeah. You, snip yeah. That away. you could just let you know, put an angle on it. <laughs> <laughs> There's always a way of using every single scrap. So, on my base, what I've done is I've used our um, lovely structure paste. Ah, oh, perfect. Um, which I've, I think you've got on the website somewhere. Lovely, do have a look for that. So, I'm going to get my smoothie don't they look amazing the little smoothies sat in their box they're great aren't they and then i've used my smoothie with my ink pad there we are. now if you want extra smoothies then you can go for those as well you can see they are 12.99 for 12 so if you are going for the extra boxes and you want those extra smoothies as well 
then uh, of course you can do that. And as Mel said, if you don't want to decorate the top of the box, unless it's just with flat paper, you can stack these together if you've got limited space and in your craft room. That is looking really, really that nice. I really love how the ink's nice. picking up in between. Yeah, that's what I really like. This would um, look lovely in my front room, just on my table with the chocolate, with chocolate. in. <laughs> <laughs> I like, but, and because the lid's so secure, my puppy wouldn't be able to get into it either. That's true, yes. He'd probably smell them, but he wouldn't be able to get into them. Oh, we've been chatting about your pup, haven't we? Oh, I know. I don't like leaving him, but he's at home with Mark. Oh, in fact, I think they've gone into work this morning to do okay. some laser cutting. Oh, so that's going to be fun. How old is the pup again? He's seven months now. Ooh, Can you believe? Um, we got him at the, a week before lockdown. So we've been going to puppy training classes, which is interesting. <laughs> <laughs> but he is, he's getting, he's adorable. I love oh, him. And what breed is he again? He's a cockapoo. Oh. But we started lockdown with no dogs. And now there's three in the family. <laughs> so I, I managed to get Bentley the week before lockdown. And then um, about a month ago, my youngest daughter um, got a cockapoo. It's called Bailey, and then this week, or last week, my eldest daughter got a sprocker called Luna. Oh. So now we're a family of three dogs. Oh, <laughs> that is going to be so much fun. At Christmas, I don't oh, know who's going to get the, the turkey, us or the, the dogs. Boxes, yeah. Oh dear me. <laughs> so I've gone into my craft stash okay. um, to decorate the box. So what I would do, when, once my glue is dry, I would get a file and I would just file the edges of my paper. Okay, to give that a lovely perfect finish. So my glue's not quite dry, so it's lifting a little bit. But it just gives this lovely kind of smooth edge, yeah. but a little bit tatty as well. So I don't I don't like everything perfect. Although some people say I do. <laughs> so, and then I've gone into my craft stash and I've also used our lovely. Oh, what have you got there? This is our glitter, glittery effects. Oh, I can see the sparkle from here. So, now you're loving the box with the smoothies. In fact, half of the stock has now gone of that one. I just want to make my leaf. Have ah, a bit so of sparkle. So, having a, a winter leaf. It certainly feels like winter today. Well, I drove up in all that rain yesterday oh, and that definitely felt like winter. So, I'm looking forward to a bit of sunshine. Will it come back here in the UK? It may, you know. Oh, I'm it leaving may, to get you mine. Never know. You never know. You see, I'm one of those that keeps looking ahead at the 14-day weather forecast. It's not looking great for the next week, I've got to admit. Um, this is where I live, by the way. No, I, don't, I don't look at everybody's <laughs> weather forecast, but I do look where I live. I, I've seen... Yes, let us, let us know. I'd love to be a weather girl. Let me know what the weather's like where you are for the next 14 days. Are you going to see the sunshine come back? Now, where I live in North Lincolnshire... We're looking at maybe a warmer weekend next weekend. Right. I hope, fingers crossed. Now we've had an email coming from Kim. Is it about the weather? <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, oh, now Kim has been saying, you know, you've been talking about the stamp platform magnets. Her die cutting machine wasn't working for ages. Oh, and the no. reason was there was a magnet stuck in it. <gasps> No damage to the machine, but she turned it upside down and it fell out. So if anybody finds that their die-cutting machine stops working, just check there's no magnet got in there. Do you know that would be easily done? Because as I said earlier, sometimes if you've had dies like they stick to the dies because the dies are metal, then you put the die through the machine, then the roller picks up the magnet. That's how it ends up in the machine. Oh, I'm so pleased, Kim, that you didn't uh, cause any damage. But <laughs> yes, well worth checking. Perhaps yours has gone in the machine and it won't come out and you need some more. We're busy on the magnets, actually, You're getting 12 of them, 12 of them there. 1.8 centimetres each, that's the diameter. Uh, well worth getting these, almost half the stock gone, just 11 99 for these. You're saving £8, 799 249 
sometimes we get these platforms and you do get two or three magnets but it's quite nice to have one or two more as well if you've got a bigger piece of card and you want to hold it down as well it's not just about losing those magnets is it no that's it and a little handy tip because they are so strong yeah is to get some low tack tape and just wrap around them so yeah, it's so easy to little, lift off the little levers on them so yeah so nice and easy to lift yeah. off so I'm oh, just going to... Washi tape's a good thing to wrap around. That's it. Apparently, yesterday, Phil Martin was saying you need four magnets. What? Four? Four on your platforms. Yeah, sometimes you only get two. Yeah. So it's worth getting an extra set so you've got some more. So I've just gone into my craft stash, which we all have, to get some little bits of decoration to decorate a box. That's a pretty blue, that spotty paper. It's just one of the colours. How many different colours have we got? There's at least six that I can see. Actually, I'm just counting up. Uh, oh, there's more than six. That there is. There's grab these. 12 coordinating colours. That's what you get. I'm going to see if I can pick you up one of each. One, two, three. So, and then I'm just going to get some little buttons. Oh, no, I'm going to have another one of those. Do you know what? I'm counting these here. Twelve individual pieces. And our wonderful floor managers just pointed out that we actually have some boards. <laughs> that makes it so much easier. So I'm going to show you these, actually. Just as Mel's just finishing off there. So there's your spotty ones. And that is the most popular option. But if you want to go for the stripes, I've got a board for that as well. There we are. There's your stripes. So it's the same colours, isn't it, Mel? It's just a different design. That's it, yeah, it? spots and stripes. And they go well together as well. They, they certainly do. And at that price, for 9 99 you're getting 120 sheets, remember, 8x8, 160 GSM, which is a great way to have. 439168 is the item number. I'm just putting some... Right, just as you're finishing buttons. off there, Mel, just yeah. finishing off gluing on your bits and pieces there, which is looking amazing. Let's have a bit of a recap as well, because a reminder about the big bundle we've got here at the side. Uh, the MDF that we've got, this is a huge bundle actually, 20 plaques is what you're getting in there. Five different designs, so there's four of each. You're getting 30 of the round tags, which are a really nice size to work with. There we are, oops. And you're also getting 15 door hangers as well. Um, in fact, there's three different designs there as well. And you, do those, does that just happen to fall in there? Or do you actually get a pop-out bit from that hanger? Those are the discs. Those are the discs that have yeah. come from these? Yeah. Ah, that's clever. I like the fact that the, the um, circles have got holes in them as well. So even though they're popping out of there, you've already got those, those holes in there. So you're ready to string them up if you want to. If you want to hide the holes, you can with the paper. What a great buy that is, and you are loving it. £19.99 is the price. £15 saving. 921271. Now, the smoothies, we've got those on their own. Let's just give you a reminder of those. Perhaps you've gone for the double set of the boxes, and you want to go for the smoothies as well. So you can buy these in your multiples if you want to do. £4.00 saving on these just 12.99 for 12 latex blending sponges 294541 the bundle with the box so getting 12 of the smoothies with one of the boxes a great buy on this one look at this 19.99 so it just means your box is seven pounds because you remember 12.99 for the smoothies on their own 362779 is the item number and then if you want to go for the bundle with the boxes but without the sponges, you can get two boxes, all the components to make them for £14.99, saving £3.582725. Now, almost two-thirds of the bundle that's got the smoothies and the one box is now gone, so we're very, very busy on those. We have got another show later. It is a different focus, but everything will remain on the website as long as we've got the stocks, of course. Let's have a reminder of one or two other things as well, because another one that's been popular has been this one. This is just ridiculous as a price. Look at the saving, £23 saving. You are getting three different A5 stamp sets here. These are clusters backgrounds, but of course you don't have 
have to use them in their entirety. I particularly like the one with the sewing elements on there as well because you can soon break that down, just use areas of that very easily. Uh, £3.32 per stamp set. That's what you're paying with this happy hour price. You also get the little little pages as well, the little sleeves, so you can put these into a file and keep them nice. 054843 is the item number and almost two-thirds of the stock has gone on that particular item as well. The papers, I'm going to remember to bring my boards with me just to show you again. So the papers, we've got spots and we've got stripes. Now you've got a choice under one item number. You can go for both, but it would be multiples, of course, of two then, unless you wanted more than one of each, and then you can go for whatever you want as long as it's in multiples. 9.99 is going to get you 120 sheets. These are 160 GSM. They're all eight by eight. You've got 12 different colours, as you can see there. Really lovely. I like the fact that the size of the spot is as it is as well, because you sometimes see larger spots, you see smaller ones, but they're kind of in the middle, so they work perfectly. And there's your stripes as well. Great papers to layer with all sorts of different other papers and colours as well. Uh, I can tell you the spotty one is the one that's in the lead. Item number 439168 if you want to go for those. Now, when it comes to the stamping card, of course it's not just for stamping. It says smooth card, it's stamping card, but you can use this for your construction as well. 300 GSM, you are getting 100 sheets of the A4, so of course this is the A4. You're also getting 50 sheets of A3, so that's double the size of the A4. So that means that if you want to cut your irregular sizes out, you know, not your standard sizes, you could do. Maybe you want to do special folds on your cards, and of course you're going to get them out of the larger sheets as well. So it's nice to have the option of those larger sheets included in a bundle. There is the price for you, £5 saving, 19.99 on those, 099622. Then we've got the magnets. Now, these are approaching 60% of the stock gone. See, I, oh, these are just wonderful, aren't they? 12 magnets. They are very strong. I've just tried pulling these apart. They are really, really strong. It is best to slide them. Uh, you have got a little spacer in between these, actually, as they arrive with you. If I just show you what I mean, they are really, really strong. I'm just going to sit those there in case they suddenly jump at me as they're trying to attach together again. So you can see you've got that little spacer in between. Uh, do take uh, Mel's tip there and <laughs> see how they just pull it together there. And do, uh, of course, put some washi tape or some low tack tape around those. So you've got those little levers to pull them up with. It makes it a lot easier. 799249 is the item number. Now, glossy, the glossy... Um, effects that we've got here really good buy again on this one i know you've been finding this one and popping into your baskets as well 82 milliliters in each bottle you're getting both of them almost 40 percent of the stock has gone so use this wherever you want that shiny effect whether you're stamping whether it's on decoupage paper however you want to use it do it works on things like your clays as well one two one six seven five is the item number just 9.98 for both of those now, another really lovely item, actually, is the masking paper. So this is uh, really handy in size as well. A5 sheets you get in here. They are sticky, so you can stamp on these. You can use them for masking off when you're stamping, but also you could use them to cut shapes as well. Stick them on something like your glass bottles and your jars and then cover with glitter because, of course, one side, uh, this side is adhesive there, so you can decorate it. I'm just going to turn this bottle on again, just to remind you about those lights as well. Although I haven't got them here on the counter, you can find them on the website. But when it comes to the masking paper, almost half of the stock, stock has now gone. Oh, doesn't that look pretty? The lights we're looking at at the moment are the cork top ones. I think we've got two different versions on the website. There's the cork tops, so they work perfectly in your bottles because the light area where the control bit is, is the cork that goes into the top of the box, but it leaves free the little switch to turn on and off. Now you get three multicolored and three warm white there in that bundle. Again, great for any time of year, but think about making your projects for Christmas again. They're gonna look great as home decor pieces. We have actually got for you the LED light strings. I know these have been busy as well. Look at these, again, it's the same. Three warm white, three multicolor. You do get your batteries. These are, how, how long are these? Two meters each two meters each you get 20 leds on each one and they can be shaped because they're wire aren't they so they're malleable 
these are a really, really good buy. So you can really sort of twist these around your projects, whether it's uh, jars, wreaths, whatever you want it to be. Half price saving, 102898. Then the double-sided tape for you, another really good buy. You've got this roll here, which is 21 centimetres in width, or 210 millimetres. You've got 10 metres of that. And then this one here, you've got 105 millimetres and 20 metres on there. So in total, you've got 30 metres. We did break this down earlier. So if you do it that way, so we're breaking it down per metre, it works out at just 43 pence per metre. Because it's double-sided as well, you can stick that onto your card so you can die cut it then peel away the other side and put your glitters your gilding flakes on there been busy on that limited stock don't miss out 17 pounds saving 12 pounds and 98 pence is the price 925792 now your tags don't forget there's a gift with purchase for everybody as well you'll get five mdf extra large tags we do also have a bundle of the large tags and these are a great size so just imagine the size of your free gift now there's 20 of these. You're still going to get your gift with purchase if you go for these. 9.99 for 20 at this size. 10 pounds saving here. 3.77789. Now I can tell you the size of the gift with purchase actually. 28 centimeters by 14 centimeters. They're huge. Huge, and you get five of them. Everybody's going to get those when they're purchasing, as long as we've got the stocks, of course. 377789 for that bundle, though, on the large ones. And then finally, we do, of course, have the gesso for you. Uh, if you want to go for the gesso, you're getting an awful lot for your money here. 500 millilitres in black, also in white as well, so that gives you a litre in total. You can't get much better than that, can you? 14.98 is the price. You're saving 15 pounds. A lot of the stock has gone on this one as well. Half of it is in fact gone. 423665 is the item number. Now, a little bit of an update on something else that we haven't got on the counter, but we have got on the website, the magnetic clasps. These have been very busy as well. You've actually got 25 pairs of these, so 50 individual ones, but you need them as pairs, don't you? If you want to use them for your album making. So these are a great buy again. £12.99, £7 saving, 677425 also something else not on the counter but on the website we've got this one we've got the hexagons for you this is your art board bundle again half price saving these are happy hour prices remember 14.99 you're getting a whole bundle of those 499.974 different sizes included in that bundle as well and then we've also got for you that uh, blackboard paint as well. Been busy for this one. Oh, I love doing blackboards. We don't. We ought to do more of them, didn't we? It's lovely to be able to write your notes and scribble them out and have, you know, have them in your children's rooms and all sorts. Your kitchen, every room of the house should have a blackboard. That's what I think. Six pounds saving on this. Nine ninety nine is the price. Zero one six four six zero. We get five hundred milliliters in that as well. So a huge bottle. You could do a whole wall. Then we've got tape for you as well, double-sided tape, 300 metres in total. You're getting six 12 millimetre width tape there and six of the six. Is that six of the six millimetre and then would it be six of the nine? I can't work that out. It's just how it looks on the screen there, 6.9 millimetre. Right, okay, I didn't know it came in a 69 millimeter, but there you go. Uh, nine pounds and 88 pence, 10 pounds saving, 872421. Do you know what? If you break that down per meter, it works out at about three pence per meter. That's ridiculous, isn't it? Do stock up on that while you've got the opportunity. Mel, about five minutes left. Okay, so what I've done is, because um, sometimes um, you can't get the right stamp or you want to say something that you can't get a stamp for so I've printed off a sentiment on my computer okay. onto paper because a lot of printers don't take card yeah. and then I've used my extra wide to cover the back of the paper Lovely. and then I'm and then I'm going to peel it off and put it onto our 300 GSM Lovely. I can just let everybody know that the extra wide Double-sided tape is actually sold out now. <gasps> well done if you got it though. This is another use that yeah. you can use it for. It's not one that was mentioned earlier. No, so, and then I'm just going to trim it, trim it down. Sometimes you want something a little bit bigger than your stamp sets, don't you? So, um, and a lot of computers don't take that is card. That is so true. 
It is hard to find a computer, especially that will take something like a 300 GSM. Yeah, I don't. My my printer at work won't even take it. Oh, come here. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, I it's on that Nearly. One. <laughs> and then, and then I'm just going to use my smoothie, ink my edge. Lovely. And then. I want to give it a little bit of dimension, so I'm just going to use a little bit of foam tape. Okay. Stick on the back. But this could say anything, couldn't it? It could be, I just I had a thought, wouldn't it be lovely to do a box, and we're, we're going back to um, chocolates again, <laughs> but um, Mother's Day. It would, yeah. It'd be lovely to put a nice sentiment in there, some nice words. We're actually limited stock for the blending smoothies with the MDF box, so that's exactly what um, Mel has created for us there. You can see the lid of the box. Of course, Mel did show us earlier how to decorate the base of the box as well, how to put the insert in. We have got a couple of samples to show you as so well. That will be your Just finished. beautiful. Really lovely. Finished one. And just create... So your papers don't have to go over the whole thing. Yeah. Use different mediums that look good together. So this, I think, looks... Um, do you used to get, like, um, anaglypta wallpaper? It does look like it that, does look like it? that doesn't yeah, it? it does. So, and there's, like, a famous company that do beautiful wallpapers. Yes. And I think it looks a bit like that. So that wouldn't look out of place with mum or dad. Definitely not. Something with some sweets in or something on a coffee table as well. So lots of different things that you can use it Definitely. for it's not just your smoothies but great for your smoothies well, everybody's obviously loving them mel because we we have sold an awful lot of the stock we are at limited stock with that one don't forget we've got the double set as well if you just want to go for the the set that's got two boxes in but the smoothies aren't included you can get the smoothies separately as well so lots of options for you as well thank you mel that's a lovely thank lovely you. demonstration now, something else that's limited stock are the stamps that are right in front of me as well. I'm not surprised on these. £3.32 it works out at. Remember, you've got happy hour prices here. £23 saving, 054843. Another limited stock, so you need to be quick, are those magnets. So the platform magnets. You've, these have been busy throughout. 11.99 is the price. Eight pounds saving. You need to be quick on those and check your baskets out. 799249 is the item number. Now we've very little time left, Mel. But is there anything very quickly that you want to show us before um, we go? I can show you very quickly if I've got it to hand. Have I got it? Have I got it? <gasps> what have you lost? My little handbag. I've got those clasps that I oh. could show you. Oh, the little time. magnetic clasps. Yes. They've been busy this hour as well, even though we've not seen them. But on the to counter. attach them, just use your red double sided. Okay. So the difference between the red and the white is your red is extra strong. Yeah. Um, so this tape is brilliant for a heavy duty card, making your boxes, um, glitter card. Um, mirrored board but brilliant to put on the back of these um, because they're so strong you don't want to use a wet glue no so you want to use the of course extra strong double-sided if you haven't spotted that yet we've got the details on the screen you've got 12 of the high performance double-sided tapes you've got the 12 millimeter and you've got the nine millimeter you get five meters of each there uh, what a great buy six each of those rolls lovely but a minute left Mel so you've got the clasps there and it's just yeah. a case of just sticking those down with that high performance tape. Yeah, then. they are so strong. I'm just going to show you how strong they are because I have to count these. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> they're, just, they're just great, aren't they? But great if you're making um, handbags, yeah. um, gift boxes, yeah. anything like that. And just, if I can find the end. Great to have 25 on. pairs in there, so that's 50 individual pieces to make those pairs, of course. Really good buy, £7 saving, twelve ninety nine six seven seven four two five. Do you know, it's a pity, Mel, you don't live a little bit closer, because you could, could have gone home to get your glasses. Cause I, I, I could have. Struggle a little bit. We'll see if we can help you out with that. I don't know if we can. Uh, but, do you know, Mel is back at 2 o'clock. We won't let her go home. She's got to stay until 2, and we will help her out if we can, of course. Uh, but we've had a very, very busy show. Different focuses this afternoon 
do keep shopping ahead on the website, of course. Have a look at everything that's available. Mel, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, I'm not with you at two, so have a lovely hour later on today. Thank you. I'm sure it's going to be just as busy because amazing products. But we've got much more coming up. I know Janice is over the other side of the studio now. We've got a great show coming up. We'll be giving you the menu very, very soon. Yes, actually, it's birthday party with White Gecko that's coming up next. Looking forward to that. Then Phil's here, sentimentally yours, birthday shenanigans weekend. Wow. And then I'm not even going to try and say it because I couldn't say it last time, but we've got the Fabazine one day special later. Flexi order has arrived at her chanda. What is Flexi order? When you place an item on Flexi Buy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi order which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments, so you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping baskets, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly FlexiBuy payments, offering you the extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with Achanda easier. Hi, I'm Jean, and together with my partner Malcolm, we run a small business in the northeast of England called Crafty Individuals. At Crafty Individuals, we're mostly involved in the design and manufacture of a very wide range of red rubber art stamps, but we also have a range of background papers and mini images that are also brilliant to create with. We also have a great little team of other artist friends who've helped us along the way and have come up with other designs that completely work alongside our own. So do pull up a pew and join us on the Hachanda shows. We can't wait to see you there. Seven days, save us. It's the set. Oh! Fancy meeting you again. We've got another chance to look at our seven day savers. This time we've got the Oakwood A4 Christmas card, 270 GSM, but what are you getting? You are getting 40 of the white, you are getting 20 of the beautiful Christmas red, and you're also getting 20 of the green as well. That's 80 sheets in total for £16.99. That works out to be 21 pence per sheet. I know, for all of this card. Remember, it's 270 GSM. Remember, if you buy anything throughout the live hours as well, you'll be included for that free gift. Yes, a free gift. All the terms and conditions are on the website. Check them out. 65915 is your item number. £16.99. You're saving £7. Right then, get me to the cake. Here I come. Hi, I'm Anna and I'm a fan of Craftbox UK. Craftbox is a box full of craft supplies that we send to our customers monthly. All products are placed in a beautiful, sturdy box, which is ribbon tied, and we hope that by receiving this box, you will feel like it's Christmas every month. Make sure you don't miss the craft box shows on Hochanda. Hello, I'm Barbara. And I'm Julie. And together we're Scarlet Rose Crafts. We're a family run business, been in business for two years, and our aim is to bring new and innovative new products to the crafting industry. We've both been involved in crafting industry for many years and we're continuing to move forward with our new company now. The Easy Mat Plate is our flagship product, uh, followed by our innovative Easy Shim product. Our range includes diamond trail plates, ultra-sized dies, cards and sticky sheets. We're constantly developing new and unusual products, so watch this space. On our shows, we hope to inspire you with our products so that you can carry on crafting, because our motto is, because we can. 
so don't miss the Scarlet Rose Craft Shows on Achanda. Very good morning to you. If you have just joined us, we are celebrating Hochanda's fifth birthday and we are celebrating in style. I've got Sarah from White Gecko with us today. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning. We were just talking about donuts, weren't we? Oh, we were. What's your favourite donut? A custard donut. Custard donut. My favourite, raspberry jam donut. But I, I think I'd like to try a custard donut. I like the ones with the chocolate on the top and the custard in the middle. Oh, you see, you had me at custard and then you've got the <laughs> chocolate on the top. What's your favourite cake? Oh, we all want donuts now. Um, but we're talking fabric, we're talking beautiful creations with White Gecko. And we are talking about a great party that we're going to have in the show as well. But if you've not met Sarah before, let's just have a quick word, shall we, Sarah? Uh, can you tell us a little bit about yourself and White Gecko? Um, there's three of us in White Gecko. There's Sean, Sarah, and then me, Sarah. So uh, you'll know me as Sarah Jane. Yes. Because uh, it gets confusing otherwise. Um, we have a little shop in Dennis Powys. Um, it's our fifth birthday, the end of October. Is it really? Yep. What a so, coincidence. So we're doing um, all sorts of things. Uh, COVID has actually um, helped us develop a lot further field. Yes, taking you in a, in a different direction, but the right totally. direction. Yes. Okay, fantastic. Well, it's lovely to have you here and happy fifth birthday for October uh, and happy fifth birthday to Hochanda. Now, because we are in the midst of our birthday event, there's going to be a free gift with your purchase that you make throughout the hour. And that free gift is a Liberty Fat Quarter and your fabrics will vary so you might get this particular one you might get another one but the main thing is it's Liberty so it's a Liberty Fat Quarter and that's going to be your free gift for purchasing throughout the hour but let's talk about something that we've already been very very busy for and that is your Moda scrap bag only 14 pounds and 99 pence you get 21 strips they are two and a half inches by 30 inches contents may vary um, but you're only getting one of these unless you want to buy two you're more than welcome to do so it'll be 14.99 each but we've got a lovely example here of a bag it's when we're using these scraps from the bag would it make a whole bag like this Sarah? yes it made uh, there were scraps left over Really? Yeah, there were strips left over from that. You could probably get almost two out of it. Because that's a sizable bag, mm. isn't it? It really is. And why do we love Moda fabric, Sarah? They're just really nice to sew with. They're good quality. There's a strength to them. Um, and when you, they just stay smooth when you're sewing them. These are beautiful and soft, oh, aren't they? Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. And just taking you through the different fabrics that you get here they will vary but this is giving you a really nice idea of the different patterns that you're getting in here and they'll tone very very well together uh mode of fabrics of course were they the first to bring out uh scrap bundles like uh, this particular one like a scrap pack and i think so i don't think anybody else does it yeah a lot of companies have stopped doing pre-cuts but uh mode are going to continue yeah which we love we, we, everybody loves a pre-cut. We certainly do. These are absolutely beautiful. Um, the price, $14.99, that is superb value for money, isn't it, it is, Sarah? yes. I mean, you get, uh, they could be anything between two and a half inches up to, I think it's three. Um, but I got it written down. I got it written down. That's all I right. I don't know where that's gone. Um, so, yeah, you can get, uh, they vary in sizes. Yeah. Um, it just depends. Some of them are two and a half with no salvage. Some yes. of them have a salvage. Right. 
Wow, well, 70% of the stock has gone. These are going very, very quickly. Uh, we knew they would, and that's why we wanted to start here on the show, because they were going already. People found them on the website. Uh, remember, when you're buying that, you're getting your free fat quarter from Liberty as a gift from White Gecko, uh, as part of celebrating five years at Hochanda. Well, five years with Hochanda. Uh, or with limited stock, it's gone so quickly. Five double seven three seven eight, and it's technically sold out. Right, you need to secure that by checking out your baskets. I'm going to move this basket out of the way because we're going to move on to our next item in the show. Something tells me we're going to have a very busy show, Sarah. Good, good we're to be like We're going to have a that. very busy show. William Morris, what are you doing to us this morning? Everybody likes a William Morris. Oh, these are gorgeous. Right, let's talk about the table runner that we've got. Is this difficult to put together? Um, it looks difficult, but it really isn't. You're um, sewing them in strips, and then it's the way you cut them. Um, the template is in the um, in, in the, the pattern. pattern. Yeah, we've got that right here. So you've got your template in there, and all the instructions to go with that. I mean, that is absolutely stunning. To have that on your dining table, or to have this maybe on a side table, just adds that extra detail that I think people will be really impressed with. They, I mean, it really does look difficult, and people look at it and think you've cut all those little squares out, but it's the way you cut it. Yeah. The sewing is simple. Uh, so you might learn a whole new technique, and then, of course, you can continue with that technique if you've got other pieces of fabric. Yes. Uh, but nothing does it quite as well as your William Morris uh, fabrics. Now, let me just pick up the jelly roll for you here. Am I allowed yes. to... Oh, thank you. You know, sometimes I'm not allowed, <laughs> and I'm just like, oh, let me get into it. Go for it. Uh, brilliant. Well, first of all, look at that. Now, that's something that you can use, which is great. So let's pop that yeah, People to like side. to do salvage quilts, so you could put that ribbon in with your salvage quilt. Yeah, you certainly could. Now, let me just open this up, and if I can... Is it 48 or 52 strips that 42. we're getting in? 42. 42. Let me lay that there and I'll go through, I'll, I'll half lift that up uh, and we'll go through the different patterns that we've got on here. So there it, we go. It's included in the Strawberry Thief? Strawberry Thief, yes that's right. And that was based on uh, William Morris's Mother's Garden. Yeah. Yes, he looked out the window, the kitchen window, and he used to see the thrush that used to come down and eat the strawberries. And that's what the story is about that particular piece of fabric. So half the stock has already gone. There's that strawberry thief. Look at that. Beak open wide, ready to put those strawberries in and then fly off or try and fly off because it might be a little bit heavy with those strawberries. Beautiful quality fabric. Though. Oh, it's it's moda. You, you can't get, um, you can't go wrong with it. What a great combination. Moda fabric, William Morris designs as well, which I think is, is very desirable and can be very expensive if yes. you were to buy the full pieces of fabric. So here's your chance to get a taster, but also to create a wonderful table runner where you're going to learn some new techniques to put it together. If I am a beginner, would this be something that I would start with? Could I do this easily following the instructions? Uh, yes. Yes, you could. Uh, I would probably say it's, it's uh, an advanced beginner. Perfect, perfect. Well, that's good because even if you are beginning your journey into soft crafts, this could be a project that you buy at this great price to have so that when you feel confident, you can start putting that together. I mean, this is absolutely stunning. £35.99, pence. nearly 60% of the stock has gone. Do you know, Sarah, I could, just, I could stand here all day and just flick through these fabrics because not only do they feel lovely, but they look fantastic, don't they? They do. They certainly do. The nice thing about a pre-cut, any of the pre-cuts, is you get a selection of, or you get all of the fabrics that are in that collection. Yes, that's right. Yeah, Whereas that's true. shops like ours, little shops, you can only have a selection of a collection. Yes. So the nice thing is you get to see and play with all of it. That's a really good point. That is a really good point and quite a good catchphrase as well. A selection of a collection. <laughs> but you get the whole selection of the collection when you purchase this today. So let me lay that back down there. Not very well, but oh, even just putting it, do you know something? This has gone to limited stock, but even just putting that 
onto the counter. It's just so soft at the way it just sits. Oh, beautiful. Right, limited stock, everyone, 846914. I'm hoping I might be able to come back to this because I just like touching it and stroking it, which sounds so wrong for this time in the morning. Um, but it's gone, it's sold out. Right, and don't forget, you are getting your Liberty Fat Quarter um, and a free, free gift with that. And the free pattern as well. Yes, perfect. Right, my goodness, well, that's two sellouts, Sarah. Right, let's move on. Let's move on. Um, right, your layer cake. Oh, see, it's all cakes, isn't it? Oh, yeah. All cakes and donuts, that's what we're talking this morning. Uh, right, so what are we getting in this particular kit? Uh, that one is Regency Romance. Now, let's have a look at the fabrics as I go through these. You get 42 10-inch squares in here. And if I go to this one here, we'll flick through them so you can see. I know they're on the counter, but hopefully you'll be able to see these beautiful patterns. Again, gorgeous and soft and some lovely patterns on here. Some nice ditzy patterns as well. The quilt behind you is made from that one. Um, and you get that pattern with it. Oh, I like that. Is there a pattern with it? Look, look, that is beautiful. That is gorgeous, isn't it, with that blue? Very traditional. Uh, yes, the quilt behind me has been made with these fabrics, so you can see the selection of fabrics. If I just stand to the side here, um, how beautiful this is. Isn't that gorgeous? And something, again, easy to make? Yes, yeah, it is. It, I mean, the thing with quilting, is half the time it looks more ex more elaborate than it is one, once you've broken it down yeah and you're just doing one piece it's how you put it together that makes quilting yeah it certainly does and you've got the pattern you've got the instructions going to be easy for you to follow as well and like sarah says you know when you break it down into the individual pieces it's going to make it easy because you'll do one then you'll do the other and then it becomes second nature and then when you place it all together um, however you want with the fabrics it could look totally different to the one oh, we've yeah. got here yeah you um, don't have to do that pattern yeah um, but I do I just think that's marvelous and it really does show off if you off. sew them together yeah just as the squares you get a 60 by 80 quilt do you just sewing the squares together and they they still look really good yeah that that would that would be amazing and what a great quilt to make if you are a beginner if you just do the squares if i show you this if you just put the squares together and sew them like that that's a good beginner's quilt really oh, yes. isn't it yes uh, but wow what a way to begin with the moda regency romance layer cake patterns a quarter of the stock has gone i think we had a carpet like this once I think we did. I think my mum paid for it month by month, bless her, for a very long time. But it was a gorgeous carpet. Always remember that. Uh, 631866, if you do want that, uh, please don't delay in your decision because we're having a very busy show and lots of items are selling out already. But of course, make the choice in your own time. But just don't spend too much time. Uh, right, 631866 is your item number. Right, we've got a bag for you now, which of course you've already found on the website. It's a great kit as well that you're getting here. Uh, so it's the full kit and caboodle. And this is with your Benetex fabric. Now, some of you may know Benetex um, and the quality that you're getting. And this one, is this the Dragonfly? Yes, Benetex. Benetex, yes. Dragonfly Dance. Love that. Uh, and again, I think it's the blues in this that I love so much. Yeah, I love it. It's just so vibrant. It certainly is. You can see the dragonfly wings in the gold and the flex that just make it absolutely stunning. So let's talk about the kit, Sarah, and let's talk about what we're getting. So we've established we get the fabric, which is fantastic, but what else do we get in the kit to complete the bag? Uh, you get your interfacing, your webbing, all your hardware, um, the calico for you to uh, piece your dragonfly onto in the front, Yes. Um, and your lining fabric and your outer fabric. You get everything. Wow. You can go home and just make the kit with what you've got. But there's also a um, second option where you can just buy the pattern and the hardware. Yes. So that you could make it anyway. Oh, yeah. Let me grab that. Oh, so I'll that one these. is made from an old pair of jeans. 
Oh my goodness. Now, if you've got your own fabric or if you've got some clothes that you're recycling at the moment, um, I think this will be absolutely fantastic. So if you want to go for the pattern and the hardware only, just £12.99, pence. then you add your own fabrics. What a great idea using an old pair of jeans. Look at that. You've got the pocket on the back as well. Look, we know what pair of jeans they are. Perfect. Love that. And then there's another um, design. Let me just show you here as well. This could give you some inspiration. Yeah, once you've used the hardware that comes with the kit, you yeah. can use uh, buy other bag hardware yeah. to go with it. And because you've got the pattern, uh, which is a great idea. So if you do want the pattern and the um, hardware details at the bottom of the screen, but the full kit that includes... You get the dragonflies if you go with the full kit. Yeah, you certainly do. Well, do you know what? We're limited stock. Ooh. Limited stock. These are literally flying out the door. 098276 is your item number. Right, so we're going to go to demonstration. So we're going to head down the yellow brick road down to Sarah for our first demonstration. Hi, we're going to show you how to put a catch in. Um, it's something that makes me nervous each time I do it, so I thought I'd show you how to do it. Um, I do need to tell you, Sarah, that the, the, the bag has sold out. The pattern oh, no. and the bag. It's with the fabric, but we still have the pattern and the hardware for people to buy. So you can still get the pattern to create the book, okay. uh, to create the bag that Sarah's going to put together now. Cool. Thank you very much. Um, right, you get the hardware in there, so you'll get your catch. So we're going to, you measure, fold your, fold your uh, um, bag flap in half and mark it then you're going to measure two inches up okay if you use the ruler the right way round so two inches up and you're going to take your outer piece which is the bit with the prongs on it and you're going to put it in the middle at your two inch mark so you're going to actually put the top of your um your outside lock lock piece and then you're going to mark inside it now you were saying sarah uh, when we had a meeting today that this is the part that lots of people find quite difficult to do yes it's always knowing how much to cut and um you're cutting into something that you've already made yes and people don't like that true right we're going to all the pattern and the hardware is limited stock on immediate dispatch. So if you want to get this expediently, pop it into your basket, check on out, make sure you've got it, 1299-853-467. That's on immediate dispatch, which may mean we might be able to get some more on extended. Right, it's technically sold out on um, immediate dispatch. We're going to have a, have a word and see what we can do, but we'll continue with the demonstration in the meantime. Sorry okay. about that, Sarah. We're That's just so right. busy this morning. So on your, um, where you've marked, you're just going to cut along. I used a stitch ripper um, to go through, and I'm just going to cut on my mark. I'm glad I brought these scissors. They're nice and sharp. So you're just going to go round. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to pop that in and check. Now you can see that even though we've marked it, yeah. you could still cut a little bit more. Okay. So you would just keep snipping away until, okay. you, and, until it's gone, um, until you can't see it. But you don't want to do too much. Now you m need to make sure that you mark inside, inside, not outside. Yeah, okay. Um, I think I've got some good news. I think I've got some, uh, we have got some good news. Right, extended delivery for the crossbody bag pattern and the hardware that you get here. It's going to be dispatched on the 7th of September. It's about a week, it's not too long to wait. I can't believe I'm saying that, that we're almost in September. But it's a great deal because look at all the hardware you're getting. Imagine going out and finding that yourselves. You're getting it within that deal. And of course, you've got the pattern then to make more bags if you want. 12 853 467. You will still get, of course, your free gift when you're buying this, your fat quarter of uh, Liberty. 
fabric, which I'm thinking you might be able to use mm -hmm. for the bag. Yep. That would, how lovely would that be? Especially you should be able to do it as an inside. There might be enough to make it. Oh, yeah, fat quarter to do the inside. Now, that's a good idea. You can imagine that. Having that as your secret inside your bag and then when you open I it I like to have a plain outside. Yes. And a bright inside. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Definitely. Um, so, bag on extended delivery. That's for the pattern and the hardware. Sorry about that, Sarah. That's all right. So, once you've got your hole to the size that you want it, you're just going to pop the, the little prongs through. Yep. Take your back piece. Oh, so you don't have to stitch it? No. Nope. Overlock it? No, nope. there's no stitching or anything. You're just going to manoeuvre it so that all your bag is on the inside. Like that. And then you pull your prongs to the side. And there you have it. How easy was that? Oh my word. So and we don't need to be worried. No. Look no. how easy so that was. So that's the front bit. Okay. There is a back bit. Okay. <laughs> I'm just thinking this is such a great deal to be able to get the hardware and the pattern because you're getting the free gift of the Liberty fabric, my word, you've got fabric to start with. It's a fat quarter of fabric. So again, being the inside of the bag, maybe you want to put it onto the outside of the bag. Um, the fabrics will vary. You may get this one, you may get another one, but the point is it's Liberty. So you could use that salvage somewhere if you want to. Uh, on your bag, 853-467 is your item number, 12 pounds and 99 pence. Brand new today, you lucky people getting that Liberty fabric and the pattern and the hardware dispatched on the 7th of December, uh, December September. <gasps> I'm jumping ahead of myself there. December. Sarah. Oh, Christmas is on the way. It's so, how many days till Christmas? September, October, November, December, three, six, 12. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot. I don't <laughs> want to scare you at home. Four months. It's more than less than half a year. Less than half ha a year. Less than half a year. Yeah. That's about the maths that I can <laughs> I can manage. Right, for you, for you've done your outside, you've put it all together. You're going to take your flap and you're going to put it right sides together with the back. Yep. They're both the same, so it won't matter. And then you're going to... You can't pin it. I think you would... Um, You could put a stitch, baste it on. I'm just going to do that. And then you're going to fold it over. That could be a little bit straighter. And then you're going to mark through your flap. Again, like that. I do need to tell everyone the pattern and the hardware. It's gone limited. We won't be able oh. to get any more. So here's your chance to get it into your basket. Remember, you're getting your Liberty fabric as well that's a fat quarter for you so it's a great deal limited stock though sorry i keep interrupting that's you, Sarah. okay so you're going to mark through your um the hole that you've made in the in the flap you're just going to put this is the scary bit i normally rip it right up um you're going to mark it and sorry i keep moving my that's okay you're going to just put a little hole in there on either side of that mark that you've made and then you're going to prod that through like that now I would put a bit of um, interfacing that yeah. you've got left over on there just for um, to make it stronger and then you're just going to fold in okay you fold the front out Look at that. My God. So we've go. not stitched, we've not glued. No. All we've done is marked and cut. Yes. And then pushed that through. That is fantastic. We've sold out. We've oh. sold out. Uh, wow, congratulations, Sarah. Thank Sold you. out twice. That's really cool. Right, I think we need to have a little regroup. Um, if anyone's got the donuts, can they bring them in? In the meantime, we've got our Yanis to tell you about a seven day saver.
Well, indeed, it's Achanda's fifth birthday, and have we got some seven-day savers for you. This is just one of them. Though I've got a few seconds uh, to tell you why we're here. We are talking about organza fabric, 29 centimetres by 25 metres. Now, you can take a pick and mix of any two of the colours that I've got in front of me. We've got things like the red, the deep Christmas red. You've got the emerald green. We've got the gold in there. You've got the rose gold as well. You've got the white and the silver as well. You're saving £7 on these, the price. £17.99 for any two of 25 metres in length. 426152 is your item number. And any purchase during the live hour, you will also receive a free gift as well. Terms and conditions are all on the website. Don't miss out on another cracking little birthday present. Now, which one shall I have? Which one do you want? That's the question. And that wasn't Yanis. It was Adam. I do know the difference. It's taken me a while, but I do know the difference. Uh, right. How about getting up in the morning or getting home after you've been out for a walk and then popping on your slippers and relax? or maybe making some slippers for somebody and relaxing now with these slippers you've got that grip on the bottom which is really really handy especially if you've got laminated floors or you've got wooden floors for example you don't want to be going slipping around so these are a beautiful kit that you can get you can make you can have them for yourself or you can make them as a gift and you can also change the size to boot as well, uh, to coin a phrase. Now, we have got a great price for you at 12 99 and we've got some options. So, you've got your red batik, uh, and that is a beautiful red with that beautiful batik fabric. Uh, you get everything you need, including the pattern to put these together. So, they look fabulous. You might want those. They could match your colour scheme. Already half the stock of those have gone already. People have been shopping ahead. Then you've got your kingfisher. Love this. Have you seen the dragonflies that are in the inside? Isn't that gorgeous? How cute is that? Uh, very busy for these as well. Half the stock has gone. And then we've got, oh, I think this might sell out first, the cats. We've got the cats, you can see there. It's a really nice colour. I like that colour. Uh, so you've got your little pussy cats there. You've got your ginger tom. And your Irene. say again? Loose and Irene. Loose Lewis. Oh Lewis and Irene. And Irene. Are they your cats? No, that's the name of the fabric. That's the name of the fabric. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Not the However, name of the that's cats. a good name for cats. I think it is. Lewis mm. and, and Irene. Irene. <laughs> Irene the cat. <laughs> oh dear, that's hilarious. Uh, why Lewis and Irene? Why do we like that fabric? Lewis and Irene, again, they, they come out with some beautiful fabrics. I mean, we just love the small pets yes. stuff. Um, they, um, they used to do pre-cuts, but I think we've gone away from that. Um, they are, you get your bumbleberries, is um, the stuff inside. There's a bumbleberries, that's a Lewis and Irene as well. Oh, um, and they, it just goes with everything. I really like the design. Now, uh, half the stock of your cats has now gone. Half the stock of the cats has now gone. And then the floral, oh, these are gorgeous. A quarter of the stock of the floral has gone. We're not even seeing these. A quarter of the stock That's has the gone. That's the Regency Romance, which is the same as the layer cake, the Ooh, quilt. Oh, yeah. Now, imagine your slippers and your quilt matching. Perfect. I love the grip that's underneath as well. That's the stuff that you would put under a carpet or oh, uh, under like your machine to stop it moving. Yes. Yeah. Now, actually, let me pop... If we could just head down the yellow brick road, just to there. Um, so, yeah, walking down the yellow brick. But you'll see, I'm, I'm really pushing on that, and that is not moving anywhere. That is a good grip. It's an excellent grip, and it's something that you want as well, because lots of people have laminated floor now, yes. or wooden floors, yes. or maybe if you're in the bathroom, for example. Um, so you can see just how good that is. Now, the limited, the, sorry, the Kingfisher, limited stock, Limited stock on the Kingfisher, everyone. So if you do want to get the Kingfisher... Oh, they've gone. They've trotted off. Oh, the cats have just gone limited. 
So pop those into your baskets. Um, they're going so fast, I can hear them going meow as they <laughs> get into people's baskets. Uh, four, nine, uh, sorry, 458988 is your item number. Very, very busy. And remember, everyone, you are getting your free Liberty Fat Quarter as well. Uh, your Fat Quarter will vary. It might be this one, it might be another one. The point is, it's Liberty. Uh, 458988 is your item number. So very busy for those. We've got, oh, can we get to the animal panel? Yes. Oh, I, lo I love this animal panel, Sarah. It's beautiful. It really is. Uh, oh, are we going to Gordon the Gonk? Oh, let's go, Gordon. Let's go to Gordon the Gonk. Gordon the Gonk. Let's go to Gordon the Gonk. Who remembers gonks? I love a good gonk. Oh, yes. <laughs> Seriously, you can't beat a good gonk. No, I, I have to agree with you. Was and it with a custard donut as well. I oh, mean, you know, you, a custard you, donut and a, and a gonk, gonk, gonk at your side. Oh, yes. Um, was it a 70s thing or an 80s thing when gonks were really... I think it was more in the sort of like 80s, wasn't it? Yes, it would have been. Mm. Yeah. Um, and they were very, very popular. I remember them in school. Yes. So could have been the 70s, mind. Yeah, it could have been. Mm. Could have been. Uh, 171663. What are we getting in this kit then, Sarah? Um, you are going to get your... Um, your motor grunge, yes. which is uh, makes the cushion itself. Yes. So, um, and the spray time, which goes around the outside, and all the bits to make your gonk. You get some um, a piece of calico. Yes. And your wadding. Yes. And your bond web. Perfect. So everything you everything need. Everything except the cushion. Everything except the cushion. I've got the cushion in my hand. Um, so all you need to do, if you've got an old cushion at home and you want to fill it, size of the cushion? About 18 inches. About 18 inches, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Um, and it is an envelope back as well, which is perfect. Very, very easy to put together. Oh, I like, is that a decorative stitch across there? It is, there? yes. I like that. It's like a faux zip. Yes. Very good. Like that. Um, beautiful design. And there he is, Gordon the Gonk. Gordon the Christmas Gonk. My brother's called Gordon. That fits very, very well. But he doesn't have a beard like that. Not yet, anyway. Uh, 171663 is your item number. It's a fantastic deal. It really is. And, of course, you've got the pattern. And if you want to make Gordon the Gonk again out of your own fabrics, then you can do so. Then you can do so. So let me leave Gordon there. Now let's get on to the animal panels. I'll tell you what, I'll leave Gordon there, just having a snooze. Uh, right, now, the animal panels. I'm going to lift this up. We do have... Uh, an animal panel quilt hanging up um, but I just want to show you this now let me just open this up because you've got four animals on here have I got that the right way no hang about shall I lay it over the front for you so we've got the owl you've got the bear you've got the deer and you've got the fox now these are these are very Nordic looking aren't they they are yes mm. um, yeah absolutely beautiful and if you want to use these separately you can make a bag? Uh, uh, yes, or cushions. Um, well, it's, you could just put it on the back of a top yes. if that's what you wanted. Yeah, that would be a good idea. Um, I would love the quilt. I love what you've done here with all the quilting as well over the animals. Just placing the animals side by side. You could, you could have the bear and the deer together if you want. You don't have to go in that particular combination. Or you could make a bag at Christmas time to make a bag like this um, or, or to make a quilt like that for Christmas uh, would be lovely. You could have a table runner if you want to. If you've got a large table at home, for example, um, that would be a really nice table runner. Beautiful as cushions. You don't have to have them that size because you've got a little bit of headroom at the top and bottom of the deer. So you could make the cushions a little bit smaller, but I think it's a nice size for a cushion. Uh, you've got the owl there with the little rosy cheeks and the little berries. They've all got rosy cheeks, actually. Gorgeous. Have an owl and a pussycat. Oh, you would. That <laughs> is so true. An owl and a pussycat. But no going to see. Not at the moment. 40% uh, of the stock has gone. Um, I've got a really nice bag here, actually, that's been made out of the animal panel. Um, and this, again, is a great idea at Christmas time because it's a gift in a gift. So you can put your gifts inside and then you've got the gift of the bag uh, rather than having the gift of the gap. Uh, you've got the bear. 
and then you've got the bear on that side so if you're buying two panels for example which you're more than welcome to do so the 13.99 each you could have a bear on each side if you go for two panels if you're just going for the one panel you get one bear one fox one deer and one owl all in the same complete panel and if you wanted to make a really really easy quilt this would be the way to do it because you just simply add your um, framework around there and just quilt away and add your wadding that would be a very very easy quilt to make for a beginner 211663 is your item number absolutely adore those and I love the design of them as well right let's talk about cake again because of course it is our birthday but let's talk about fabric layered cake you can't eat this uh, but half the stock has gone so you are finding this very very delicious indeed beautiful mode of fabric soft brilliant patterns in here absolutely stunning and beautiful lovely ditzy floral patterns and all toning in together so well you also get the pattern as well to make the quilt it's a very very easy quilt to put together we've got one behind me uh, which really does show off all the fabric if I just get out of the way um, it really does show off the tones of the fabric and how easy this is to put together block by block step by step probably one of the most easiest quilts you've ever made and if you're new to quilt making what a way to start what a way to start 37 pounds and 99 pence 631866 is your item number and remember with that you are also getting your free gift for the hour and that's the liberty fabric fat quarter uh, 631866 busy 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 we've had lots of sellouts pop this into your basket so this doesn't sell out before you check out right so we're looking at some seven day savers and here's the thing is it Yanis is it Adam who knows <laughs> Well, I've just got a few minutes to tell you about some of the new seven day savers. It's a Chanda's fifth birthday. Oh, I know. And this one is one not to be missed out on. £14.49 is what we're looking at for all six of the fat quarters that I've got in front of me. You've got white and you've got off-white as well. Uh, this is Ada, 16 count Ada, 100% cotton fat quarters. You get includes three of the white, as I said, and three of the off-white. Let me open one out so you can see what you can use them for. Beautiful, beautiful quality for £14.49, £23. Pounds is what you're saving with these as well. Also remember, anyone purchased during a live hour, you will also be established for that free gift. All the terms and conditions are currently on the website. Your item number again, 847111, pounds £14.49. Now, where's that cake? Hmm... Yeah, it's all with us. It's all with us and we're going to eat it all up. Right, I've got some news for you. We've got some more sellouts as far as the slippers are concerned. All options, bar the floral, have sold out. So your Kingfisher, your cats, and the beautiful batiks, they can go over to one side because they have sold out. But what we do have are the floral, oh my goodness, <laughs> we, are, we are, let's say this, extremely limited extremely limited stock 12 pounds and 99 pence for the florals you've got that great uh, uh non-slip underneath as well good tread yeah because look at that on there i'm pushing there these are fantastic you do need that if you're on tiles or on wooden floors so 12.99 the next sorry go on I came up with those because a lot of our ladies who come to class they sew with the shoe off so they're walking around with one shoe and a, a, a sock. So I thought if I made those, they could put their slippers on when they came to class. Oh, that's a lovely idea. Well, they're so comfortable. They really are. And I think it really does personify slippers because you just slip them on and they're comfortable to wear. Twelve ninety nine. 99 uh, We're in trouble of selling out of these as well. 458 Nine double eight is your item number. You could be the last person to pop these in your basket if you do that right now. Uh, right, let's head back to Sarah. We've got another demonstration. What we're going to have a look at now, Sarah? Gordon. Gordon the gonk. I love Gordon. Right. Okay. So I've. Uh, you start from the beginning. 
You've got your template. Yes. So on your on your bond web, you would trace out all your pieces. So you would trace out your body, which goes around there, and then your beard, and you would follow the uh, dotted lines because that's going to go underneath your piece. Okay. 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 So I have st I have already ironed a few on, but I thought I'd show you how to take uh, the bond web off. So if you score it with a pin like that and get your pin underneath it comes out a lot better than if you're picking at it with your nail on the side there Got you go you. that's that's as easy as that and then you're just going to place them where you um where you want them so i think we'll put his hat at a joint jaunty angle now i've got a little bit of uh, fluff to go under his nose just to give him a bit of a a raised nose so I've put a bit of bond web on the back of that one as well okay and we've got a fluffy bit for that right he's so cute isn't he he is I like him um, he's just lovely so we're gonna do that and then you just take your iron and you're going to make sure that you iron it in the place that you want it now, if anyone collects gonks, why don't you send a picture in of a gonk? Um, studio at hochanda.com, because I know people used to collect gonks and have huge collections as well. So if you do have any gonks knocking around, uh, why don't you email a picture to studio at hochanda.com. Get them out the loft, get them out the drawers. Let's see your gonks this morning. Right, Sarah? Right. So I've ironed all that on like that. Now I'm going to show you about the beard. Okay. Now the first one that I did, um, that one, we did it and I did the thread exactly the same colour and it doesn't really stand out. So I've put shading in. Oh, but yes. you could use a darker, darker thread. I thought he just drank a cup of coffee. <laughs> and got it on his beard. <laughs> One of the things that I found that I needed to do when I was doing it was if you use a Frixon pen and just trace around the beardy bit. What's a Frixon pen? Frixon pen is one that you um, iron off. It's uh, an erasable pen. Like an erasable pen. pen. Yes. Oh, okay. Sorry. Um, so I would just use my erasable pen and draw around it so that you can see it Ah, when you're sewing that is a great because idea because otherwise when you've actually sewing it and looking at it you can't see your lines so, so there we go so you've got to find your um blanket stitch yes okay so with mine should have put it on 33 there we go i'm just thinking sarah because you get the pattern to make gordon you could make Gordon quite Father Christmassy. Yes. Towards Christmas, if you wanted to make yes, another. Yes, use a white beard. Santa the gonk. Yeah. That would be hilarious. You could have a little sack or presents around the bottom. Yeah, that would be lovely. One of the things that you can do with uh, uh, the blanket stitch, what I would do is I would put the fabric through, a, a spare piece of fabric through, and watch where your machine because each machine does the uh, blanket stitch in a different way. Does it? So watch how it's like a five-step thing. Ah, okay. good point. Good tip. So we're going to go... This is where you forget what the buttons on your machine do. <laughs> Instead of a blanket, come out with a zigzag stitch. Yes. I mean, you, you don't need to use a blanket stitch. I've used a blanket stitch. You could use zigzag. Yeah, because you know, some machines only only do straight and zigzag. Yes, you could do uh, free motion, and free motion all his beard in. Yes, um, you could thread paint. That's something I'd like yeah. to try. Where you you literally drag the thread drag through the thread paint. through. No, um, you paint with your machine. Oh, so you draw the pictures with the machine. Oh, I've never I, seen that. Something that I'd like to try. Yeah. So. So you just. I don't know whether they can see that yet. Yeah, we can see that. So you're just going to follow your line all the way round. 
Now, with Gordon that you've got there, I did it by hand. I used the thread that matched the fabric I was using, and then I just did long and short stitches. That's really good. I've got that here. Can we show that? Just the darker stitching. Sarah did that by hand. That's like sketching with your stitching, isn't it? It is, yes. That is, that is very effective. I like that. So when you get down to the point, there is a point to this. Um, <laughs> very good. Lift your foot, turn, turn your fabric, do one stitch into there and then turn it again. Don't drag the fabric. You need to um, turn it rather than drag it. Getting a bit cocky now. Nothing wrong with being confident in the morning. Okay, we're going to stop there so that you can see. So by using, sorry, <laughs> by using the darker thread, now I would probably take it down a colour. You can see it's going to um, give, it that give you that definition. I like so that. you would just, I mean, you could use one colour, you could use a black and do all of them. So you would do, um, pick up like a red to go along here. Yeah. And around his hat, pink, and just stitch him in. Uh, which will hold it down and um, give just, it definition. I'm just thinking, do you know what else you could do? You know, if you've got some, um, some like, wool or some thick yarn, mm -hmm. you could actually put little strands yes. of his beard on there. I mean, once, once you've got the initial thing, yeah. you can add anything to yeah. it. Oh, it's fantastic, isn't it? It really is. Nineteen ninety-nine, and you get the full kit and the pattern, so you can make more if you want to. Um, all you need is the stuffing for the cushion uh, to make your Gordon the Gonk very, very um, huggable. So, Gordon the Christmas Gonk, you get the uh, applique cushion kit, fabrics, bonder web, and wadding. Nineteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. I don't know what the next thing after and was. Bonder web, wadding, and fabrics and fabrics fabrics yeah of course you do yeah there you go fabrics oh no fabrics bonder web wadding and pattern there you go i knew it was in there somewhere uh 171663 is your item number if you want to pop that into your basket but as with everything on the show we are extremely busy now the animal panel oh the animal panel sold out the animal panels it's like a, the animal panel sold out. Ch -ch. The and animal a, panel sold out. Ch -ch. And have a busy week next week, can't <laughs> we? <laughs> you certainly are. You certainly are. Uh, right, okay. Next, we're going to go for the Sophie bag. Um, oh, sorry, I'm back, up, I'm back up the yellow brick road. Let me just go back up to the yellow brick road, to the Sophie bag. You've not yet seen this, but already busy for it. So can we talk about what people are getting in this particular kit? And I'll open this up to show people how we use it. Right, you get your wadding with it um, and your strapping. Yes. Um, yeah, the bit strapping. Yes. Um, and the wadding, you, you just sew straight onto the wadding. You choose your own fabrics. Now, um, a scrap pack or a jelly roll is perfect for this. You need a, like a fat quarter and a jelly roll. And um, then, and it's all, all done for you. And you just literally sew straight onto the wadding. Yeah. And it's sew by numbers. So you would uh, find your, the, the cutting instructions yes. are brilliant. They come in in the pack. Now, they're always hidden within the wadding. Right, A lot okay. of people say, I have got any instructions, but open it right up. Yep. And there uh, should be instructions in there. Yep. Um, you start with number one. Okay. It'll have told you how to cut it out. So you put number one down, 
This is actually the wadding for uh, one of the other bags because I forgot to bring the ah, Sophie bag. Okay. So it won't look like it this. It won't look like this, everyone. This is just an example of what your Sophie bag wadding will look like. But this is your Sophie bag. Yes. This is what you'll be making. Uh, that's why when I was looking at the triangles, I was yes. just trying to acquaint them. But you will have the panels on there. Um, on your the wadding. Sophie bag is a good one to start with because yeah. it's just the strips. Yeah, it looks easy to make, but how gorgeous is that once it's made and the ability to pop the straps on as well. Eighteen ninety nine. You've got that lovely wadding as well. All you need to do is choose your fabric. Five two zero eight zero four is your item number. Um, pop that into your baskets and order it, and then you've got yourself a brilliant bag for life or a gift for someone else. Remember, with this. You're also getting your Liberty fabric, your fat quarter, and that comes as a free gift. Which with you could any use purchase. at the, at the yeah. top. Yeah. I mean, your Liberty fabric on that would yeah. be, yeah, absolutely perfect. And if you wanted to put a pocket inside, maybe use your Liberty fabric to do that. You can always add a pocket. You inside. could, yeah, if you uh, check out the Josie bag. Yes. The, there's instructions in there of how to put a pocket inside. Oh, perfect. Right. Don't delay, get that into your baskets and proven to be very, very busy. 520804. Now, we've got some more seven day savers for you, and I know this time that it is Adam. What do you mean? What do you mean they can't see me? It's seven day savers, it's the fifth, but what? I've got to do the special click. Oh, Scott taught me this, and Yanis. Ready? Three, two, one. Yes! Here we are! Seven Day Savers is what we're looking at. Happy fifth birthday, Hachanda. This time, it's a haberdashery bundle. 13 items in total for £13.99. 271594. You've got all your sorts in there, from threads to bobbins to pins to needles to buttons to scissors and a tape as well. £13.99. Remember, with every purchase that you get, you will also receive that free gift as well. Oh, buttons galore, you can't go wrong. 271594 is your item number. That free gift, by the way, any live purchase, all the terms and conditions are on the website. Right, how do I do this again? Click with the left, click with the right, jump up, jump down, let's give it a go. I do actually, Sarah. Sarah's just asked me whether I find myself talking to myself at home on a regular basis. On a regular basis. Do you? say now come on Sarah Jane get on with it but yeah it's, it's like a little bit of encouragement isn't it, it is, it's yes. like come on you can do this or come on Janice you've got to get out of bed um, so yes yeah I often do it's interesting isn't it uh, right let's have a look at our layer cake uh, 37 pounds and 99 pence but my word you are getting value for money can we talk through what everyone's getting with your layer cake and how special this is Sarah you get 42 10 inch squares um, beautiful mode of fabric uh, all completely co coordinated you don't need to go and look for anything else really with that because it's it's designed to go together it, the, the tones in here are absolutely gorgeous and even with the ditzy patterns like that one as you can see there the detail is extraordinary isn't it and there are thousands of patterns that you can do with a layer cake I mean some of them don't even look like they started with a layer cake they've yeah. cut them into different different things I mean, it's just a uh, probably one of the most versatile things that you can buy. Yeah, because if you've got all your different templates for your different projects, for example, uh, whether it be quilting, bag making, cushion making, applique, styling, um, absolutely stunning. And that one as well, you can see getting close in there, the detail in that pattern is absolutely beautiful. And it is all about not just the quality of the fabric, but the attention to detail that Moda do. Yes. Totally. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, let me just continue showing you some more of the fabric. I'll just pop that over there. That, I think, is my favourite. Absolutely love that. It's like the old Victorian-style wallpaper, isn't it? Yeah, you, you could see that on your wall. Yeah, beautiful. Lovely colours in here. I think with this, you've got um, like a vintage vibe yes. with the colours that you have. And there's um, like a... It's, it's not a cream, it's not a beige. What colour would we say that is? It's more of a... Creme. Yes, more of like a cream. Or Did you a say creme? creme? 
Yeah, like creme. A creme. Oh, now you now you just coffee. About, yeah. yeah, coffee, cakes, creme brulee. Um, absolutely stunning. Got some roses in there, which of course traditional and English. That is sumptuous, isn't it? Look at the detail in the background. Almost if the uh, roses on there are like a 3D style. And it, you look at the colours and you think, there's no way they're going to go together. And once you've put them together, you just think, well, they would, they definitely do. They're, they born to be together. Yeah, they certainly do. We've got a quilt behind us, actually. You do get a pattern to build and create this quilt. How easy is it to make the Picture It quilt? Uh, I didn't actually make this one. Um, uh, one of our ladies did. But you're cutting uh, two and a half inch strips off to leave the square and then you just sew in the two and a half inch strips back on the sides. I mean, quilting is just taking a perfectly good piece of fabric, cutting it into pieces and then sewing it all back together again. Yeah, you're quite absolutely right. Um, you don't have to make this particular quilt if you don't want to. Nope. You can make a whole variety of different projects and different styles. But what you've got is that beautiful Regency lovely romance fabric from Moda and you'll be getting your fat quarter for, from Liberty included as part of the deal. Sarah, my, I don't know where the hour's gone. I know, it's gone really fast. It's gone really, really fast, hasn't it? Um, is this your only show today? Yes, um, normally we do two, but uh, you're so busy. Well, you've got nothing else in. to sell, though. No. So I think I think we are now going to have some coffee and cake because there's nothing oh, else for us yeah. to do. So that's good. Uh, safe journey back to Wales. Thank you Are you driving much. back today? Yes, we're going to go via Birmingham see some friends. Oh, lovely, lovely. We'll have a lovely journey um, and hopefully see you again very, very soon. Yes, yes, lovely. next month. Sarah's back next month. Well, thank you to Sarah, Sarah Jane, as you may know her, and thank you for watching, but do stay where you are and do check out your baskets, everyone. We've had a busy show. Right, so we've got the show with the longest title in the world. Sentimentally yours, birthday shenanigans, weekend, wow! And then we've got the Fabazine One Day special and crafting celebrations with cricket. What do you mean? What do you mean they can't see me? It's seven day savers, it's the fifth, but what? I've got to do the special click. Oh, Scott taught me this, and Yanis. Ready? Three, two, one. <coughs> yes! Here we are! Seven day savers is what we're looking at. Happy fifth birthday, Hachanda. This time, it's a haberdashery bundle. 13 items in total for £13.99. 271594. You've got all your sorts in there from threads to bobbins to pins to needles to buttons to scissors and a tape as well. £13.99. Remember, with every purchase that you get, you will also receive that free gift as well. Oh, buttons galore. You can't go wrong. 271594 is your item number. That free gift, by the way, any live purchase, all the terms and conditions are on the website. Right, how do I do this again? Click with the left, click with the right, jump up, jump down, let's give it a go. Ha! Hi, I'm Pat. I'm Mark. From Totally Patched. We're a family-based business here in Shropshire. We've been established for about 20 years. The, all of our kits uh, come pre-cut, meaning all the fabric is cut for the actual people who want to make the items, whether they be um, cushions, bags, quilts or anything else you want to cast your creative memory or mind into. Most of the kits we produce we design ourselves. The design process is usually inspired by the fabric itself. We use only use great quality fabrics, 100% cottons. So, whether you're a beginner or an experienced sewer or quilter, we hope we've got something for all of you. Make sure you come and watch us on Hachanda. Twenty-seven years ago, whilst enjoying a day out in Santa Barbara, California, with my brother and the kids, we came across a shop called Stampa Barbara. Santa Barbara, Stampa Barbara, we had to go in. And when we ventured inside, we were met with walls of wood-mounted rubber stamps. Well, that's when I had my moment of clarity. 
Wouldn't it make more sense, I said to my brother, if you could see through the rubber stamps? And that's where Clarity Stamp was born. Since then, Clarity has grown into the worldwide success it is today, bringing you the very best in stamping, parchment craft, and more recently, die cutting. To celebrate our 27th birthday, we have joined with Hochanda to bring you a long weekend of your favourite Clarity products with your favourite Clarity demonstrators. So, put the kettle on, put your feet up and join us for our 27th birthday celebrations on Friday the 4th of September from 10am to Monday the 7th of September at 5pm. We'll see you there. Hi, this is Els from Elizabeth Craft Designs. Elizabeth Craft Designs is a Colorado-based company. It's a family company, so husband, son, daughter all work in the company and then a fantastic team of designers because a company cannot exist without a great team around yourself. What we would like to share with you is my passion for crafts. We love all the concepts we have, so we have from cute till classic and beautiful designs. We love our journaling planner line and we are going to bring you our ideas, our passion and we hope to transfer that passion to you. So please join Elizabeth Craft Designs here at Hochenda. Well, a very good morning to you all. Now, if you've just joined us, don't go anywhere because, of course, we've got a wonderful hour with Sentimentally Yours. That means one thing, doesn't it? It means we've got the fabulous Phil Martin with oh, us. Oh, good, good morning, morning, everybody. Morning, darling. Good morning. From a distance. Oh, it's been ages I know it has. since I'm really we were looking together. Forward to this. It does feel like ages since I saw you last. It, it does. We've been ages. missing each other. And I genuinely, I'm really looking forward to this show as well. Now, Phil, you had a show yesterday. It was so busy. I know. So, so busy. I know. I know. Um, do you know, you're going to have to be quick on this hour. We've got some limited stock for you. We've got extended deliveries. We've, oh, we've <laughs> got all sorts. Let's go through it, though. Of course, Phil's got lots of demonstrations lined up, I think. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be one in a bit. Well, he's got them lined up. Whether he gets to do them or not is another matter. Let's have a look at this, though. We've got, oh, this is just beautiful as well. I, I've got to say, Phil, there's a slightly different style here for you. It is. It's just absolutely they gorgeous. They are. They're gorgeous. And I wanted to do, these have taken a long time to do Catherine obviously because you can see the detail that's in them and I wanted to do something that was floral but was a, bit, a little bit funkier um, and I was saying yesterday to Scott and to Paula what I, what was hard for me was making sure that there was lots of white space yeah. so sometimes as you know when you do this style of stamps and you stamp them they're a little bit dark they're a little bit too grungy so the, these have got the balance just absolutely perfect the flowers are gorgeous they are. the theme obviously I've called them flora musica so that tells you that you've got little bits of music in there and you've got the floral elements but you've got so much more in these I mean look at that one just stamped the, and chopped all up. of the samples as usual Phil are absolutely exquisite Thank they really you. are this is your weekend wow now it's limited stock you are saving eight pounds, fifty-four pounds and ninety-four pence. I've got tons and tons of samples here at the back as well. Now we can break this down into two payments for you. Two payments are twenty-seven pounds and forty-seven pence. Which remember, if you've got your credit, if you're spending over twenty-five pounds and you are on that flexi payment, so if you haven't spent it and you want to spend it wisely, this is a great way to spend it, isn't it? 346-303 is the item number. Now, we do have these individually for you as well, but set number one has actually sold out. Set number two, which is at the bottom there, we've just shown you on screen. Well, a lot of that stock has gone as well, but if you want set one, the only way you can get it is the weekend. Wow. Set number two that is still available on its own is limited stock. So if you do want those, you need to be quick with those as well. Now, let's just break this down a little bit for you as well. Now, if you look at the stamps per stamp set, if you break it down, it's £10.49 per stamp set. 
You don't want to pay that, do you? If you go for your bundle, let's work that down. It works out at £9.15 per stamp set. Now, if you do have your credit, remember that's a £5 credit. If you haven't spent it yet, it brings the price of those stamps down to just £8.32 each. That does make a difference, doesn't it? So we say spend it wisely. Do that if you want to do on this show, of course. And you get your flexi as well. So make sure that you do spend that, that voucher if you so wish because these are absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to show more samples, Phil, because we've got a whole array of gorgeous, gorgeous samples here. Each and every one of them is completely different again. Oh, we're just looking at that rosebud there as well. I know. Absolutely gorgeous. So that was the demo that I started yesterday that I am going to finish when we get when we get to me. Uh, the design team have done an amazing job and I have had so much fun with the samples that I've made. And I think that's the key. I was yeah. saying to Scott yesterday morning, when you've designed stamps for as long as I have, and you're still excited when you design a new range and you still want to keep crafting, that means that they're really good stamps and you know you're going to use them time and time again. You certainly um, are. And because the design team, I'm just going to say thank you to Alison, to Jennifer, to Lozzie and to David and to myself. <laughs> um, because we all have a different style and hopefully when you're looking at these samples at home, you're going to see bits of your own style in there. I've designed these stamps, uh, stamps specifically so that you can apply whatever is your your favourite theme, your favourite style, and you can just make them work for you. They are beautiful. And we've not mentioned the gift with purchase no, as well, have you've we? Got a free, a free what gift have we with got purchase? for everybody, Phil? Right, we do have for you, actually. I'm just going to borrow this one. That was mine, can't. yeah, but you're all right. Now, these are in assorted colours, <laughs> aren't they? <laughs> These are, you, we're not sort of specifying a colour you'll get. A, no, but there, a are nine, there are nine colour. colours. It's, ju it's just a, yeah. cause can you imagine me trying to say to the girls when we're packing, right, you've got to find all the light blue <laughs> ones. It's, it's just not going to happen. So it'll be a random colour. There are nine different colours. You're going to get a, a, a dark, a medium or a light shade in pink, purple or blue. These are my ombre blending paste. And believe you me, this is, I, I don't give things away lightly, but these work so well with the, you know, I don't. <laughs> you don't want to know what it's <laughs> but these work so well with the stamps i've used them to do edges and to add texture to my to my stamping so these are a really good addition it's not just something i've thrown in and let's face it they're worth 650. wow it's a pretty decent will we gear. see these in use during demonstration as uh, well not on this one pace. we might do on the second one it depends Ooh, which card i pick let's up let's see if we get to the <laughs> second one then looking forward to that well do you know take advantage right now we are very very limited on the weekend while we're just hanging on in there do do not hesitate and check those baskets out. Limited stock, very limited stock, it should say on there. 346-303. Now, while I'm here as well, I'm going to tell you about our pen set. This is set number four. Now, these were limited stock at the top of the hour, but during the time that we've taken already, they've sold out. Oh, dear. However, now, this is where you've got to listen carefully. We have got an extended delivery the date is from the 21st of September because I know Phil is waiting for the delivery, but you need to get in quickly if you want that. I know it's a little bit longer to wait, but these have been so, so busy. They've literally flown out and Phil has got to wait for his shipment to come, of course. So the 21st of September is the date we're looking at. Now, please do get in the queue for these because they literally flew out. If you've already got set number one, two, and three, don't miss out on set number four. That will make the full set, yeah. won't it? So the set four is the final set, and yeah. I know it's three weeks. It might be sooner. If it is sooner, obviously, we're going to ship them as soon yeah. as they come in. But I already know. I knew that I'd not ordered enough, so I ordered more. And I already know that the next lot is not going to be enough. Oh. But this is going to be the last time. So I will bring back sets one, two, three three and four if there are any left either at the end of this year or the beginning of next year but that will be it that will be the last opportunity to to complete your set oh, well. so now i know it's three weeks it will be sooner if they come sooner you should be getting them now do don't miss out on this secure yours now to make sure you do get them and you do get the stickers as well you do though, I'll go, when, it gets, when you come to me i'll go through all that but set four is the final set so you've got two sheets of stickers in there that relate to all four sets yeah and and when you come to me i'll show you what i'm 
well, I've already done mine, but I'll show you what you're going to do with yours, just so that you can organise them. Put, I've put mine into colour groups, so I've got my dark blues leading into my light blues, my dark greens Perfect. lead. So the colours in here are the final, the final colours that complete the set. Yeah. There will be no, there won't be a set five. Wonderful. Well, you can see the details on the screen. Just remember that dispatch date, uh, item number one two seven four seven nine. Now, the Weekend Wow, I'm just here and getting updates as we go along. The Weekend Wow has just sold out. Now, we do have more stock of that on extended delivery. It's a different date to the pens because obviously the pens are coming from somewhere else. Uh, limited stock. Check those baskets out. Oh. It's an extended, it's not limited, we need to say that because of course it's sold out so it's on extended delivery. So the date for these is the 12th of September. There's no more after that either. Ooh. I've got no more stock. So after after that's gone, that's it. Yep. Thank you, everybody. Oh, we had huge stocks at the start. At yesterday's show, I can't show, believe a weekend wow stock has gone effectively in two live hours. Wow. So thank you. Obviously, it means I've done a good job with it's the stamps. A, well, but still, you, the, the timeless, them, aren't they? You're going to be stunning. using these year in, year absolutely, out. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right, let's have a look at something else because, you know, I've fallen in love with these next stamps. First time I saw them was today. I didn't get to see the show yesterday. Why but not? They, That's just ridiculous. I had one day off this week, Phil. <laughs> one day I was catching up on sleep or trying to. <laughs> yes, I'm so sorry, Phil. I didn't watch you. Uh, <laughs> I've got to admit, I hold my hands up. Uh, but these are absolutely amazing. I love these. They are so. They're so different. They are very different. They're very funky. They're very modern. Um, I did introduce these when I did my Facebook Live on my Sentimentally Yours Facebook page last weekend. And I, I mentioned to everybody, do you want a full set? Because I haven't done a full set. I've just done these two for this show. Um, so there probably will be relatives and everything coming in the future so you can complete the set. Oh. So these are my trio frame uh, sentiments and you can see trio frame kind of gives it away. You've got three different frames around each of the words. You see I've put Flora Musica in there yeah. as well. I wanted to put that in because it just if you just use that one word with the st when you use one of the stamps it looks so classy. Flora Definitely. Musica it's, it's just really clever. Um, so you've got three different ways of cutting each of those individual sentiments out and effectively what you're looking at in the sets times that by three and that's that's how many stamps how many times you can use the stamps how many different exactly. ways it's crazy isn't it it is i just love them and uh, if you've funky. not spotted samples already we will find some for you as well really good idea do you know it's one of those ideas again you think oh, why hasn't anybody thought of it before phil got there first and well done phil there is look, looking very <laughs> smug in the corner there i, I, can't, <laughs> I can't have a new pounds. photo done because the botox was, was in it was work <laughs> it were working on that photo. no i'm kidding i don't have that as you can tell <laughs> Busy on these as well. Two thirds of the stock has gone. Twenty-eight pounds and ninety-eight pence. Six two zero two six five. Do pop those into your basket if you can. And remember again, if you've got that credit to spend, once again here over twenty-five pounds, so you can take that five pound credit off. So that brings the price on. Let's bring it down. That's twenty-three ninety-seven, isn't it? So do you know what? 11.98 each but you've got an awful lot of individual stamps there 48 individual stamps times it by three if you want because they're cutting them different ways you do the sums it's just incredible value let's see what else we've got though because we've got some beautiful embossing folders for you half the stock has gone i absolutely adore these phil i do you know, you. I love them because they're square. I love them because the size, you know, you've got the 8x8s eight there, yeah. haven't you? 8x8 eight eight for me is the perfect size for embossing folder. There is Beautiful. a story, but I'm not going to keep saying it. It took me a while to find a manufacturer that A, would put up with me being so demanding, <laughs> and B, that could, that could bring me the quality that I wanted. And I, you, know, you know I'm fussy, but I'm fussy for the sake of everybody at home as well. Like you, yeah. you already know my brand, you trust it, and this is why I am the way I am. But these are really top quality embossing folders. Folders. The impression is amazing. Uh, th thicker, thicker plastic than normal, so these are slightly thicker than a normal embossing folder. If I get a chance when you come back to me, we'll run one through the machine just so I can show you. The designs, I've designed these, these are the first everyday ones that I've ever released. So uh, the, uh, I already know that the stock is, is going quickly. So you've got the everyday flourish, the classic flourish there, which you know is going to work for every occasion. Love the beaded swags. It's so decadent. It's really pretty. And then the first one that you showed everybody was the striped elegance. That is and beautiful. I wasn't going to do that one. It was only when I was talking to my sister and she said, no, let's do it because you can actually chop that in two halves. Yes, you so can you not. can actually use that middle bit separately and have stripes top and bottom. 
I just love that because yeah, one it's, it's simple really little clever. flower there's a quick card. Elegant. It's going to look yeah. as though you spent hours and hours on it. I love embossing folders anyway. They just they add something to gorgeous, your projects. They are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. £26.97. Again, above that £25 limit. 343423 is the item number. So if you've got your credit to spend, it brings it down. It works out. We take it per folder price. Seven pounds and thirty-two pence per folder, and these are eight by eight. Without your credit, eight ninety-nine, still a great price. That is an amazing price for actually. It is. I'm a good barter. -er, you... -er, -er. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a good barter. They are absolutely gorgeous, and I can't see it there on the board because we've just got the one side, but the deboss side, I should oh, imagine, looks oh, just I'll as show beautiful. You. I'll show you. Yeah, the deep. These need... are really deep, yeah. so you know you're going to be able to use a deboss and the emboss side because they, they're both really deep. Lovely. Oh, fantastic. Right, we've got more for you, though. Oh, I've got more samples to show you as well. I should really have shown you some there for the uh, the embossing folders, but I know Phil's going to be using them in demonstration as well. Now, when it comes to the dies that we've got for you now, all of them come with magnetic storage as well. Now, we do have a bundle here for you, so if you want all of the dies that you can see there on the screen, there is a £10 saving. Again, of course, you can use that credit if you've got it as well. And we've got a flexi buy option for you. Two payments of £38.49. and pence. The item number is 017523. Now, I've got the boards for these here as well. And these are absolutely gorgeous once again. You've got those that lovely sort of elegance about these. So the first one you're looking at is perfectly pretty border die set. So what you're getting, of course, are four dies in each set. So you can see you've got your, I'm not going to call it plain because it certainly isn't your base die there. Then you've got your decorative overlays. You can use them separately, but of course when you put them together, so you can see there, the plainer one and also the overlay there will give you this creation. Beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. That's just one of the sets there. So when we're looking at the full bundle, you're also going to get this one. Delightfully deco border die sets, individually, because you can get these individually. Um, already nearly two-thirds of the stock has gone. That's the perfectly pretty, the first one that I did show you there. When it comes to this one, the delightfully deco border die sets, it's the same principle, but obviously you've got different shapes on the bottom of the dies there. Almost two-thirds of the stock gone individually again on this one. So you've got your base one there, which works perfectly on its own. You could overstamp on that with those beautiful stamps if you've got them. And then, of course, you've got your layers over the top. Oh, I do love that. In fact, that's the one that's been used at the bottom there. Isn't that pretty? Oh, no, it's that one that's been used. They're all gorgeous, Do you know, they, they all work so well. Do you know, Phil, the fact that you've got those different di those different looks there, and it does uh -huh. change it, doesn't it, from going just absolutely. from the decorative die to the overlay yeah, as well. Absolutely. They're so Stunning. intricately detailed as well. It was I was really pushing the back. Well, you can see the, the gaps between the yeah. die cuts are really small. Now, these are nice as well because you've got the loveliest lattice border die sets. So, again, if you look at the overlay, it's stunning. Those decorative ones. But I can see areas you can thread through your ribbons and yeah, your paper strips absolutely. there as well. Yeah. And also the, the top and bottom one with the um, octagons and the diamonds, they're actually really good for men's cards. I always struggle to find border oh, dies for men's they? cards because they're always pretty. And that's really why I did why I did those a little. I'm saying they're not plain, are they? They're not plain at all. Definitely <laughs> they're very not. decorative, but the shapes are not. I are can not see as where you're coming as, from as there. Hard. Beautiful, just beautiful. Now individually, stock-wise, on this particular one, 60% of the stock has gone. But of course, as the bundle there, you have got that £10 savings. So do take advantage if you want to go for them all. You're certainly going to use them all, aren't you? And again, they, these are timeless pieces. Don't forget that A4 magnetic storage comes with them as well. And you've got that flexi buy, two payments of thirty-eight pounds and forty-nine pence, zero one seven five two three. Now, when it comes to dies, Phil knows exactly what he's doing. Let's have a look at the next. Now, we've got some individuals for you here. We've got the new elegant eyelet octagon here. That's a mouthful if I've ever heard one. Phew. Just Thanks, going back darling. to those border dies as well, <laughs> Phil. There, the last set that we did show on the board there, you've got the little octagons in there, so they work perfectly with you've these, don't got, they? Uh, yeah, you know how my brain works. <laughs> I certainly do. You're very clever. Does. Very clever. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these. Thirty-five ninety-nine. You're actually getting thirteen dies, and again, you've got that magnetic storage included. These are so so striking, Phil. Yeah, I've absolutely. Got to say. The, these are your essentials. These are the ones that you can't craft without. Well, I certainly can't anymore. 
and, and if you put your hand in front, you'll see just how big the biggest yeah. one is. They're, they're slightly bigger than eight by eight, so you, and put they my, go all the way down. Hand in front but there, the detail in them is incredible. That. And I know That's from the really first release out. of Elegant Eyelets that people are now already collecting them. So these are the latest. These are the latest two sets. Yeah. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So there you go, that's the eyelets. They're on the left for you. The double D boss is at the bottom because of course we all know about those by now. So of course you've got to have that included as well. So uh, do take advantage of those. Details at the bottom for the double D boss. Let's have a look at the squares because they're available as well. So we'll do the same thing. We'll bring up at the side of the screen the eyelet option for you there. And I'm sure at the bottom the screen we're going to be seeing the double D boss as well. So same price, 35.99. But of course you've got those squares, 14 dies in this one and the magnetic storage as well. That's if you're going for the eyelets there, the squares, as I say, at the bottom. Same, but you've got that beautiful effect of the double D boss as well. 121077 is the item number for these. Now, do remember to check those baskets out. Don't miss out on anything. We've had such busy hours with Phil. Uh, this is really, is this only the second hour then? You had such a, oh, it's the third uh, one, This isn't is my it? third hour, yesterday. yeah. I had two, two yeah. yesterday and I've got two today. Um, before I forget to mention, Julia's taking over tomorrow, if there's any stock then. <laughs> so Julia will be here tomorrow at three and seven. I can't wait because I've already seen some of the demos she's got planned. Oh. And unlike me, Julia will probably get to, or hers done. <laughs> um, so I can't wait. She's also doing a Facebook Live on her Facebook page today at one o'clock. Is she? So make sure you ch it's just an extra bonus, yeah. So so she'll be using the new stamps uh, on her Facebook Live today. Okay, okay. right, so we're going to finish this card that I started yesterday, and I was going to do this in between shows, but I changed my mind because I wanted to finish it live for you. So basically, this is as far as I got yesterday. This is using the rose um, from the Weekend Wow, and it's just singling out the rose. So all I did was ink the stamp up, and then you can see where I've just wiped off the ink on the stamp before I stamped it. So we've still got some like shabbiness going on. We've got a little bit of the script showing. We've got the border, and I started to colour the rose in. The card that I'm using is our is our hot press watercolor card, and I said to everybody yesterday, if you're going for the pens, please treat yourself if you can to a pack of the hot press watercolor card because it is a game changer. It's so smooth, it's it's so luxurious and easy to work on. So I'm just literally going to finish finish this, and I'm going to add a little bit more texture. So can you see how we've got? I need in my brain, I need this to have a little bit more around here. It's just it's just not right to me. <laughs> so I'm using one of the extra uh, texture stamps. These are also on the show. You've got them in a set of three. Uh, you've got the A5 and you've got two two smaller sets. And I'm just going to add some of these little lines from here. I find stamps like this so invaluable, Very particularly smart, for this right? kind of yeah. thing. So I'm just going to use my acrylic circle and I'm literally just going to over stamp look and I can fill in. Can you see? I can fill in that space there. Exactly. And that's what I need to do. Now, and these have been thin. busy as well. A quarter of the stock has gone. They are invaluable, I think, these, Phil. In fact, the set that you're just using there, I'm just thinking if you if you stamp and you miss a little bit as well and it's bothering you, these are yeah, a great one to go over absolutely. the top with. And uh, you would never even notice that you'd missed anything. Great bundle there. You can see the details on the screen. 3547, item number 787825. Now, we've also got for you as well... Let's just bring the details up. We've got the circles for you. So the acrylic circles that uh, Phil, of course, is using right now, which are fabulous because you can see exactly where you're stamping. 19.99 for the set of three, 611.539. Okay, so I've just inked the top part and I've taken some of the ink off and we'll just try and extend that a little bit more at the bottom. There you go. I mean, that, now to me, oh, that, that is balanced. It, it works better. I can also, if I want to, doodle in that. This is why I love the stripes in these stamps. You can doodle your own words in these. Yeah. I'm not going to do that because I want to get this demo finished. So I'm just going to literally carry on colouring in the rest of this rose. Uh, I've stamped with Versafine Onyx Black. So the stickers, while you've got me at this end of the counter, so you've now collected, if you've ordered set four, you will now have four of these hard cases. Yeah. Um, and when I was talking to the people who make these for me, I'm like, I need something for the outside of the box because I'm stacking these on my shelf like this, yeah. so, or, or even like that. And I, I need to know what colours is in. I don't want to take all four off to find my blues and so on. So you've got all the colours from set one, all the colours from set two, and all the colours from set three and set four. And if, like me, you're going to organise them into colour groups, 
it gets confusing because some of the shades start to look similar. Yes, I so see. Like, so like one of the blues from set one might look similar to one in set three. They are not, they're not the same colour, but the stickers obviously these are digitally done. So that means you can, you can get your set one, think, ah, that's the blue, put your blue there. Yeah. Put your next blue, yeah. next blue, next blue, and then you can have them all organised. And then when you've got them sitting on your shelves, it's going to look really, really pretty because you can see all the colours at the end. Oh, it just makes idea. it easier. And I'm a bit of an organised freak, because you know, <laughs> you I just spent, I just redone so my room at home, really my craft room at home, and I've, I've organised all my car stock into pretty little boxes with coloured labels. Oh. Yeah. How uh, how right, so we're going to go. How do you find time to do that? Eh? How do you find time to do that? J Julia said exactly the same thing. She says you must have too much time on your hands. <laughs> but but that's that's important to me because yeah. I always say this because obviously we're busy. But if I spend as much time looking for things that as I do, true. so yeah. it makes sense to have them organised and then I think, right, I know I need the pistachio card. Yeah. Job done. That is right. that is very, oh, very I need true. Your glasses. I was just looking at that thinking, oh it looks a bit blurry to me. That's because I can't <laughs> I got my glasses on. Hang <laughs> God, hang God. <laughs> Right, so I'm going direct in with the pens. I'm not, um, not going to watercolour with these. I'm going direct in with the pens, and I've got two different shades. These are both from set four. Um, so love the fact that in this set, you've got some gorgeous greens and you've got some gorgeous pinks. You've got some like really shabby sheet vintage pinks oh, in there, which are, not, are missing from the rest of the sets. So I'm just going in direct. Apologies if you, oh, if you get my head in. Um, I have done my hair so it won't look too bad. Unlike when I do my Facebook lives and I've usually, because you know when I'm tired, I twirl my hair. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've done it from being a kid. I twirl it and because my hair doesn't look long like this, but it is actually quite long, yeah. <laughs> and then when I do my Facebook lives and lean over, I've usually got a horn bit <laughs> where, where, I, where I've been twirling my hair. It's a bit of a standing joke now. It's funny. I have my shirt on and then I've usually got my jar bottoms on. So... <laughs> So let's get uh, let's get this coloured in. So look at this beautiful, beautiful green. That is a beautiful this is green. another one of the benefits of the hot press cardstock. I can it's going to. I mean, these pens blend together on any any cardstock, but on this, they are going to blend so so beautifully. So I'm just going to go. You can see how smooth that is, Phil, as well. So that means as well, of course, when you're stamping. I mean, the quality of the stamps is exceptional anyway. But you're not going to lose that print. You're going to get a lovely effect from yeah. those stamped images. Absolutely. You're going to get all that shading. And literally, well, you've seen what I've done there. I'm literally just adding a bit of a darker colour in the middle to where the veins are. I'm just going to do the stems as well. So this will be the only colour on this card which is what really makes this image pop. And I, if you didn't see the show yesterday, I did, I did um, give Lozzie a little name check because this was one of her ideas that I borrowed. Uh, and I just thought it's amazing. You've got six different stamps in that, in that weekend. Wow. We could do this with the lily, yeah. the daisy, yeah. the, the hydrangea, and the cars are just going to look incredible. So you know, just... I would be putting that extra set of stamps into my basket as well. I just love what you've done there at the side of the, the rows with that uh, that lovely collection of three stamps, that trio there. We can see the details at the bottom of the screen for those. 787825, such a useful set, not just with the new Weekend Wow, of course, but everything else you've already got in your stash. That is looking amazing. For and it's, it's just so easy to achieve. So I'm just going in, I'm just adding some more shading with the first colour. Uh, obviously, you will have a little bit more time. We all say this. It makes me laugh when we all say it on TV. You'll have more time than me, and then you think, yeah, it looks dodgy, Phil. But actually, for quick colouring in, that it looks like good. I've spent hours on it. It does. <laughs> so that's all I'm going to do to that. I'm not going to add anything else to it. We're just going right. to stick this card together. I'll give you two minutes to tell everybody what's happening. Okay, okay. And then I can do my... Ne oh, I need to do my sentiment. So I'll just tell you what I've done here. So this is... This, you know me and my big cars. This is 23 by 23. <laughs> <laughs> then we've got watercolour card 21 by 21 this is one of the border dies from the perfectly pretty so obviously the border dies are 20 centimeters wide which is not 23 which is what my card yeah. is so all i did was snipped off at the ends and i've extended it you'd never know because you you've got the know. elegant eyelet octagon over the top i'm going to add this one over the top and then we're going to stamp the sentiment um, and I'm just going to stamp it in black and cut it out. I'm going to do exactly what Lozzie did on her sample because it looked fab. Sometimes I never do 
clean and simple, I just can't do it. But I saw the card that she'd made. I don't know where it is. I think I've got it on the front it's, of the counter, right a the rectangle the counter, one. Yes, we will, uh, we will and find it just stood you. out. You know, sometimes yeah. the, the, the image was enough. And I thought that just looks so classy. That's it. Look it's at that. Beautiful. Is that not just the most beautiful it's thing? Absolutely. You imagine stunning. that done with the daisies, though, in pinks and oranges. Yeah. And, yeah, and that little bit of shadowing at the bottom of the yeah. stem as well. Amazing. And uh, because these stamps have got so much going on in them, you can actually cherry pick areas from it. So if I'd have got more time, I would maybe have used some of the music on the back of my, yeah, yeah on the background, nice. just to just to bring the whole thing in together. We're not halfway through the show. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Do you know I'm we just... are halfway through the show, Phil? Halfway through the show. Yeah. Right, I'm going to crack on with this because I want to get it done and get the other one done. I said that yesterday. <laughs> It'll never happen. So let's just pop that. Look at this. Look, Look at that. how that Soon pops just that with that red. Oh, Phil. So all I'm going to do now is I've got some of the scraps from my watercolour card from when I was doing the matting and layering. Okay. I'm just going to stamp one of the sentiments. Uh, 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 oh, oh, too many choices. <laughs> now, uh, that's a, a point as well. The watercolour card, I know we're busy on that as well. Do not waste a single scrap of that just no. for using for the sentiments. Absolutely. You only need a minuscule amount, really, don't you? Absolutely. So I'm just going to I'm just going to stand with love because I think that's probably enough for okay, this one. I think it is. Now um, almost 8% of the stock of the card has gone. Uh, busy on that. Very, very busy indeed. You're getting 20 sheets. Remember, this is your hot press. So you've got that lovely smooth surface. It's absolutely beautiful to work from 20 sheets. Don't forget, as Phil said, and you've seen him do it there live on TV with those pens. It is just wonderful to work with 017406 and also the quality of the stamp from the sentiment stamp that you can see there as well you can see how well that has picked up on the hot press cardstock now when it comes to the sentiments we've got those there for you as well another great buy two-thirds of the stock has gone 28 pounds and 98 <coughs> pence don't forget your credit your voucher if you've still got it to spend that you'll qualify for it on this because it's over 25 pounds you're going to get both sets 48 individual stamps there it would work out at 23 pounds and 98 pence if you've got your voucher of course 620265 is the item number okay so i just want to try and explain to you what was in my brain so when i designed these i designed them with the uh weekend wow stamps in mind yeah because i know that this kind of thing is is the perfect addition to this style of stamps kind of collage style um, but also with my Ticket Tape Tastic Sentiments from last month or the month, I can't remember when I did them. But these are designed to complement those as well. So it's a different font. So if you if you bought the collection of Ticket Tape Tastic, it's a different font. It's very similar, but it's a different font. However, you're going to be able to use these with all of those sentiments and with the ones that are coming. And I'll just Ooh. quickly explain to you what's happening. Look at me looking over my glasses. <laughs> quickly explain to you what's happening with this. So when I did the inspired sentiments, I wanted something that gave you lots and lots of choice, lots and lots of ways to mix and match. So you have this freedom too, and then you can create colourful art. Freedom to be phenomenal, freedom to be beautiful, and so many different ways oh. to use it. If you then take that with the ticket tape inspirational sentiments, it's going to blow your mind because wow. the options are just so unlimited. So if I would really treat you yourself really to that. You really do think about everything so carefully, Phil. Well, I, it's not a cheap hobby, is it? No, it's not. I mean, we've done this for long enough to know that as as crafters, we want everything. Yeah. So I want everything to work with everything I've done yeah. and everything that's coming. Yeah. Right, so what I've got now are three different choices of how to cut this out. More if you look at it more carefully, but three, we'll go with three. So I can now cut the whole thing out, which is what I'm going to do, and then I'll get that lovely shape. Or I could cut along that line, look, and then we've got a straight sentiment with that lovely little bit of a border showing. We could cut the black one out, and then we've got a different shape again, or you or the outside one so it just it just means you can mix and match it so you know the cars i've got there on your left yeah with all the borders on yes keep going these yeah, ones no come back the these? cards no oh, come back yeah here. that's it oh. only the biggest pile in front of us so while i'm just cutting this out you show everybody i you will see show these all the different ways that i've i've cut these out let's have a look at it do you know i want to look at these <laughs> anyway because they're just so beautiful uh well done never again, worked with animals children and phil <laughs> 
Oh, dear. these, look at these. Look at the weekend wow stamps used in the background there. But we're looking as well, of course, at those sentiments to see the different ways that Phil's cut these out. All the design team, of course, who've created these wonderful cards. These are just beautiful, Aren't they? Phil. I've had so much fun doing them. This oh. is not my typical style, as you know. Uh, my my typical style is very pretty, lots of flowers. There's they not a single pretty, flower though. on them apart from the stamp. You, you've got the balance just right, I think. The pretty and the kind of the the sort of grungy, but mixed without being too look. grungy. Yeah, the mixed media look. It's beautiful. Yeah, because there's, there's lots going on in the background, but it, these, this is just a stamp. So what I've done is I've just extended it. So although they're A6, yeah. if you're wanting to create an 8x8 background, you can absolutely do that. Just stamp it more than one time. Definitely. Joanne made a card. I don't know where it is, but Joanne made a card where she'd used two or three of these stamps. Yeah. And it, it just looked amazing as a color in the background so many Beautiful. ways right you, so I'm literally just going to stick this sentiment on the uh, border dies on those samples as well there yeah, which really them. really make those uh, the fact that I've made a card with all six stamps shows you how much I love these yeah. stamps because I've and they're not quick ones as you can see so I'm literally just, I'm not going to glitter this I'm not going to do anything else to it I'm just going to pop this little sentiment down the bottom like that Aww. and leave it but how striking that is, is that it's so love simple it. Yeah, Beautiful. so simple, but the stamp is just, it's just so classy. So, I'm going to let you, if that's all right, do a we'll bit do of a work, because you've not done much yet. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a look at the weekend wow because of course we've got it back on extended delivery for you. So oh do you know already twenty percent of the restock has gone. Oh do you know we've only had it twenty minutes as well. This is the third hour fill. Everything has just been flying out the door. It really, really has. Don't miss out on this. Let's have a look. Set one. And set number two individually are sold out. They've both gone now. So the only way you can get any of these stamps is the weekend wow. And why would you not? Because look at this. £31.47 and pence would have got you set two there, sold out. We had a little bit of stock earlier on, but that's gone. All six of those stamps in the bundle will cost you £54.94. and pence. You're saving £8. Then you've got your flexi payment as well. Two payments of £27.47. pence. Just as a reminder, if you've got your credit of five pounds to spend you need to spend in 25 pounds or more that applies to this because your first flexi is 2747 so you can bring that down so the first flexi would be 22 pounds and 47 pence because we can take it off that first payment for you now with that five pounds off each stamp set works out at eight pounds and 32 pence and when you look at the detail in each and every one of these stamps the way that you can use them whether it's in its entirety whether you use just sections of the stamp you know it's endless it really is one of those sets that you are going to be using time and time and time again and you can see you've got the floral elements you've got butterflies in there of course you've got the music in there as well it's the flora musica that's what we call this or that's what phil's called it it's your medley of that full full medley actually with all those different stamps absolutely beautiful we'll have a look at a few more samples i think as well i don't want to take time away from phil but I'm not sure, I don't, don't know if he's ready to go, he's doing a little bit of work, I think, just to get in front, uh, <laughs> to make sure we get another demo finished. I'm just going to show you one or two more samples. I'm trying to grab something that we didn't show you earlier. Isn't that beautiful? That is gorgeous. gorgeous. The design team have done an amazing job, an amazing job. It shows you how you can look at six stamps and certain different people will do different things with them. Uh, they're just so beautiful. They really, really are. And it doesn't matter if you add a lot of colour, a little bit of colour. Actually, I've just spotted this one. I've got to show that. I love that. Again, so simple, simple. Lots of yeah, white space. Absolutely. Beautiful. And this is, I mean, Lozzie has been a great addition to my design team because she thinks differently to me. I would never do that because to me, that's like, too, it's too quick. Yeah. If I don't spend 15 hours on a card, I feel this like I've cheated myself. This is more a isn't it? But this it looks one. incredible. Yeah, Lovely. that's more likely. Beautiful. That's one of Lozzie's, though, so it just shows it you does show how you. she's gone from one extreme to the other. It certainly does. Wonderful. That's one of our cares, that oh. turquoise one on the top. Isn't that this beautiful? One. 
best. So They're all beautiful. She's had a good you teacher, can't, obviously. You can't pick, <laughs> you can't pick a favourite out. Okay. Do you know, Phil, if you pat yourself on the back in the morning, you're going to go head over heels over the counter. 346 303 is the so item funny. number. Oh, we love Phil. Right, almost a quarter of the restock stock wow. gone on the weekend. Wow, do not miss out on that. Right, Phil. Wow. Right, we can okay, tell them about so. brush pens as well, can't we? Because we've got those back on extended. Yes. It is a three-week wait, but well worth it. Do not miss out on these. Get in for these. You need to be in the queue. Uh, we haven't to give that longer time because, of course, they're not even arrived here with Phil yet. But do make sure you get yours, especially if you've already got set one, set two, set three. You want set number four as well. One, two, seven, four, seven, nine. There we are. And then the sentiments, of course, the ones that Phil's been using, almost 70% of the stock has gone. £28.98. We're getting a bit worried about Julie and what she's going to use tomorrow. <laughs> 620265. That's the item number for those. The embossing folders have been really busy as well. I'm not surprised. These are stunning. There we are. We've hardly seen them this hour as well, but they are absolutely beautiful. 2697, two thirds of the stock has gone there. Eight by eight, three, four, three, four, two, three. Right, Phil. Right, back oh, to me. Oh, we've got embossing folders involved in this one. You Love have. It. I've already done it, which is just as well. But if I've got time at the end, I will run one through and okay. show you. Let me just sh look at that. So beautiful. this is the classic floor. So this is a Phil card. There's a couple of little flowers. Let me just swing them. A in couple. Front. Look at that little dancer. Beautiful. So this this is just showing you the versatility of these stamps. So how gorgeous is that beautiful embossing folder? And more importantly for me, in my mind, that is neither feminine or masculine. It's just generic. Yeah. So you know you're going to use that one loads. So all I've done already is I've matted and layered. This is the... Um, if you go on the website, all my premium car stock will be under the Sentimentally Yours brand. It's a... Uh, I'll let... Um, Catherine tell you the details, but I've used here uh, Lavender Meadow and Sky Blue. So I'm using the Hydrangea stamp and the Lavender Meadow and the Sky Blue are really, really pretty together. So that's what I've used on there and obviously the Pure White. Okay. I've got my border already cut. Now if you saw the show I did yesterday afternoon with oh, Paula, I did drop you a little hint. I mentioned that the all the border dies that have feature the hearts and these kind of shapes are going to tie into something that I'm bringing you soon. Ooh. Yeah, so you're getting, a, you're getting a head start. I'm literally just going to stick that on. I don't know whether you met, you've noticed either, but they've all got a double deboss detail in them. Can they you see? Have, haven't they? So again, they work perfectly with the yeah. double deboss dies for the, the shapes. Now, we've had an email, actually, um, Phil. When it comes to the border dies, this is from Pauline. Can you repeat the pattern? Can you extend... Could you make the them bigger? Yeah. I suppose you could. The only way you would be able to do that is if you didn't use the end, the, the end of the cut. So if you started at one end of an A4, for example, and didn't, didn't, and went over the edge, you're then going to oh, get I a see. cut, and then yes. you can carry it yeah. on. Uh, I suppose you could, but, but these are eight inches, and I've yeah. done them eight inches because they're the biggest cards that I generally yeah. make. You know, I'm a bit selfish like that. But what it also means is it will work for 7x7, 5x5, 6x6, A5, and so on. If you're a scrapbooker, yeah, I'm sure you, I'm pretty sure you'd be able to do it. There are tricks, though, even if you can't, isn't there? As you did show, you could, if you've got a photograph or something, you can cut it in the middle and hide yeah. the joint, put a little flower over the top or some sort well, of embellishment. Well, that's what I did on the big card. Yeah. I, I, the middle bit was covered, so I just used the... Um, I just used, I just chopped it and used the ends so it looked like it was longer than it was. But if, if you wanted to go around a scrapbook page, for example, I suppose you could. Right, so I've just literally overlaid that. Look at the change it makes just by adding a different colour underneath. Yeah. This is why I kept them separate. I wasn't going to bother with the plain ones, especially with the rectangle, because obviously you can cut a rectangle on your machine, but you never get them the right size. You, you don't. So I did it. And sometimes our trimmers don't cut ever so straight no. either, or you can kind of flex the blade a little bit. So it's nice to have the dice. It also it the ties into finish. the ones that are coming next year quite nicely as well. So I don't just do things for the sake of it. So I'm literally just going to go over that edge, straight through the middle, and we've now created a divider for that card. We'll let that set while we do the stamp, and we're doing the hydrangea. And oh, I absolutely love this stamp. Absolutely love it. I can't choose favourites because I love them all, but I love the hydrangea so much. It's just so easy to colour in, and it's really, really pretty. So top tip, if you've not seen us already do this, we just snip the top off the packaging now so the stamps just slide out. Not my idea. It was Julia's, and Julia got it from 
I think it was Jane. But what a Jane cracking, got it from Sue. Yeah, what, Sue a, got what a cracking it from idea. Daniel. What a cracking idea. <laughs> it just keeps everything nice and neat for you, doesn't it? So I'm going to stamp it here. Okay. So I've just got the hydrangea. Oh, hang on a minute, Phil. Hang on. What hang have you on. Done, Phil? What because have you done? it's going into the frame. I don't ah. need to see all of it. Yeah, so let me just check where I'm going with this before I get too giddy. <laughs> Actually, while you're just checking that, I'm just going to mention the magnets you've got because we were talking about you this morning. We had the Crafty Devil show and we'd got the, the platform magnets available. We were saying Phil likes to use four magnets. I've got four, yeah, and I can't remember who it was that told me, but when I was here, I think it was Paula. <laughs> it's just so it's just common sense what she told me. And she's like, and I'm lifting the stamp up, and you know when it lifts the card up, when you bring the stamp yeah. up, I'm like, oh, that drives me mad. And she says, well, just get another magnet. Yeah. I'm like, well, I've got two more of these, or three more of these at home. I'll just take some out one of the other boxes, which is what I did. Oh. Anyway, so let me crack on. So I'm now just going to do the hydrangea, and we're going to extend it just on one side. Okay. And I will move the card this time. Now, on the original sample, which is this one here, Catherine, right yeah. at the very end, we'll see if we can get a shot it's uh, the top right on the counter. This has got the hydrangeas uh, decoupaged. Yeah, this is where I've taken the inspiration from this. It's Look one of my sisters this. as well. Isn't so she's, she stamped the hydrangeas a second time and then just decoupaged them. She's done the same with the envelopes. Uh, and just how pretty and effective is that? Beautiful. Oh, look at that. That's just so pretty. I might not actually need to stamp. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, I do. That's just cheating, Phil. You're just <laughs> cheating. <laughs> so I'm just going to move this across. Do you know what's a nice idea as well? Just that little bit of kitchen towel to save getting the ink you in know, your phone do uh, okay. <laughs> My platform underneath is immaculate. Is it? <laughs> I should, des I should really design my idea. own kitchen roll because I use so much of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is just said in my ish that I'd buy it. <laughs> <laughs> so now we've just extended, look, because I know we're going to see that bit. I'll just Lovely. let that dry. I am going to clean this um, because... Ver as you know, versifying stains your stamps, and yeah. I can't be doing with that. Do you know if you extended there as well? That would be another good excuse to go for those trio of stamps as well, wouldn't it? With those worker stamps, and that you, you know, you yeah. like to use to fill in the gaps, and Absolutely. the white gaps. The textures. This is it's the first. I think it's a new bundle. I don't think they've ever been together that way. Uh, it's the first time I've brought them in that configuration, but I use them so yeah. so much, you and that's what I, especially with are. these, you know, that they're going to work perfectly. Yeah. We'll bring the details up again for those actually, because they are well worth a look at these. So you've right, got your so. textural temptations extras and the decorative extras there. 58 individual stamps there. Again, if you've still got your five pounds, you still haven't spent it. This might be a way to spend it as well. So it's going to bring the price down to 30 pounds and 47 pence. That makes it just over ten pounds per stamp set, but break it down per stamp. Well, the for next to nothing, seven eight seven eight two five. Right, so I am going to watercolor on this one. How long have I got left? How many? Nine minutes. Phil. Nine minutes. We'll see. I'll I'll do it quickly, <laughs> or as quickly as I would normally do. So I'm looking for my other water brush, and here you are. So I'm going to go direct in with the lavender colour. That this is all from set. This is all from set four. Okay, lovely. So I'm going to go direct in with the lavender, but the blue is a little bit too dark for the middle of my uh, hydrangeas. So I'm just going to water that, okay, and then go over it. So uh, clearly, you don't need to spend a lot of time colouring this because it, the style of it is just so forgiving. But I like my hydrangeas to have. If I'm doing them this colour. I like them to have a little bit of blue in the middle of the lilac in the middle and obviously you can see the way I've designed it. You've, you've got little centrepieces so just do it on that. Okay. Really forgiving. And once again is that the hot press card stock that you've used? No this still? is this is just my pure white premium pure card. Pure white premium this. card. Yeah. Because you know what I'm like. Oh I know what you're going to say. Pure white. Yes. Pure white. Yes. Pure white. Yes. It yes. needs to, to match. Yeah. So if I was making a card and I was using the hot press watercolour card, if you're colouring the whole image, it doesn't matter because it's going to yeah. be coloured. But if you're going to see bits through it, you want it to be I the want same. it to match, darling. Yes. Right, here we go. So that's that. That's the blue. I'm going to go all over with the purple. 
and what happens is even on my basic uh, well I don't do anything basic but even on my regular pure white cardstock look it's blending the colors together it's, yeah. these pads are just so good you can so see the quality good. of the brush nib as well and I'm not actually doing anything am I I'm, I'm just going over the whole area it will be glittered within an inch of its life in a minute <laughs> <laughs> and then I can go back in with a bit more blue if I want to did you see in set four as well, we've got some really nice pinks as well as the nice greens You've got in some there. gorgeous, gorgeous pinks in there, Catherine. There's, you know Victorian Velvet? Yeah. There's one that's similar to that Is and there? it's absolutely oh. gorgeous, yeah. Oh. And I'm, I'm like that with greens as well. Um, I like pretty greens yes, and there are some nice. beautiful, beautiful greens in set four. Well, you've just seen me use that gorgeous yeah. olive one on that. To, on the rose. I'm just thinking with the hydrangeas as well because they come into so many different colours. You've got the, you've got tinges of green in hydrangeas, you get the pink, you get the blues, you get the lilacs and purples. Yeah. And I, actually there's no rules anyway is there? If you want no, brown absolutely. hydrangeas you can have absolutely. them. Absolutely. You can do, you can do whatever you want. So I'm just picking a few elements and just adding a little bit of colour um, just so it, it ties everything in together when I've stuck the card together. This is why these are so good. You don't need to worry about what you're doing or matching anything up. Six minutes is crazy. So that means hurry up, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> so I've just got to add a bit more, Lala. Would you believe it? Almost a quarter of the restock Julia's stock of the... Brain wow, me. that's the stamps, <laughs> has now gone. Look at that I look. keep wanting to say wow. I'm trying to stop myself because of the weekend wow, and it just sounds. <laughs> but you do want to say wow because it's just it's just flying again. Oh, now then you're back again at three o'clock, aren't you? I am Girl, indeed. I'm not sure what we're going to be doing, but I will be here. It's gone really quickly. Um, it's gone really quickly yesterday and today has gone so quickly. So clearly you would spend a little bit more time doing this. Just going to colouring it in but I don't want to get this card finished just so you get the idea from me. So on here I've used the um, double debossed octagons to create the base of this frame. I've used the Isla octagons to create the lacy part for the top to create that little border and I've got one of the same size in the double debossed look that is going underneath. So I'll just pop that on there. This is why I love nesting dies, because the ways you can use them are just incredible. Well, just looking at the eyelet there, just how thin that border is, and it, it just makes that, doesn't it, when you put it together? They're really pretty, Catherine, and this is they why, I mean, you know as somebody who designs products, but the, the, the gap between these circles is the smallest possible gap yeah. you could probably do yeah. with a die. Um, and importantly for me as a crafter, the circles are the same size all the way down to the smallest die yeah. and that's the same on all of the elegant eyelets. Now normally what would happen is you would design the biggest one and then just shrink it, shrink it, shrink yeah. it. I didn't. I had to do all the individual circles to make sure that they were the right oh, size. Wow. There is so much Because obviously I've got so much time that I can spend just doing circles on the computer. <laughs> <laughs> Well, but you've got precision. time because you're so organised now. It is true what you said earlier. When you've got organised, it saves you so much time. I can't tell you the hours I lose just because I've got boxes for one yeah. show, you know, demonstrating for a certain brand, and yeah, then I do another brand, and I need bits from that. slightly different for you because oh, you've got more, it's all over the place. more of a range. It's so hard. Yeah. I've been really, really, really brutal with my room at home. Everything that I don't use anymore or I'm never likely to use anymore has gone to the shop. Has it? I've just took it off and left it so they can sort of... So let's just pop that together, get this stuck together. And this that one is, is also beautiful. going on foam tape. Got the frame on yet. Four minutes, I might just get this done. I might you can just do it, get Phil. this done. You can do this. Speed crafting. This will be the first show I've done. One and a bit. Oh, now then, when it comes to the hot press card, we're at limited stock on that as well. Remember, this is such a good buy. Do go for this if you haven't done already while we've got that stock. A4 sheets, this is hot press, so you've got a lovely smooth surface. It's going to take those watercolour pens so beautifully, but also you're going to get such a crisp image from your stamps as well. 20 sheets is what you get in there, 017406. Now, don't forget, do you know, the gift we've purchased as well, 
just a reminder anything you buy and even if it's just the card stock as well you're going to get one of those wonderful i'm just going to pick those up again before i get told off wow. uh <laughs> could be a different color to the one i'm holding here there's nine different colors in total but one of these will be coming to you as well with your purchases just amazing to have those gifts as part of the birthday event of course as well remember if you've not spent your voucher yet your credit if you haven't spent it yet have a look at spending it on one of the options here as long as you're spending 25 pounds Phil, Three do you think we're going to do it? apparently. Right, so I'm doing the titivations now, Lord. I'm just doing the decorations. The so the, these are my berry branches that were released at Christmas. If you haven't got the berry branches, you're going to use them so, so much with these stamps because they just lend themselves to every one of the flower stamps. Yes, so um, I think they're on the show. I'm not sure. They I can't are. We remember. Can bring the details for you, actually. There we go. Four dies. And again, the magnetic sheet. Remember, that's important as well. 1599 one zero zero four one three so i'm literally just sticking the flowers on now i'm using glue gel rather than my white glue i always use the white i always do use at the minute this is my thing at the minute i'm putting my flowers on with glue gel and then lifting them up to tuck my leaves underneath which is what i'm doing normally because then it means i've got them in the right position if I've got time, oh, oh look! Now this is a oh. this is a fill card. It, it definitely is a fill card. You know, it's got a couple of little flowers on. Very pretty Just indeed. A couple. Don't forget, if you're adding anything into your baskets and you've already got that flexi basket open, you can split the cost on those as well. Oh, now then, Phil, you've got pearls in the centre of those I've flowers. Got to show we you haven't you even again. mentioned those. We've got ombre they, uh, pearls for you as well. Mine here. I'll show oh, them. Have I got time got them to in show front you? Of Phil? I don't know. We've got just over a minute and a half, Phil. Hopefully right. we have. But I think everybody's found them anyway. They are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You've got the velvet teal, go. the lime fizz, and the secret escape there. That there we go. So we've got stunning. we've gone from we've gone from this to the one that I did yesterday, look. So this is where we've gone from. The rose this morning. The daisy oh, one that I did yesterday that's got all that mixed media technique going on. And then we've gone to traditional Phil Pretty. That just shows you the versatility It really of these does. Stamps. And I love with the daisy one there, because that's the first time I've seen that. Those beautiful sentiment stamps as well, with different options of how to use them. What a lovely hour. Now, you are back at, at three, Phil, with our I am. Um, I'll be driving home then. So oh. I'll miss another show, won't I? Well, uh, you know, I mean, that's just... So, really but you know, I, I know it's going to be another fantastic show, almost a Thank third you, of the stock of the weekend. Wow, that's the extended stock has gone. Please, please, please check those baskets out. Don't wait until three o'clock because you might miss out on certain things. Oh, do you know, just keep shopping ahead with so much to see on the website. Don't forget that trio of stamps as well. If you can afford to go for that, go for the hot press card as well. That wonderful watercolor. Before that's gone, <laughs> the pens. Get in the queue for the pens. <laughs> oh, don't miss out on those either. <laughs> Just keep shopping. Phil, thank you so, so thank much. You. It's been I an absolute delight. It. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. So pleased to be back working with you again today. I have missed working with you because oh, it's been so you. long. We've got a lot more coming up, though, of course. Um, do stay with us. We've got some wonderful shows ahead, actually. We've got a good variation of shows as well for you. Still part of the birthday event. If you still haven't spent that credit, do look at doing that. Just... Spend it wiser, that's what we keep saying. <laughs> Spend it on this, amazing. Coming up next, we've got, of course, Janice and Hayley. I'm gonna give you the menu. I'm not going to say it again. It's the Fabazine One Day Special. Then we've got Crafting Celebrations with Cricket. I'll be back with Emma for that. And then Celebrate with Crafty Devils. Another lovely hour that was busy this morning. Do not miss out on those prizes. Dreaming of a crafty world, Dorothy and Wasabi slumber. Her Chanda's fifth birthday will be a time of wonder. Zuri, La Blanche and Orlan create. Wow and Rowan Dean, it's going to be great. Sentimentally yours, Clarity and John next door. Pink Frog and Daisy Chain, who could ask for more? We'll credit your account with £5 to spend. Seven days of celebrations, the fun will never end. One day specials with all of your favourite guests. All at a socially respectful distance from the Wicked Witch of the Hayley West. 
From fabric to paper, to glitter and pencils, pens and stamps, inks and stencils. Join us in August. Nowhere will be grander. Happy fifth birthday. There's no place like a chanda. If you love cake and you love to bake, we've got something you're going to enjoy. Here at Achanda's Crafty Kitchen, we'll be introducing you to brand new guest demonstrators from the world of baking and cake decorating, who will be on hand to inspire you with sugar flour making techniques, food flavoring ideas, baking kits in a bottle, and as well as showcasing some very fashionable kitchen aprons. Watch out for brand new products, some very bespoke to the baking world, but others you can utilize within the world of craft, which will allow you more flexibility between the different mediums. Intrigued? Well, set your temperatures, set your timers, and tune in every fortnight to see what's in the oven on The Crafty Kitchen. Chanda is five and I really hope you're enjoying our birthday celebrations. So continuing the festivities, we have another seven day saver to bring you these fan this is a great bundle. I mean a real essential. So Oakwood and Archer, what we have is a pair of uh, quality craft scissors. Everybody needs craft scissors in their life, but you've also got, and I have a pair of these at home, these serrated uh, micro scissors as well. So you micro serrated scissors, so they will chew through anything. They're really durable scissors, so another great addition into your crafty stash. But then we have our paper trimmer. So paper trimmer, obviously useful for your matting and layering. Can I just say though, it can do a lot more because it can also cut uh, at angles of 45 to 90 degrees as well. So 45 degree angles or 90 degree angles. So you're getting your trimmer. Your scissors are both sets there for $21.97, saving eight pounds. Your item number is 311412. And just a reminder, if you make any purchase on the live show during our birthday event, you will be eligible for a free gift. See full T's and C's on our web. Hi, my name is Blanche Siegmann. I'm the owner of the company La Blanche. The company La Blanche is a crafting company located in Germany. For over 20 years, I'm designing and selling stamps, paper crafting products and home decoration. As a passionate crafter myself, I make sure all our products are of highest quality and easy to use. We produce a whole range of products. We produce paper products. We have also shrink sleeves for your jars, glasses. We have home decoration products, paints and wall decals. Everything, the whole range of crafting we produce for you. I hope you enjoy watching us at Hochanda and crafting with La Blanche. I hope you are. We're celebrating five years here at Hochanda with a fantastic event which started on Wednesday. Oh my goodness, it did. And we're running all the way through the bank holiday. Now, did you notice you got a £5 credit into your account? Everybody did. Every customer got a £5 credit into their account. If you didn't know that, go and check it out because you can use that £5 credit on this show. So everyone got £5 credit and you get to use it once. And you could use it on this show to get your one day special, taking your one day special down to £35 because you've got that credit if you want to buy it in the full. Now if you're buying it via FlexiBuy you can't use that £5 purchase. It has to be £25 or more. But if you are dividing the cost of your one day special into two sittings of £20, well this is superb value for money. We have got the lovely Hayley Smith with us on the show. Hello Hayley. Hiya. How just, are you? I'm, I'm just um, top stitching a mug rug. 
She's busy, 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 because what we're going to and do is throughout, more the, demo. throughout the whole of the show, we're going to try and get all 12 projects that are in the book, in the Fabazine book, done, so you can see how they're put together. This is a marvellous collection of gifts for you or Christmas gifts for someone else. Now, all you need to do to pop these together is to get your sewing machine, your needles, and your thread because within your fabazine you get a panel that's going to give you all the elements to create and make all of these projects it's very very easy to navigate through you've even got a QR code where you can go and have a look at the videos so you can sit down with the patterns you can sit down and read it or you can go and watch it or watch these shows again superb value for money two payments of 20 pounds you're saving 10 pounds on that price and within that fabazine you are getting just shy of 28 pounds worth of projects a hundred did i say 28 i did <laughs> 128. I was so confident. I, I thought I told you. I said what, just shy of 128 pounds of projects. Let's have a look at some of them that you can make and create. Uh, we've got the pinny, the little apron here, which is lovely. In the panel, you've got the fabrics to put all of that together. So if you know someone that bakes, what a great gift that's going to be for them. Or it's a gift to yourself. We've also got now. This is Boris the Duck. Now, yes. Boris the Duck could be a doorstop, could he not, Haley? He could. Yes. Absolutely, he could. Um, and he's a he's a drinking duck, not he, a drunk duck. No, he's not drunk. He is just drinking. Yes. If, uh, if you watch the Instagram video on Frank's Instagram account where Frank meets Cup, then that will kind of explain why Boris is like that a little more. And also, that's what Frank does when he wants duck cuddles. He comes and sits on your lap and puts your head through your arm. Oh, I love Frank. Who's Frank, Hayley? Frank's my dog, and he's lovely. Oh, he's, he's absolutely gorgeous. Or she. She yes. might be well, a she. Sure. A little bit like myself. Uh, right, so we've also <laughs> got this fabulous, well, it's a pencil case. It's a toiletry bag. You could put your pens and this pencils in here. This is the one we're doing in the demo. And we're doing this in demonstration. It is an insidey, outy, outsidey, inny. Uh, bags, you can turn that all the way out to the outside and all the way back to the inside if you want to. And it's got a flat bottom, we love that. Uh, what else are we getting? Who Ooh, doesn't love a flat bottom? Your mug rug. Well, this is a mug in a hug, isn't it, really? Um, and you also get the pattern to make those flowers, those beautiful flowers. Not just the pattern, you get the fabrics. You get the fabrics for all of this. It's all on a huge panel for you. Right, moving on, what else are we getting? Now, this is interesting because we can twist, we can push, and it collapses it so it traps all your bits and bobs that you're working with. And then you can just make it bigger by pulling it back out again. Now, this is very, very handy. This is your card pouch, so you can put your card in here, your bus pass, your credit card, or maybe your pass if you go to work, for example, or you might want to put something else in there. It's entirely up to you. You've also got um, your template to build and create these clamshells as well, which some people find difficult to make, but you're not because you have got the templates to put them all together and the patterns to boot as well to build and create. We're still going. Now, this is your string arch. You get your MDF board. You also get the nails and then you get the thread as well to create your string art, which is fabulous. You, of course, you, of course, can paint the back of your MDF if you want to. We've still got more to show you. Um, now, these are, are these your mug hooks? They're, yes. They're the, the ones. So the mug that you saw with um, the rug on, this is what they're like. Uh, which is fabulous. Now, I must tell you that you can make two of these yes. from the panel, but if you... Double-sided yes. ones. But what Attractor's done there, who's uh, one of our lovely design team, is she's actually made four from what she had uh, because she's used the uh, just an extra piece of fabric. She's used a generic piece of red spotty fabric to use as the lining, and she's created four. She's added a couple of buttons on to hers as well. But, uh, yeah, you can absolutely make more from what's on the panel. As we've said earlier, the cushion, you could make, easily make two of those if you wanted to. Yeah, you certainly could. Uh, so you could make four of those. I love this. Now, the embroider doodle, you don't get the hoop, but what you do get is the prints on the fabric so you can start to embroider that beautiful design. You also get the threads as well. You do get the threads as well. The colours may vary in the threads. And there's another sample of that that Claire's done from our design team, and uh, that one's really pretty as well. It's just 
Um, obviously, Patty's thrown a lot of colour at that one. Claire's is a bit more simple. She's just gone kind of black and white with a couple of splashes of colour. And what's really nice, you can add some fabric paint to the back of that as well. Uh, so that's another project for you or a gift. You've also got uh, your cushions as well. So with the cushions using the templates, you can build designs like this using your own fabric, of course. And this is a cushion that you do get in the kit. Now, this is interesting because on the panel, you've got the front panel that you're seeing there. It's a really interesting technique as well. You've also got another panel which has a more of a cream background. Uh, so you could actually build two cushions from that if you want to. You've got some back backing fabric as well for one cushion. But if you've got your own fabric at home, you're going to make and create two of those fantastic cushions. Um, and you're also getting the organiser as well that we didn't see there. Um, and this is brilliant because you get to put your crafty tools in your organiser and you get that fabulous um, fabric as well. Just to show you, can I just quickly show the panel? Uh, you can see the panel here. So all your projects are right here. And of course, you've got lots of other elements on there as well. You've got all the little pieces of scrap that you could possibly use. As a soft crafter, you will know exactly what to do well, with those white bits of scrap you actually use in your um, cotton cushion because that's what you put underneath when you stitch over the top and rip the uh, top layer out to create a faux chenille so all those bits of scrap all get used up as well so you're going to use every single piece of it it's impressive isn't it it's impressive uh, right you also get some paper straws as well for your projects that you're putting together but all will become clear when we head over to Hayley and it works out to be three pounds and 33 pence per project yes Miss Smith I have Smith. a question you have a question yes yes if you were to use your five pound credit yes then how much would it be per project? It's As got to I be under three pounds it then. It could, yeah, because it would be 35 pounds if you're using your five pound credit that every customer received and you can only use it once if you've already used it. It works out to be two pounds and 92. So Boom. it's easy. There you yeah, go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> True value for money. So take advantage of that gift if you've not done so already and pop this into your basket like so many people are already doing your fabazine. Half the stock has gone. And as it says right there, hours of fun we've only got one hour in this show we've got another hour of four o'clock today but we're going to try and get all of the projects done within that time all have a purpose within the fabzine but it's all those little bits that you'd have to go and find like the elastic for the mug rugs like uh, the plastic the uh, paper straws for the the tulips it's all those little bits that are difficult to find you already get and what's nice is the whole project is right there delivered to your door. Now, if you want to go for the hoop, fabric and scissors that we've got available for you, it's a happy hour deal for this hour. £9.99, saving £5, a great deal as well. Do we know the size of the hoop, Hayley? Uh, it's a four-inch hoop. Four-inch hoop. 087134 is your item so number. That's your happy it's hour really deal. It's a really nice size for kind of stitching on the go kind of thing and taking little projects with you if you're travelling. Yes. Very um, nice. And if also, with that, remember, you get to get your uh, gift with purchase of your little bear panel, and that's a perfect size to use with that hoop. Yeah, it certainly is. And your gift with purchase is a beautiful bear panel. There it is. So once you've cut out all your elements oh, and no, placed... No, no. You, you don't cut them out. You don't? No. You stitch them first, secure the edges, so you uh, stitch them out. Stitch them first as, as, as a continuous piece because it's going to be much easier, especially if you're going to assemble it. Uh, stitch them first, then cut them out, do a little zigzag around the edges just to make sure nothing frays, then you stitch them together. So you embroider it first? Embroider it yes. first. Yes. When we say stitch first, this is what yes. we mean. Here's your teddy bear. You can see the fabric uh, panel. There you go, there's the a word panel. for you. The fabric panel. Um, you can see the panel with, you can with the pattern, pattern on, on there yeah. um, but it's, it's embroidered on so you've got that embroidery yes so before you cut out the elements and stitch them together you want to embroider that is correct do all the embroidery first because it's a lot easier 
to uh, keep it as a solid panel while you're stitching uh, all your embroidery on and then to cut it down after. If you have just joined us, that wasn't the teddy bear talking, that was our lovely Hayley. And off to Hayley we go. Uh, one day special though, saving £10, busy, half the stock gone. Right, Hayley? Okay, so we are going to do uh, the kind of makeup bag, it could be a wash bag, it could be anything that you want to put into it really. And um, This one looks like a complicated one because it starts off as a very peculiar shape, but it's all going to be fine in the end and the sample that we've done we've done with the kind of beige side facing out but this other one we're going to do with the uh, colored side facing out so it's up to you which way around you want it and in your kit you are going to get um, a cream zip I think in the picture it's it's showing as a beige one but then we decided the cream one actually went a bit better so we swapped them for cream ones so uh, first step is whichever is going to be your outer fabric you need to pop that onto a piece of batting and just I've stitched all the way around the edge just with um, what we call a basting stitch so that's the widest or longest stitch that your machine can manage all the way around and then just secured it on and then I'm just going to cut away the excess of that batting now I tend to uh, put it on first and then cut the batting because as, no matter how many pins you put in, something always tends to shift a little bit when you do this. So it's much, much easier to um, I find a slightly bigger piece. This piece that I started off with was a fat quarter of batting. It reminds um, me of an aeroplane. If, that's actually, it. Yeah, just as it is on, well, once you've cut round it. Oh, once I've got this piece off, there yeah. you go. Can you see that at home? It does look like an aeroplane. With the propellers at the front, the two wings, and then the wing tail. Oh, the tail at the back. Yeah. Okay. It's, Either that or a hammerhead shark. If it was skinnier, shark. then yes, I'd give you it. Or longer wings. Yeah, maybe. Well. Okay. Ready. Right. We're going to put it together. Not his so, wings weren't that big. What are you supposed to do with this? Is Yanis in? Oh no, he's just as bad. Um, <laughs> Catherine. Where's Catherine? <laughs> Catherine's having to lie down after <laughs> Phil's show. <laughs> well, not in that She'll way. She's having to lie down with Phil, is she? <laughs> <laughs> Casting rumours here. Well, good oh, work, Janet. Janet. <laughs> Just to clarify, they're laid down separately. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Moving okay, on. so um, you, the piece that's going to be your outer piece, that goes down first, and that's the one that we've attached to the batting. Next is your zip. You're getting a zip that's longer than the edge that you're going to attach it to, and that's just because life is an awful lot easier to put in zips when they're a little bit longer, because you can take that zipper piece right out of the way. So we're going to pop that piece in next, and then face down, this piece goes over the top, and it's really important to make sure that you've got these edges lined up completely, so it's entirely on top of there. So we're just going to pop a couple of pins in to keep that in place and then we're going to stitch this side in and then it starts to all get a bit wibbly and confusing. Well, I'm saying wibbly and confusing. This isn't a difficult bag to do. It's actually just three um, lines that you're sewing. You're sewing either side to get the zip in. Once you've sewn the zip in, we'll, you'll get a kind of a tube going a bit like that. Once you've done that, you're sewing this end to this end so those two bits of the zip will be joined together and then after that you're just sewing up those sides so you've got four sides to sew together but we'll okay. put it we'll try and get it all together in an hour now so, Hayley if I'm a beginner um, this... I would say do this project as one of the later ones if you're a complete beginner leave this one till a little bit later but it's something but I'm going it's to definitely achievable to. Yes. oh yeah it's definitely achievable maybe not use the bright red thread for it though let's just switch that to a beige one there we go There's a world record for speed threading machines. Well, that was pretty quick. I was impressed. <laughs> Until <laughs> this bit. Until this bit. Yeah. It's because um, um, they make me put sticky tape on the lights. So you can't really see what's going on. But there you go. I'm in. We're good. Good, good, good. Right. There we go. And we're off. So this is the one we're going to do first. Now, let me see if I've got a, a zipper foot in here. Ah. Oh, there's so many feet in here. There we go. Ah, there we go, there we go. That's the one. So, this, um, there's lots of different types of zipper feet. This particular one comes with this machine. And all you're looking for is something that's got a channel in it. Because what I'm going to do is put the foot on the machine and then that channel 
is going to allow the zip to slide through. So I'm not fighting and I'm the, you know, it's not rocking against the zip. So I can then get the needle to go down the side of there. So that's the one we're going to use. Let's just ping that off. What would happen if I didn't have one of those feet? Um, if you have haven't foot. got one of those feet and you can't move your needle left and right, then I would probably say it is worth investing in the correct kind of foot because it's just going to make your life so much easier. Okay. And you put it back to the middle. And yep, that's pretty good. Okay. So we're going to sew this as a straight line. And what's going to happen is the foot that we've put on is going to help us to guide that. I'm just going to straighten that edge up before I start. There we go. The foot that I've put on is going to help us guide that. And I'm using the edge of the zip here running against the edge of the foot. And then that's going to keep everything nicely in line for us as we sew straight along the top here. Let's just take that one out. Ooh, a bit giddy there. Let me get that thread out of the way, that's better. Okay, and then we can take this one out. Do you and always just, pin? Uh, I, if I'd brought the tape, I would have taped them, because we've you? got some um, what we call pins on a roll which is uh, like a double-sided sticky tape, not yeah. for fabric. And that kind of holds everything in place for you without having to pin, because especially with zips, pins tend to distort yes. the way that your um, fabric and your zip falls in. But by using the, uh, the sticky tape option, that tends to make it a little bit easier. So, right off the end, and we'll take that out. So that's our first side, and then we're going to repeat exactly the same process. So that's our first part of the zip in. Then we're going to repeat exactly the same process with the other side. So face up, zip face down, and this is the point where we need to be matching up. Now it's better to go from the bottom corner because obviously the top corner has now been turned to accommodate that zip. So I'm going to match that up exactly because we don't want it to be offset when we come to it later. Let me just fold that back out the way. And then the top one. So what I've ended up with is a folded in half lining piece and then a folded in half front piece. Okay. So I'm going to again pin all that into position and sew that straight edge all the way across there. And that's going to create our second piece. Now, this bag matches perfectly with the organiser that you also get as part yes. of your projects. And that's also on the panel. So you see there we've got the projects. And this is what your organiser is going to look like when you put it together. It's very cute. And it will go with your bag as well. So maybe this could be for some paint brushes. It could be for your knitting needles. And then well, maybe your bag. It's could upside down. That's it, otherwise the stuff was going to fall out. So um, when I made this, first of all, um, I realised I actually had space enough on the panel to give you a second strip. So you can either make the pockets quite twice as deep, or you can make two rows of pockets to go on there. Okay. That's it, you've got it, and it'll stand up like that. Oh, yeah. So and there's a little press stud included in the kit to be able to keep it shut and to open it up and... It tells you where to put the press stud so you can kind of have it open or closed still using the, the single press stud. And that matches the bag that you're making now? Yes, it does. It's perfect. Yes, it does. It's a slightly different pattern, but it's all the same colours, so it's absolutely fine. Right, so that's pinned in place, and then I'm just going to do exactly the same as I did before, run that straight edge. And there you can see at the edge, I've got all of these sides lined up so that when I come to do the next piece or the next step, that everything's in the right place. So let's get this one in. And then. So this is fab fabazine yeah. number three, isn't it? Yes, Hayley? it is. And there's been two others previous. There are two others. Mm. So, They're also um, available. We started these in April, and this is one of the things that when we first got the printer that I wanted to do, but it's just taken us a little bit of time to get round to be able to do it properly. Um, and it, it takes, a, we, they do them every two months because it takes that long to actually put them together because you've got to make all the projects, you've got to test all the projects, you've got to make all the projects again. 
Oh, and we do actually, you know, I do actually do that. We do um, test them and, and redo them because yeah. there's a whole selection of uh, reject ducks <laughs> here. <laughs> oh, they, you know, we you tried them in different colours, we tried them in different kind of uh, formats, oh. but uh, yeah. Sorry, reject ducks. Oh, those ducks didn't make it. No, they didn't. They did Bless not make them. the cut. <laughs> <laughs> but, that, that, you know, it, we do actually test the, all the patterns and but make sure that we, we can get them to work. And, you know, it's, it's no point in me making something, uh, you know, absolutely beautiful that nobody can replicate. Yeah. Because then it's, it's absolutely pointless. So but we no do ducks try were and harmed in the making of the ducks that didn't no, make it? No, no ducks were harmed in the making of the reject ducks. <laughs> Maybe they could be cuddly toys for it's Frank. It's made Meg really sad, that. <laughs> I don't... I, I don't... Oh. <laughs> They're not such ugly ducklings. They're lovely. OK. I don't know if I should say this, but I have a, I have a, a drawer full of teddy bear heads as well. <laughs> OK. You know how you make them? The Confessions like, oh, of Hayley Smith. I'm not sure that looks quite right. I've got a whole drawer full of bear heads. <laughs> Big ones, small ones? Uh, no, they're all about the same size. They just uh, just have where I've they kind of varied the pattern. Right. So I've um, <laughs> I've turned this the what would be the right side out now, just so you can kind of get your bearings and see where you are. So we've added that dip it uh, the zip in, and then the next step is to join these pieces together. So this piece is going to join onto here. But the way you need to do it is you need to join the outer piece together and then flip it around and join the inner piece together. Okay. And while you're doing that, remember to move your zip back into the middle, because if you join that while your zip's still out here, you're not getting your bag open. So um, we're going to do that now. So we'll do both ends. So I'll put it inside out again so we can see where we're going. And all the instructions are laid out for you. So you've yes, got the yes, pattern on the panel. So that's done for you. The instructions are really easy to follow in your fabazines. You can see just here. And then you will get ah. to your end result. Ah, what so I lots should of have said is when you are sewing these on, you need to stop a quarter inch before the end. So let me just unpick a couple of stitches there. So that's all I need, just a quarter inch before the end. And the same on this one because we don't want to um, stitch the backing into the or the lining into the front side at the same time. So let me just, again, unpick three or four of those. That should do me. That's fine. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is add this side to this side. Now, I'm going to just put a little crease in so I find the center because everybody puts zips in slightly differently and some people may have left uh, quite a large seam allowance on the zip. Some may have put a little bit less. So we've left you wiggle room on either side of here. So you've got a little bit of extra fabric on either end. So center it up with the zip, pin those in place, and then stitch all the way along, keeping that lining fabric out the way as you do. And then you can always take that excess off later, but it's very, very hard to add it back on if you haven't got it. So okay. we've been quite generous and uh, just made sure that it is a workable project. So I'm going to kind of fold those bits out of the way Oh, I need to swap my foot back to a normal one because I've still got the, the zipper foot on there. there now, you whilst you start stitching, uh, let's have a quick recap of your one-day special as we're getting very, very busy. What a fantastic way to get your 12 projects in your magazine. You get the panel as well, so you've got all the fabric, everything you need, and all the components as well. As Hayley said, rather than fishing around trying to find those extra components to put the projects together, you're getting them included in the deal. You can divide the cost into two. Two monthly payments of £20. If you're a Freedom member, there's no PMP to pay. And do go and check out the brand new prices on Freedom membership as well. If you've got a £5 credit in your account, as every customer did at the start of the birthday celebrations on Wednesday, and you haven't used it yet, you can use that credit if you buy your Fabazine and your projects 
in the one price of 39.99 without dividing the cost into two months it works out to be 35 pounds then that is an incredible deal with the panel with all the projects that you can put together we've got them in front of us here you can make you can learn and you've also got a chance to give these away as gifts as well we've got that lovely apron maybe you know someone that bakes maybe you know someone that likes to wear a penny that doesn't have a penny well here's a penny and you could embroider someone's name on there if you want to what was that, Hayley? I'm in trouble with Paola because I didn't make her a penny and Adam got one. Oh, Adam got a penny? Yeah. Adam got a penny. And Paola wanted a penny but she didn't get a penny? Yeah. I don't get a penny. You didn't get a penny, no. Sorry. It's all right. Can I do a, a vital piece of information while I'm sewing this together? Yeah. And just uh, ignore the penny gate. Uh, <laughs> So I've done the same on this end. I've creased it. Now this is the end that has the actual zipper in. And remember I said you need to pull that inside before you stitch it just to make sure that uh, you can open your zip once you've got it together. What I'm actually going to do is just uh, crack a couple of pins in here first. So I've got one either side just to hold that in place. So I've got that in the right location before I go ahead and open that because otherwise you may leave this too wide or too narrow when you put your zip in so it's worth pinning them then opening that zip and now sorry I interrupted you you may crack on and I shall uh, there <laughs> well, I don't and you've mind. got to say the important bits absolutely that's the bits you'll get stuck on absolutely you don't need to apologize to me you don't need to apologize to me to them maybe not to me i'm only <laughs> to kidding. them definitely <laughs> <laughs> uh, right uh so we've got boris who is a wonderful doorstop um or it could be nice a nice little cuddle toy for somebody if you want it to be um then we've got oh this is the bag that Haley's making so this is the bag that you can turn inside out or outside in with its flat bottom which is great for storing your crafty items We've also got your mug rug. It's a mug in a hug, isn't it? It's fantastic. I love that. And you get to make two of those or more if you're thrifty with your fabrics. You've got some more fabrics to add. Then you can also make the flowers, the tulips that go in there because you have those on the panels. And you also have the um, paper straws to put inside those stems to make them stand up taut. You've got the thread catcher as well. You can twist and collapse that and you can twist and bring it back up again. So that's intelligent, you get the components to make that. You've got your car card pouch, and in this you can pop your credit card, you could put your bus pass in there, your ID, your driving license, or something special to you. Maybe a lottery ticket. Uh, you've also got your templates to make your clamshell, so you can build and create your own quilts or cushions, or items of clothing maybe, or bags with that particular pattern on there. You've also got your pin art or your string art, so you've got your little pins that go in, they're more like nails, you hammer them in, so you will need a hammer for that. You've got your MDF boards and then you've also got the thread to start creating your string art. It's a bit like Cat's Got the Cradle, isn't it? Um, and then you've got, all oh, those are the uh, mug rugs again, so that's how you can make four if you've got some extra fabric got different designs and you'll have to add your own buttons to those as well um, now this is your embroidered doodle uh, which is brilliant I love this because you get to learn some new stitching and you get to create something rather spectacular at the end of it as well uh, stitch guides to work with so you get two um, beginner two intermediate and two advanced stitches for you to have a go at that's right you, you get video your running stitch all of them and then if you obviously if you want to add you know do your own thing that's absolutely fine it's just we give you a starting point yeah so you've got those your beginner your intermediate and your advanced there in the um, magazine you've also got a QR code as well that you can use your smart devices on. You can go watch a video of how to do that as well. So you're learning, learning, learning along the way. So you can also use your templates to make cushions as well, which is a nice design. It could be a cushion, it could be a bag, using your own fabrics, but this is a template that you're getting. And you've also got the opportunity to make this cushion. In fact, you've got that particular pattern in two color tones, so you can make two cushions if you want to. You've also got the backing panel as well. And all of the white salvage that you use is going to be used on the cushion to make that lovely 
effect all will be revealed in the book when you get it home now over 65 percent of the stock has gone you've also got your free gift as well which is the panel to make your embroidered teddy bear so do the embroidery before you cut out the elements of your teddy bear before you stitch him together 507152 is your item number and you get uh, all your projects and how much were they again three pounds 33 pence per project but if you are using your five pound credit then it brings it down to two pounds and 92 pence that's incredible value for money uh, if you're not dividing the cost by two you can use your five pound credit if you are dividing the cost by two two very very easy payments of 20 pounds but you can't use your five pounds on your flexi buy just to let you know now we've got Frank and friends. Yes, Frank and friends. Here we go. So in this particular project, you get to make this fabulous bag, but you also get the fabric to do so because it comes in a panel. These panels are so handy. They really are. You've also got your project to make your little purse. Love that. There's Frank and his friends. Let's show you the back of that as well because you've got Frank and his friends on the back. And then you've got your scissor holder, which is brilliant, your zippy pouch. Um, I think that's superb. That's your zippy pouch and your um, scissors. For your scissors, you get your felt, your zip. You also get your wadding to create your bag. You've got the magazine there so you can follow all the patterns. They're in there. And it comes with your panel. And on top of that, you get 13 appliques of your ducks, which is brilliant on your panels, you can see there. So there's so much that you can make and create with that. It's absolutely quackers. And what a great deal it is as well. So that's the panel that will come with that particular kit. 779364 is your item number. Saving £3 is £21.99. Now, if you want Frank with your one day special then you're keeping £10 saving on your one day special your £3 saving on your Frank and Friends and then a further £3 saving for buying them both together that's a great deal and your flexi is 29.49 which means you can use your £5 credit on your first flexi payment 03236 376 is your item number if you want to go for Frank and Friends and your issue number three of your Fabazine, which is an amazing deal. It really is for all the projects and gifts to yourself or to your loved ones. This could be Christmas all wrapped up. Uh, 032 376 is your item number. Right, let's have a look at a seven day saver and it's a surprise as to who it is. <laughs> Well, indeed, it's a Chanda's fifth birthday, and have we got some seven-day savers for you. This is just one of them, though I've got a few seconds uh, to tell you why we're here. We are talking about organza fabric, 29 centimetres by 25 metres. Now, you can take a pick and mix of any two of the colours that I've got in front of me. We've got things like the red, the deep Christmas red. You've got the emerald green. We've got the gold in there. You've got the rose gold as well. You've got the white and the silver as well. You're saving £7 on these, the price. £17.99 for any two of 25 metres in length. 426152 is your item number. And any purchase during the live hour, you will also receive a free gift as well. Terms and conditions are all on the website. Don't miss out on another cracking little birthday present. Now, which one shall I have? Which one are you going to have? That's the question. It's great to have your company this morning. I hope you're well. Celebrating five years here with Hochanda. So I yeah, hope you're having a lovely day and taking advantage of all the great deals that we've got for you. Now, within the hour, we've got a happy hour, which is a deal for this hour and this hour only. And Hayley has it with her. I have it, yes. So uh, the happy hour for this hour is a uh, nice little embroidery set, really. You've got the fabric. Now, pink's quite unusual to get in an embroidery weight fabric. It's usually always white or cream. So uh, quite unusual to get a pink. And then you've got that four inch hoop, which is brilliant for doing smaller projects, especially things like the, the bear panel, which you'll be able to get. The bear panel on its own is usually 9 99 So if you've got the happy hour yes, and the bear panel, you're all set. Because the hoop, of course, doesn't have to be a project itself to hang no. on the wall. It's actually oh, a yeah, tool it's a to function, use, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's a tool, this one. So uh, you've got the little embroidery scissors as well, which are serrated. And they're really good because if you're going to cut kind of embroidery floss and things, the serrations actually kind of hang on to the floss rather than smooth blades, which it, the floss tends to kind of roll out. So they're really, really good. They've got a little sharpener on the back, so you can sharpen your blades. And they've got a little... Um, uh, 
case on the elastic as well so you can't lose it i think that's <laughs> a, do, do you know what I, i'd get that just for the scissors i would i would buy this just for the scissors 9.99 saving five pounds it's a happy hour deal for this hour definitely worth popping into your basket zero eight seven one three four and if you do put that into your basket with your one day special and divide the cost of that into two that would that qualify for I your five pounds would. because your flexi needs to be 25 pounds then essentially you're getting that for a five well i know it, you see sneaky. that's what i'm thinking nice. and every customer had a five pound <laughs> credit going to their account so if you've not used it and you want to use it that's a good plan as long as the first flexi buy payment is 25 pounds so i'm not sure if it's 24.99 just make sure just to clarify I think it just put it into your basket and see because it's 9.99 <laughs> so it might be a penny shy um, but give it a go what do you know that's what they say uh, well, your one day special full of ins always things mm -hmm. like the end of call offers which are we've got art boards and uh, I think we've got the letters and lots of other bits and pieces end of call offers so you might be able to put because I think the A5 art boards are like a pound or something now so there's a good idea that might sneak it up that's yeah don't yeah, do that. yeah end of call those little added additions that's good thinking good thinking okay. uh, right what we're gonna have a look at Hayley I'm gonna finish off the bag so we put the zip in we have sewn those end pieces together so we've sewn the, the bit with the zip to the bit that's at the bottom and now we've got these kind of pieces left on the side so I've essentially got the bag inside out there's the the bag there that's the lining of the bag that's currently at the top um, and what we're going to do is close up these side pieces now if you want to add a handle to it I had a handle that went with it here it is you do get a handle piece within there as well so the handle piece that you get is um, is quite long because you can make it as big or as small as you wish the intention for the handle piece is to fold it in half and then we'll just snip this in half and then we're going to put it face to face and so all the way down both sides and then turn it right side out to create a handle now there's enough handle here that if you want to you can make one for each side obviously that needs to once it's sewn go on the inside like that to create the little handle you can have no handles you can have two handles you can have one handle you're looking for that bit that's the bit in the middle isn't it no it's a bit at the bottom down oh there. it's a bit at the bottom bit at the bottom similar to uh, that bit, no, bit on the other side under the duck Got you. That bit. Got, Got it. you. Okay. <laughs> I like to. I'll I like to know where everything is. <laughs> I'm spotting everything on the panel uh, because I like so, to know where everything is. Uh, that, I mean, that's very simple. Isn't in the instructions. It tells you how to put those handles in if you want to. But what we're going to do now is just close up these gaps. So what you're going to do is there's a little, the little corner piece that kind of formed, uh, you know, the bit between the propellers and the body of the plane the, when and it was tail, flat on yes. your counter it looked like a plane and then yes. between the wings and the body of the plane there are two little kind of corners there and then what you're going to do is just pull those apart to create the straight line that's that little extra piece that we left you just in case you were a little bit out on your zip that can be cut off so what you're going to do is line that up with the shorter piece that is we know is correct and then we're going to stitch all the way along there and then trim off that excess so you're going to do all four sides on your outer piece which at this point is the one with the batting on the back of it and then you're going to do three out of your four on this piece here because we need to leave one remember to turn it right side out got you so i am going to go and do, go ahead and do those now and quickly see if we can get this done within the hour now all of the instructions are in the booklet uh, for your projects. You can of course watch these shows again. They'll be available for you on Rewind. Haley is trying to get all 12 projects done by the end of Final Call. And Final Call is at 4 o'clock today. So have a think about Christmas gifts. Have a think about maybe gifts that you want to give people in your lives at the moment that perhaps have done something for you or supported you. This is a good way of getting 12 projects that could potentially be gifts, potentially gifts that you don't have to go out and buy. 
because you're making them. You're getting all the essential elements to build and create each one of these projects. So you don't have to think about going off to get the paper straws. They're included. Those paper straws are for your flowers, for example. You might want to add some buttons to perhaps the um, mug rugs. These buttons have been added. If you've got buttons, you could do that if you wanted to. Uh, but this is what it looks like when you place it on a mug, which is fabulous. I love that. Nearly, oh, my goodness, 70% of the stock has now gone. I think you're waking up this morning thinking about projects to do over the next couple of weeks, maybe thinking about the fact that Christmas, well, it is, it's not that far away, but it kind of is. I don't like to start talking about Christmas too early, but in the crafting world, we start talking about Christmas in June and July because you guys make things. You make your crafts and then give them as gifts. So this is going to be a great way of producing 12 fabulous gifts, whether it be a cushion, a penny, whether it be flowers, organization, for example, a wall hanging, if you want it to be, maybe a doorstop, you know, somebody that needs a doorstop, maybe you know somebody that wants a quilt and you could make them one by using the templates that you're getting in that deal. So your magazine and all of the hardware that you're getting is right there. So all of your essentials are coming with it. So that's your magazine. You've also got uh, your straws in there. I'm just going to bring that out for you. You've got your um, nails in there for your string art. You've also got your embroidery thread. So you can do that embroidery on that fabulous uh, project. So all of that included, and the zip, don't forget, you get that. All of that included so that when you get your panel and your magazine, you can start cutting out all the individual elements and then you can start making and creating. The cushion, by the way, this is what I meant by the fact that you can actually make two, because the top part here, you've got the darker part of the cushion. Let me just pick this one up and show you. I'm gonna bring it to you, so there you go. So that's the cushion there, and that's the backing fabric on that particular cushion. But if you've got extra backing, you could have another cushion. You can have an envelope back in. It's going to be, this could be the first cushion you've ever made. And then you've got the chance to have two. You could have those on either side if you want to, which then frees up your backing panel. So you've kind of got an extra there, haven't you, if you think about it in that way. Um, your lovely organizer and the bag that Haley's making, well, they match because you've got those two elements together. And if I just lift up the base of the panel, once you've had a look across, if I just lift this up here, you can see there's, there you go, there's Boris the duck, there's the bag that we're working on at the moment, and your other elements. So it's all there in that one panel. You're not going to lose anything. It comes to you in one piece, which is fantastic. And of course, the magazine and all of the extras to make and create your projects. That is issue three, brand new today. Uh, we've also got a bundle of issue number one and issue number two. If you think this is great value for money, you might want to add these to your basket as well. Because at the end of the day, it's not just a magazine, it's the projects and the kits that you are getting. So, uh, issue number one and issue number two, together, two payments of $39.99. Some real funky style projects in that one. Uh, 401 394 is your item number. You've got Scotty Dog Bunting. You've got a pencil case. You've got a hippo in there. You've also got uh, some embroidered doodles. You've got a floppy, um, a floppy turtle. That's it. A floppy turtle. I know it's early in the morning, but it's floppy and it's a turtle. Uh, you've got a bag in there. You've got, yes, the embroidered doodles in there. You've got a fabulous panel that you can create and make into uh, storage. It's got a lovely uh, design on there as well. Um, so with that, that's £242.82 pence worth of projects. My word, that is incredible value for money. Now, we've got about 10 minutes left of the show. Let's head back to Hayley. Okay, so I have got almost all of these done. So all I've done is uh, do all of the ones on the outer and I'm on my last couple on the inner and I'm just taking those corners, pulling them apart and then lining up that top edge, giving it a, a little pin in there and then one in the bottom edge. And remember, you're gonna have that little bit of excess there. That's just to give you a little bit of wiggle room when you put your zip in and that we are gonna trim off before we turn it right side out. Let me just put these on the other side so you can see. There you go. And then I'm gonna sew all of these in. I'll sew this last one and then we'll get it flipped right side out so you can see the 
finished result. Let me just pull that pin out because it's getting caught in the it's getting caught in the outer piece. There we go. That's better. So you're just doing straight lines. It looks like a really complicated piece when you initially see it because it is a bit of a strange shape, but you're only doing three different sides. You're putting the zip in, you're joining the either end of the zip to the base piece that forms the kind of one side uh, of the bag and then to form the other edges you're just bringing these up just kind of splitting splitting them at the corners and pulling them apart to create those straight edges to sew and then that that's it it's as simple as that you just reverse a little bit on there and done and then if I, I've got, I've still got two more to do because I know we've only got 10 minutes. So I'm going to turn this one right side out. So really important that you leave your zip open before you start this. Yeah. <laughs> because if you've closed your zip, you're going to be in bother. Uh, but we're going to flip this right side out through there. And then you can always close that inside gap just by um, folding, pressing those edges in at the seam allowance and just adding a top stitch to it. So this is my on this one this particular one this darker side is my lining and this one is my outer so let's just get these corners pushed out there you go and that, because i had a little bit of extra space there is actually uh, a little panel with some extra ones of the geometric designs on there as well. So if you wanted to applique a few of those on, especially if it was the planar side, down by the duck. Oh and yeah, got I see it. it. Yeah. Well, this, is, this is like it's like a game, isn't it? You just oh there it is. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah, so I, I added some of these in just so you could add them onto the front. So if you wanted to use the planar side and wanted to embellish it, you absolutely can. So on the panel, yeah, you've got four, haven't you? Yes. 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 So let me just turn that right side out. So there you go. Oh, I see. I'm just—I was just looking at the sample I've got because I've. Because you've got the one with the handle on. Well, I'm because when you the... add the handles, the handles will come into here. Yes. And you add those before you sew these side seams because you're going to catch that handle within the side seams when you throw it up. When you sew, throw it up, when you sew it up. <laughs> when you throw it up, I was just about to say I was looking at my bottom uh, rather than my sides. Uh, that's why I was looking at the different uh, fabric, which is on the bottom. But it's a yes. lovely bag. So because the bottom one, um, the bottom on that one has got these patterns on, that's yep. why we've left you a few of those to add onto the front maybe as a bit of a plique. And I would do that right at the beginning before you assemble it. Yes. Rather than adding them on after. I think you need to stitch this one up, Hayley. Yes, all right. <laughs> just, just saying, Shh. just saying. Um, but it's, it's lovely, isn't it? Um, oh, our lovely producer, Meg, she's saying, let's have a look, let's have a look. Um, oh, yes, yes. Looks like a little penguin with the little arms out oh, okay. at the side. Oh, I'm, I'm with you. The little, <laughs> little head on it. Oh, that would be cute. Uh, and by the way, you know how... Do you want to sit and draw eyes in the mall, then that's up to you. <laughs> if I want to what? If you want to sit and draw eyes in the mall, then that's well, up to you. Do you know what? I would. I would. Um, you know how we sit and chat about our producer oh. and director here? Yes. Uh, on Hochanda. Oh, do it. Go on. And you guys at home, you hear names. And when yeah. you hear names, do it. you get do images it. in your head. Do you want to see our lovely Meg and Hannah? You don't? Oh, well, never mind. Do you mind. hear now they're, um, uh, they're choosing to ignore us now and uh, yes. having other conversations? Um, uh, we've, we've actually got a camera in the gallery. Um, and here they are. There they are. Hi, Meg. Hi, Hannah. Oh, so you've got a nice quilt there in case anybody yeah, gets what's cold. That what's that quilt? I that's think spring? that's because of the air con in case that's anybody gets nice, cold. Nice, nice quilt. Nice quilt. Anyway, that's the guys in the gallery. Um, right, Hayley. Okay. You've got I, the finished piece just how, there. How long have I got? Have why, I got? why is yours different to mine? What do you mean? Well, mine's a different shape to yours. Well, because I poked all the corners out. <laughs> because yours is squashed. No. If you poke all the corners Hang out on. properly, then that's the shape you should get. It's almost like a it's like an upside down loaf of bread. Oh, Isn't I see. Like yes, a... let me just poke my things out. It's like a toaster. That's what it looks like. It In does. my head, it looks like a toaster. Hang on. 
There, there yeah, you, you just had, didn't have your corners poked there out. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Oh, Brilliant. Goodness. Poked it out. It looks that fine. That looks better on that. Side. Um, anyway, right. right. Um, have we got enough time to do um, string art? Yes. Or can we start at this hour and then do it next hour? Yes. Okay, I'll go and get my bits. I'm, ju I'm just saying yes. Okay, I'll go and get my bits then. I need you to do some numbers while I go get my oh, bits. You want me to do something now? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. In cheap bossy. <laughs> right. Th three quarters of the stock. <laughs> She's still chuntering away, everybody. Have we cut a mic yet? Yeah, good. Uh, <laughs> right, three quarters of the stock has gone of your Fabazine. And in your Fabazine, you get 12 projects. You get the panel and you get all the essential bits to place your projects together, including the paper straws so you can make and create your flowers. Those are here, so lovely tulips, for example absolutely delightful. You also get your threads for putting together on your embroider doodle uh, and that's really nice that's got some fabric paint in the background you might want to do that. Uh, you can make and create your doorstop, your duck, your drinking duck, uh, not a drunk duck, a drinking duck uh, and his name is Boris that's really nice that's a penny that you're seeing just there. Uh, so if you like baking or if you need a little penny to wear for whatever reason, you've got one there. We're going to take a look at the nail art in a moment's time with our Haley, And you get a cushion to make. You get templates for your quilt as well. The templates, let me just grab those and show you. And there you go. Uh, string art. Na I used to call it nail art, sorry. Um, here's, here's your templates. Actually looks like a... Oh, yeah, it's bending it into a pram. It looks like a pram. It looks like a pram. Or... If I turn it that way, a frog. Okay. Two eyes and his mouth. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Okay, it's getting weird now. It's getting weird now. Um, Hayley, are you ready? It's not been weird, mate. Pardon? It's never not been weird. Oh, it's never not been weird, no. No, but that's a good thing. Yeah, it's fine. It's a good thing. I'm happy with it. It's a good thing. I'm happy um, with it. What are you doing now, then? Bashing nails in. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very sure that... straightforward this one. Uh, initially, all you're going to do is add a load of nails in, and you get, I think it's 50 odd nails in there. So, um, I've actually got one of our pieces of um, the A5 boards, the ones that are the end of call offer. These are well worth adding to the back of here just to add a little bit more depth to get your nails in. So, you've um, got the art already on there, haven't you? Yeah, it's all it's all kind of etched on there, so it's it's ready for you as a guide. All so we're going to watch doing... you hammering nails for the next ten minutes. Well, is no, that what the, we're doing? well, luckily we're at the end of the show, <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to hammer three or four in, okay. and then I'm going to uh, do the rest in between the hours. Watch your fingers. Watch your fingers, please. I am doing it carefully. It's fine. You worry me. <laughs> You worry me. You worry me more. <laughs> I, I worry myself. Don't you be worried but about me. I worry about myself. Because you've got little etched lines in there. What you'll find is the kind of the ends of the nails will kind of lock into little corners of it. So that will kind of help you out. You see there's a little corner there. Okay. And it'll kind of lock in and help you out for holding them because obviously they are quite small. The other thing you can do is if you've got um, a scrap piece of wood or a scrap piece of MDF that's about half the thickness of the nail, if you just put a little notch in it, you'll be able to hold the nails while you bash them in. So I'm, I'm going to see if I can get that one in there. I know there. this might sound a daft question. You've probably done this quite a few times. But as you're hammering that nail in, Oops. yes, you only need to tap it a couple of times, don't you? Yes. You don't yes. need to go mad. It doesn't yeah. need to go all the way through. You're really looking just to get it um, far enough in so it secures, so you can kind of pull the um, thread against it and it not come out. But you don't want it yeah. in so far that you've gone right through the board. Is that MDF or hardwood? It's um, MDF. MDF. So you just one. want it to nibble. Yes. The MDF. Well, ideally, you want it to go kind of through till you can feel it on the back. And if you've got a spare piece of MDF, I would actually put that on the back, and we'll go a little bit further through with those, so it actually bites into the next piece. <laughs> Sorry, do you know the image I've just got of you? Oh. Then? <laughs> you know, a judge with the big long <laughs> wig at the side. Order. Order! That's rude! <laughs> Catherine, are you free at four o'clock? That's o exactly what Do it again, go on. No, you are just do, do order, order, please. Oh, no, you're going home, aren't you? 
<sighs> Come on, we've got 20 seconds left. Do, do order, order. You don't need to see more nails. Just going. do order. Behave yourself. Say order. <laughs> Order, 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 order <laughs> your fabazine. You see, I was going somewhere oh. with it. Well, I worry, but I yes, so do I. Um, oh, hello, bye. <laughs> right, so we've got crafting celebrations with cricket. Have they got chocolates? Cricket. No, celebrations. Oh, and we've got more shows coming up after that. Well, hello, everybody. So I've got another opportunity to introduce you to one of our fantastic seven-day savers. You can see all of them on our website. Have a look at this. This is your Oakwood and Archer adhesive foam tape collection. You are getting 36 in total, 60 meters worth of foam tape. Look, the fact is, this is an absolute core essential for any crafter. Your matting, your layering, create shaker cards. You don't need me to tell you how often you do use your foam tape. So if you want to stock up at a great price, take advantage of the saving there. Eight pounds and 98 pence saving is part of our seven day savers. Your item number is 337905. Now we are celebrating Ho Chanda's fifth birthday and I really hope you are enjoying the festivities. Uh, don't forget if you make a purchase on a live show you are eligible for a free gift and you can see the full terms and conditions on our website also have a look on the website at the other seven day savers because there are some utter bargains to be had so go check them out hi i'm emma and i'm pam and we're from quilters trading post we've been open since 2007 so we're coming up to 10 years now we started our business um, in Cambridge, really, with a long arm quilting machine. We decided we wanted to make a proper business of it, so we bought a shop in this area. We soon grew out of that because we became successful and we bought a school, and now we're in the school. We have four parts to our business. We have the quilting service, we run workshops, we sell patchwork and quilting threads, fabrics and notions, and we do patterns and books. That's our newest thing, and our favourite being our crafters carry-all. We've really enjoyed being on Hochanda. It's um, made us famous, really. We've got lots of people who now come into the shop and tell us that they've seen us, and that they've enjoyed the demonstrations, and they've watched us over and over again. Make sure you don't miss our shows here on Hochanda. Hi, I'm Anna, and I'm a founder of Craftbox UK. Craftbox is a box full of craft supplies that we send to our customers monthly. All products are placed in a beautiful, sturdy box, which is ribbon tied, and we hope that by receiving this box, you will feel like it's Christmas every month. Make sure you don't miss the craft box shows on Hochanda. Hi, I'm John Lockwood from John Next Door. I'm lucky enough to have been a guest on Hochanda since day one. I like to pack my shows with lots of hints, tips, and techniques. And my idea is to give the experience that I've got and I've gained to everyone at home and show as many things as I possibly can. The John Next Door brand is designed to bring high quality, innovative products to the crafting market. The range includes stamps, dies and new products such as the media plates. I'm also looking to expand the brand and bring you lots of new techniques, new ideas and new products into the next few years. I hope you can join me on my crafting journey and learn some tips and techniques from me that I share with you. So don't forget to tune in and watch the John Next Door shows on Hachanda. Hi, I'm Nikki Hassan. I've been working with Heartfelt Creations for about nine years now. Heartfelt Creations as a company launched the company back in 1994. They have been in the industry for a very, very long time. They are crafters, so they know what you crafters want and they listen to us crafters too. Their products range from stamps that coordinate with dies that then coordinate with a paper pad. But then we also have storage folders. We have decorative dies, we have coloring daubers, we have Insta albums. One of the products that really make 
heartfelt, unique are their flower shaping molds where you can make easy, quick, three-dimensional flowers which are absolutely stunning. So I hope you can join Heartfelt Creations here on Achanda. Good afternoon to you here at Achanda. Of course, we're watching the Cricket Maker in action here. If you didn't catch the show at 7 o'clock this morning, please do stay with us for the next hour. Of course, we've got some wonderful bundles for you, part of the birthday celebrations as well, some amazing offers. If you've never seen this machine before, it is absolutely incredible. If you have seen it before, perhaps you've been considering this as a purchase. Well, do take advantage of our savings. Perhaps you've still got your credit to spend as well. We're going to talk you through the whole bundle and much more besides with our wonderful guest who is demonstrating who's Emma and we will be uh, introducing you to Emma in a little while we're just watching the machine cutting away there do you know I have no idea what we're actually cutting here so it's going to be a really nice surprise hmm. <laughs> let's find out we will find out I honestly don't know what that is actually that's cut in there now I am going to in introduce you to our guest of course because it is Emma she was with us at seven here she is again hi Emma <laughs> hello have you managed to have a cup of tea or a coffee in between yeah I had a little nap yeah <laughs> have you had a little nap <laughs> oh, just a tiny lucky. one <laughs> oh well done well done right okay Emma's going to be back with us of course during demonstrations but Emma just for now what are we actually cutting out there we are that? cutting a really intricate um, well quite intricate bear out of cardstock so ah. um, he'll be finished in a minute so we'll be able to reveal him uh, shortly perfect perfect right well when it does come to the machine of course it is the Cricut maker let's have a look at this so if I oops if I just lift the lid here and we'll see what oh there we are it's just trapped on the cardstock <laughs> there who is that inside Emma who is that <laughs> um, that is our cricket mascot the cricket cutie <laughs> oh he is a cutie as well isn't he yes. actually I do know who he is I'm going to just lift mm -hmm. him out just for a second and let you know this is your gift with purchase so anything that you buy on this show this little fellow is going to be heading his way to you it may be a different color actually because there are various different colors and it's going to be a nice surprise as to which color you receive oh he's mm -hmm. fabulous i really do like him they are very rare in fact yes. they've not been available anywhere other than i believe um past exhibitions when the ceo of cricket has been there handing them out or maybe in america you might have found them but not here in the uk so uh, do treasure him and look after him won't you now let's have a look at the makeup bundle because we've got an amazing saving on this now of course you are going to get the machine we're going to talk much more about that machine as we go through the hour of course with emma but it is an amazing machine it is a digital uh, cutting machine of course it's you it's um, wireless isn't it it's bluetooth as well yeah, bluetooth so you enabled, know it's yeah. and we've got the most amazing app to download haven't yes, we Emma we have cricket design space um, which is free to download we can work all of the, everything that the machine does off of the app or we can use it on our computer as well so we've got of lots course. of options wonderful we'll talk more about the app yeah. and your design suite as well as we go along but let's have a look at the other items in the bundle because it really is incredible now we're going to start with the chipboard because this is something you don't always see in the bundles let me just turn this to the side so you can see the actual depth of this there is actually two together there so I'm just going to separate those a little bit so we're talking two millimeters of depth there now you're probably thinking well how does that cut with a Cricut blade we are going to include the deep cut blade in there for you but I'll come back to that in a little while so we've got our chipboard there we've down in the front of that we've got the tools now these are really really useful you've got your basic tool set but very important you've also got your applicator and remover set there as well which you'll see Emma using so in total you've got a good number of tools there, all included in the bundle now we've talked about the machine but I've just got to remember about the mats as well because you're getting two 12 by 12 mats you're not just getting one you are getting two so the light grip the blue one that is going to be for your car stock and your vinyls and various different materials but the pink one is for fabric because of course you can use the machine for cutting fabrics as well and much more than that what else have we got in the bundle well it keeps going we've got the sorbet cardstock in the front here these are beautiful colors as well there is a texture to this cardstock 
you can, might be able to hear me scratching there. It doesn't really show up. Just, it's not really prominent, is it? So it's not going no, to really interfere subtle. with cutting or anything like oh, that. No. But it, it gives a really lovely sort of look to this cardstock as well. So you've got lots of sheets of that. Was it 24 sheets we've got of the sorbet? You do, yes. And these are 12 inches by 24 inches. So really good size pieces. We'll continue with the cardstock because we've also got the coloured cardstock here. Now there's some corrugated and some smoother cardstock in here, but again, a good weight. I know we've got plenty of samples around the studio using these as well. You're going to get 20 sheets of that in total, but it keeps going because we've got the vinyl for you as well. Now the Sport Flex vinyl is there, it's an iron-on, and that means it is going to flex on those stretchy materials, so your sports, uh, you know, your joggers, that sort of thing, your lycra pants, your vests, all those different things, this is going to work with that. Then you've got your Holographic Sparkle iron-on, which is absolutely beautiful. Now we do have a lovely shirt in the t-shirt, we'll find that in a little while, it looks amazing, it's a zebra. And then next to that we've got that permanent there, the premium vinyl, it's the mixed mosaic. When you get these out of the tube as well, they're really, really stunning. And then also we've got that beautiful red vinyl there as well with a shimmery effect on it. Let's just have a look at that. But it still keeps going because there's more. We've got the pens for you. This is the gel pen set because, of course, the Cricut Maker will also take your pens. It doesn't just cut, it draws as well. So well worth having these. And they're included in the bundle. They're your peacock fullers, colours. There he is again. Look, the little cutie. The little purple one for you there. Now, there is the deep cut blade for you. You can see the blade on there. So that's going to be used for cutting, of course, your thicker materials, including the chipboard, grey board, balsa wood, leathers, things like that as well. Wow, it just keeps going on and on and on, doesn't it? Not only that, we've got a £65 saving here. If you've been waiting for a bundle that's got so much in it and a great saving like that, this is the time to do it. Perhaps you've got your voucher to spend, your credit, your £5 credit. £498.88, but we're going to split that down into three payments for you as well. Now, you can see the zebra t-shirt I was referring to there. Isn't that magnificent? Love it. Three payments of 166.29. That's for the Cricut Maker. And the item number is 709796. There we are. Now, we were busy earlier, so are we going to be busy again this hour? Maybe you've been watching and waiting for this hour. We'll talk more about everything as we go through, but we've got more for you as well because we've also got, of course, the Easy Press bundle. Now, this is your 9 by 9 inch Easy Press. Uh, we'll talk to Emma about this at demonstration area, about the plate and everything. If you've not seen that before, do wait for that detailed information. You've also got the tools in here as well. So once again, you've got your applicator. You've also got your tools there with the very important weeding tool included. It's just one of five there. Lovely set to have again. And then you've got your different vinyls in this one as well. So your iron-on vinyls. You've got glitter there. You've got a fairy tale one. And you've also got the holographic in that one as well. And don't forget, you also get the wonderful bag, which is absolutely beautiful. Love this bag. It's so smart. So you are going to keep your your uh, easy press inside here when you're not using it of course and it's great for transporting but it's going to keep it nice and safe there we are and there's a strap to hold it in place it's just so smart you have got a pocket on the front as well with a little zip there you've also got another pocket on the back you've got a really lovely long shoulder strap there as well it's really well made i just love the bag i think it really keeps everything so well together and it looks so smart 234 pounds and 43 pence you are saving a whopping 74 pounds on this bundle again three flexi payments 78 pounds and 14 pence item number 011 Four eight zero. We've got another bundle for you though. Perhaps you want to go a little bit smaller. Perhaps you've already got the Cricut Maker and you're wanting a more portable machine as well. Then maybe the Joy is for you. Now the Joy, just because it's small, doesn't mean it can't cut just like its big brother or big sister over there. Now it is a little bit different because obviously the size of it is different. You do get a mat with it, which is a really clever mat. Uh, I think again probably we'll get to speak to Emma about that. But also you can cut on a continuous length here up to 20 feet because you can also cut without the mat you don't always need that mat in there you do get extras in here as well we've got card inserts we've got the carry bag we've got pens in there as well and we've also got vinyls and transfer tape so you can see the whole of the bundle here just very quickly i'm just going to pick up this lovely little sample actually 
look at this how cute is this I am going to talk to Emma about the app but there are so many different designs that you can download and have access to and of course you can design your own as well so it's not just about cutting the motifs and the detail there it is about you know cutting your fabrics especially on the Cricut Maker there as well but I can tell you this little area here this embellishment has been cut on the joy isn't that so cute and also the materials from this bundle as well a milk of all. I love that what a great name for a little baby dinosaur. There we are. Everything dispatched from the 8th of September. Uh, not long to wait at all. We're almost into September. Who would believe it? 551708 for the Joy Bundle there. Of course, everything's over on the website. We've got much more over there as well because we have got lots of tools and lots of different vinyls for you and cardstock as well. There's probably fabric packs on there. All sorts of different blades for you to go for as well. So if you've already got the maker or any of the machines, you'll be able to find those accessories. There is uh, just a wonderful array of products all there waiting on the website for you. Now, the Easy Press Mini is a very good option as well. If you want to go for those smaller projects or perhaps you want to iron onto your shoes and trainers and things like that, you can get to all those little areas. Lovely array of products there for you. Wonderful. Now, we are going to go over to Emma because we're dying to see what the Cricut Maker was cutting at the start of the show. <laughs> yeah, let's have a look. Um, so I'm going to eject from the, I'm not sure if you can see a little bit there. Oh, wow. Yeah. Look so at let's that. take that off the mat. Um, with cardstock, we always peel the mat away from um, the material so that we don't uh, roll or curve our cardstock. So just be careful as you remove it from the mat because the mat is sticky to keep everything in place of whilst you're cutting. You have to be careful with this one. I don't want to... There's lots of detail in this one, Emma. Yeah, oh, look I'm at excited. This, this as you're pulling it away there. <laughs> this is a tricky one to see. Oh, I don't want to accidentally rip a piece. You've got a very sticky mat there. Look at that. Look at all the bits and pieces. Wow. That would make a great stencil. Yeah. That's an, yeah, that's another great thing you can use the machine for, is stencils. Uh, oh, we've got that a few amazing. bits Look to poke that. out, but uh, you can see there. Look at that. Emma, <laughs> and of course you could size that down if you wanted a smaller Completely, version as well. Completely, yeah. Yeah, you could go really intricate with that. And of course you could make that in any material. That's cardstock, but you could make that and put it on a t-shirt with iron-on vinyl or stick it on a wall with vinyl. Wonderful. All sorts of options. Oh, I love it. Absolutely love it. I'm just thinking with the cardstock, if you did it, especially in a smaller size, so you yeah. haven't got so much to work at, you could paper piece in there. If you cut two yeah, different beautiful. colours and yeah. paper piece And even you could in. just cut out the background and layer him up or chop some bits out. That would love be beautiful. It. Maybe well, I'll do that and bring it back next month. <laughs> I think you should. I'd love to see what you do with that, actually. <laughs> That's just one thing that you can create, of course, with our wonderful machine. So when it comes to the app then, Emma, just yeah. a, a reminder to everybody that you can actually download the app before even purchasing the machine. So you, you can, can be finding indeed. your way around yeah. there. Um, you can download it right now. Um, sat at home. It's called Cricut Design Space. It's either an app on your smartphone or tablet. Yeah. Or you can download the software to your computer. Lovely. Um, and you can have a play. Um, yeah, you can have a look at everything before you buy a machine so you can see if it's right for you uh, we do say if you can use a smartphone you can use Cricut Design Space it's that easy you've got a massive library of projects a massive library of images over 150,000 images wow. in there um, you can upload your own images as well so you've I mean the possibilities are endless is what we like to say because it's something I don't think we mentioned in the earlier hour actually if there are any updates it's done automatically yeah just once you connect in. your machine everything's downloaded so you don't have to worry about doing that yourself or you know sort of fiddling around with your mouse yeah. or anything or like that. Or if a new feature automatic. comes um, that will just automatically update yeah. for you. So yeah Perfect. it's constantly up, um, evolving with you. Yeah beautiful lovely. Now I've noticed you've got a green mat there. We don't no, have a green I know. mat in The this only kit. reason I've done that is because I was being lazy and I didn't want to clean my <laughs> <laughs> So if anybody's got a green mat, it's the same as the blue one. It's very it? similar, a little yeah. bit stronger in grip, but you'd also use it for cardstock, um, vinyl, iron on vinyl, okay. so it's not much different. Okay. I apologise, that's the only reason I've done that, um, out of laziness. <laughs> um, I, do, 
I do apologise if you heard a bit of a crash. Everybody's all right. Everybody's OK. <laughs> it's just, uh, I don't know, some Perspex stands or something dropping on the floor. <laughs> OK, so I'm going to um, get started on a tote bag project. Ah, I've got wonderful. a nice blank tote bag. Yep. Um, and I'm going to do this in glitter iron-on. Okay. And you'll notice I'm putting the, the front side, the face, the shiniest side down towards the mat. And that's because we cut into the back of iron-on vinyl. Okay. And then we flip it over onto our design. All will become clear. Okay. Um, I'm going to use my brayer tool to make sure it's well stuck down. Just get out any air bubbles if there is any. Yeah, you can see one or two little bubbles there, so that shows how important that tool is. Yeah. There we go. Now, if you, if you miss any bubbles or if you don't actually stick things down fully, Emma, that could be a point where it may catch a little bit on the blade, so make sure yeah, that you do get that. Exactly, especially on vinyl and cardstock. Um, if it's not stuck down well, that's where you can uh, yeah, come into a bit of a mischief, so make sure it's stuck well down to your, um, to your mat. Right, I'm going to grab uh, my image up here. Uh, I don't know if we can see this. Yes, uh, here's a, a little bit quick Aww. image I made earlier. I know I so original, used my own name, um, of a rainbow, and then I've just typed in my own text. So this shows that how easily you can personalise anything. I'm going to click Make It, and I need to mirror my image because, like I said, we're cutting into the back, so any words uh, need yes. to be backwards. But yeah. you can see that's... Uh, Really so easy the, little the click there, just yeah. to flip that around. Click continue. I'm just going to connect to my machine via Bluetooth. And then I'm going to tell the machine what material I'm cutting, and that's how it knows the depth that the blade's going in. Okay, perfect. So there's no dials, no settings we need to remember. We just tell it exactly what we're cutting. So um, glitter iron on, which is actually right here. Um, that's one of my favourites, <laughs> funnily enough, else I can search for through loads and loads and loads of materials. So I just click that and you can see it tells me which blade to, po po ugh, to pop in <laughs> and even tells me to press a button there. <laughs> it's so got it's everything you that guide all indeed. Along so the let's way, load into the machine. Okay, lovely. And then once it's ready, it tells the button you it's will ready, flash. it flashes for yeah. you. Then it has then, that pause where it's just checking everything's correct before yeah. it gets going. And it's going to double check that that's what it was doing there. It's just double checking that I had put in the right blade. So if you didn't at that point, perhaps you'd popped in the rotary blade because you were doing a fabric project earlier. Um, it will tell you and stop and you can sort it out. So even if you know, you're not concentrating, you're not going to make a mistake. You're not going to ruin material by that cutting with really the wrong blade. Clever. Now we just put the overhead on for you though. That's a really good shot actually oh, yeah. to watch this. It's so glittery. <laughs> and I am just going to comment again because I said this on the earlier show. I just love to listen to the machine work. <laughs> it's not clunky, it's not loud, it's not it doesn't sound like you've got those cogs going around. It's just very smooth and sleek. But you know it's actually doing the job. Now on the software, Emma, we can mm -hmm. see the percentage of the project as well, which is really nice to watch. We can, yep. So we know if we've got time to go and make a cup of tea or <laughs> something like that. Uh, but remember, with some materials, especially when you're using the knife blade that's in the bundle, uh, you do want to be next to your machine the yeah. whole time. But if you're cutting things like vinyl and iron-on, you know, let it do its thing and um, leave it to it. I mean, I always end up standing here looking at it, so I say well, that. Well, can't help but watch it, can you? It's <laughs> I waste all of my life just stood and watching it do its thing. <laughs> well, you could, you could be, I don't know, just scoring some cardstock or getting ready yeah. other projects as you stood next to it as well, so you can keep an eye on it, you can watch it, but you can still be doing other things as well because your yeah. hands are totally free. Yeah, exactly. I think we're almost there. I bet there's a lot of people could have made use of the cricket in the last couple of weeks, getting the kids ready for school. You know, yes. lunchbox bags, personalising <laughs> everything as well. But it's not too late, even though they may be back or they're going back next week. So there's still all those projects to make. Think ahead as well to Christmas, to teachers' gifts. Those little thank you gifts and personalise them for the teachers. They'll be so impressed. Well, yeah, just Christmas um, full stop with the cricket is, makes things just so much easier. Um, to do personalised presents, you know, to buy cheaper things, blank items, and then...
personalise them yeah, and you've got something that's idea. really meaningful and looks like you've spent lots of money but you know you've just popped a bit of vinyl on it just or something. Just thinking as well, I don't, know, I don't know whether, I suppose Christmas fairs won't be happening the same this year because of the situation we're in, I don't know but you can make to sell as well can't you Emma? So think yes, ahead, you, can. you know if you do do sell yeah maybe you've got an online shop perhaps you do sell yeah. online but definitely gifts for your your children's friends for the family for your neighbors for all sorts of things that is such a pretty vinyl isn't it i love the glitter vinyl do you have any t-shirts that you haven't created yourself no <laughs> I don't have anything in my house that doesn't have vinyl on really? it. Really? All of my cushions in my lounge have got iron on on. Um, everything in the kitchen's got some kind of vinyl label. My boyfriend thinks it's hilarious that we need to be have a label on the jar of sugar to know that it's sugar. But <laughs> I think it's cute, so whatever. Um, oh, yeah, even my toilet door has a sign on it that says toilet. Nothing wrong with that. It looks cute. And uh, the whole of my downstairs loo, I've done vinyl like shapes. Um, because we live in a rented house, so I used removable vinyl. So it looks oh, like wallpaper, but it's um, just all kind of abstract shapes, but oh, yeah, all in black idea. and gold. So it looks like oh, our wallpaper. You can see the wording almost, don't you? those sentiments above a bed or in a hallway or something. Yeah. You can cut all those out yourself. And sometimes those, those don't fit you know, the size of your room, whereas yeah. with the Cricut, you can make it exactly to the measurements that you want. Most definitely. Okay, so all I'm doing here is weeding, and this is what we call this. And this is taking away everything apart from our design. Okay. So um, you're leaving the actual design on the carrier sheet, on that see-through bit at the front. Yeah, that's and right. And removing the remainder. So it keeps our design in place, so we don't have to faff around placing anything. There we go. And I can, um, I like to, with a hole punch, just um, punch stars and things out of these and yeah. pop them in a jar, and then if... Um, a t-shirt or something needs them I can just iron them that's, on so that's a really even nice that idea. waste um, cut it up or use your punches but that's a nice waste, way to yeah, keep that definitely. from going okay so now let me just fix that little bit there we've got our design I'm going to turn my easy press on okay. now remember we've got the easy press as a bundle as well with a huge saving 74 pounds saving if I remember rightly let's check that and see if I'm correct Oh, where is it? Where is it? I need to know. <laughs> We're finding the details for you. Now, with the Easy Press, it's the 9 inch by 9 inch Easy Press as part of the bundle. Okay. Oh, we've brought the bright pad up. Because, Emma, you've got the. Have you got the bright pad there? Yeah, I have got the bright pad right into here. The I didn't use it there. then, I just used it as a cutting board. Uh, but, yeah. This is great for weeding, um, especially if you've got, I mean, we don't really need it in here because it's so bright, but I've got a really dark, oh, look at that. It has, it's let's got a find out, price quite on a few this as well. settings of um, bright, but yeah, I use it a lot at home because my uh, craft room is quite dark and it means I can see all of the pieces that have been cut because sometimes that is difficult. And you could use that for other reasons as well, couldn't you? Oh, yeah. It's, Lots of reasons for using um, it. Non-scratch, so yeah. yeah, use it for all sorts of things. Tracing, Brilliant. beading, all sorts of things. And it fits lovely. so nicely in the maker up there. Outdoors. It does, doesn't it? So you can, is that where you can put your tablet or your yeah, mobile your phone tablet, as well? Yeah, it goes in there and Perfect. the bright pad. Right, as our Easy Press is heating up, I'm just going to pre-press um, the bag. And this is to remove any moisture from there. Uh, because iron on vinyl isn't a, a great friend of moisture. So we want to get any of that out before we press. Okay. Um, and let's talk about the Easy Press, shall we? We shall, <laughs> because it's there on the screen now. We, it? It's a £74 saving. Look at that. Oh, nice. Now, tell us about the plate of the Easy Press. Yes. Emma. So, this whole plate heats up to exactly the same temperature and a temperature which we pick. Um, so, we can be really exact depending on what type of iron on we're using and what type of material we're pressing it onto. Okay. Um, so, there is a Cricut heat guide, so that's all you need to search online. And you can pop in uh, what vinyl you're using and what um, material you're blank is and then it tells you the exact temperature so for me that's okay. 160 degrees for 30 seconds so I've popped that in there 
and it means we get a really even press. If you press with your home iron, um, it might look like it's pressed and then you wash it and you'll actually find that where the steam holes are or around the edges of the iron doesn't actually get as hot as yeah. the small tiny centre of your iron and you don't actually know what temperature that is. <laughs> like no, who knows what temperature very, that very iron true. is. Do you know there's a lot of good reasons for going for the easy press actually because you yeah. get a lot in the bundle for a start but if you're a soft crafter as well this is going to be fantastic for you. You don't have to be a soft crafter because of course you've got the iron on vinyls if you wanted to do those projects onto pencil cases, onto bags, onto t-shirts hair accessories and all sorts of things that you can apply the vinyl to so this is for everyone it really truly is now i did notice emma a little beep is that because it got to temperature it was telling you it yeah. was ready yeah Lovely. it was telling me it was ready and then if i leave it and don't pick it up for five minutes it bleeps loudly at me to say like i'm still here i'm still on and if you don't do anything it will turn itself off Oh, um, so, so you've got that safety you've got aspect, that safety aspect. as well. And where it's in the cradle, there's no way you can get any fingers on anything hot. Um, oh. And it disperses the heat. See, I can even pick that up and that's at 160 that's degrees. Wow. <laughs> um, so we're not getting our It's our not table going down into hot, the table and damaging your table. Yeah, so it's really nice and safe, I think. If you've got pets or children running yeah. around, you can put it back there. I'm a person who will put an iron down on the carpet mid craft, you know, in like chaos. You don't <laughs> like, do oh. that in a property. <laughs> Whereas now I've got somewhere to put this back to. So yeah, perfect. Right, let's get pressing. Okay. So I'm going to pop it down, press the um, green button, and that counts down the timer for me. Okay. And I'm just going to hold it in place. You don't need a lot of pressure. Um, just stand and kind of hold it and you'll see it count down it will bleep when it's done as well so you don't have to stand here counting and we can see the timer counting down there so no need to move it around like an iron you just leave it in place there now there is actually a heat guide on the website for you as well i think we're going to show you that yeah, actually fab. there you go yep so we can pick our um the easy press that we've got yeah um and then pick the heat transfer material so we're using glitter iron on and then the base material, this is a cotton canvas, I think. I mean, this might are. prove. And then easy press mat is what we're using. And it tells you um, exactly there you can change. And then if you scroll down, you've also got the exact, um, all of the directions, um, all of the steps for applying iron on. So if you have a little oh, moment, you think, oh, I'm not it? sure how to do this or what la l layer things go in or any of that, it's got it all there for you as well. That is amazing. So very easy to access that and check on all those temperatures, of course. And it is important because different fabrics, different vinyls, different materials, there, yeah. there can be a vast difference between them. Yeah, exactly. Um, especially if you're doing something a little bit more unusual. Like I um, pressed onto a yoga mat once, Did but you? because I was able to get the um, heat right down low, I could press at a low temperature for a longer time, which meant I didn't melt the yeah. yoga mat. So you've got those options. Ooh. Now, with glitter iron on, we can peel straight away. Look at that. That looks amazing. Isn't it? And now that is on there. We can wash that. I'm going to scrunch it up. <laughs> and let me hold it up for you. And that is a really good canvas bag as well. You can see how thick yeah, that is. Nice quality canvas. Isn't that beautiful? And that is on no there now. No shedding of the glitter either. No, none at all. That won't come off. It's all. Emma, on there. I take it you needed a new bag today. Well, I didn't, but I've got one now. <laughs> <laughs> or I need to Perfect. find someone in the street called Emma. <laughs> And it's as easy as that. Oh, lovely stuff there, Emma. Let's have another look at the maker, of course, because to cut out, uh, to cut out your wonderful designs whether you're downloading them from the app or whether you're designing your own you've got those options you can resize everything of course as well don't forget oh where's he gone he's back in the box lot back in the front of the machine there there he is our little cutie anything that you're purchasing on the show you are going to receive your little cricket cutie he may be yellow he may be a different color who knows it's just going to be a nice surprise and of course he is very at home there in the machine but don't forget don't leave him in there when you're using it of course he won't uh, he won't arrive already sat in there he will arrive separately right let's have a look at the bundle again because of course you're getting much more than the machine just one or two other things to point out as well of course you've got an area to keep your tools in there and your pens at the side you've got that wonderful area there for your your tablet or your mobile phone or whatever you want to sit in there or the light box as we saw uh, it's just a lovely lovely machine very sleek it looks smart it looks the part on your desk 
it works a treat. It, you don't have to fiddle about with dials and things like that. Everything's there on the software for you. All the uploads are, sorry, the software updates are going to be downloaded automatically for you as well. Let's have a look what you're getting in the bundle along with the machine. Uh, let's go straight to the chipboard again because this one you are getting another blade we have got the blade to show you but you get a deep cut blade as well so you're going to be able to cut things like your chipboard your balsa wood your heavier levers that sort of thing as well two millimeters thick that's the thickness of the chipboard that's here but I think the blade Emma goes up to 2.4 yeah, millimeters blade, yeah. it's almost two and a half millimeters which is absolutely amazing you do get the tools we've seen Emma using in particular the applicator there and the weeding tool now you're going to get those along with various other tools as well so both of those packs are included you do get your card the sorbet card which is lovely now these are big pieces of cards you could cut them down but you can get bigger marks can't you as extras yeah. as well if you wanted to Emma so you're 12 inches by 24 inches and there are 24 sheets of that so an awful lot of that card stock there you've got your vinyl included as well so there you are, the vinyl. Now you've got various different ones included here. You have got the Sport Flex, so that's going to stretch with your materials and not crack as well. And that's important if you've got something like Lycra and anything that is going to give that given stretch or those knitted fabrics. Then you've got the Sparkle there, the Holographic Sparkle Iron-On. You've got the, oh, that wonderful Mixed Mosaic. That is a really pretty one. And then you've got some more permanent vinyl there as well. Because there are different sorts. There are removables and permanent. That is a permanent one included for you. Uh, it keeps going, though. We've also got that blading in front that I was telling you about there as well um, so the deep cut blade is also there and I think if we can just come in quite close on that you can see how deep that blade actually is you do get that cap to protect it as well very easy to install into your machine and of course if you're requiring that the software is going to tell you when you need that if you get it wrong the machine is going to let you know if you've got the wrong blade in so it's incredible you've got more cardstock here as well we've got the corrugated and the smooth cardstock in these really bright colours. 20 sheets of that, good size sheets there as well. And don't forget, you are getting the mats to go with the machine. You're getting two 12 by 12. So the blue one is for your lightweight materials or your vinyls and your cardstock, your papers, that sort of thing. You've got the fabric one as well in pink. And we've still got something we haven't mentioned. We've not mentioned the pens. <laughs> the pens are there as well. You've got five of those pens. They are gel pens. They sit into the housing so you can actually draw the designs as well as cut or do a combination of both. And there he is, another little cutie, just to remind you that you're going to receive one of those as well. Three payments of 166.29. You're saving £65 on this bundle. 709796. Right, I'm just going to move down back to the easy press because, of course, we've seen that in action as well. If you are wanting to make those wonderful T-shirts, those pencil cases, those bags, those uh, shoes, whatever you want, you know, you've got the vinyl here as well as the machine. Now, this is the 9 by 9 inch. That's the base you've got. You've got the, the docking area there as well. That's included. You've got the bag to go with this. I'm going to show you that a little bit more closely. Remember, you've got that even heat right across that ceramic plate there. The bag that goes with it, oh, I adore this. It's so smart. It really, really is. I have mine sat out on my dining room table at the moment because I'm hoping to use it later with my daughter. Uh, you've got, yes, it's heat proof as well. So even if the machine, the easy press is a little bit hot, when you put it away, it is heat proof in there. You've got uh, pockets front and back as well and a wonderful strap for carrying. You've also got tools in this bundle as well. So the applicator, the weeding tools, amongst other things. And of course, the various different vinyls are included, and they're all going to be reactive to the heat because, of course, it's part of the Easy Press bundle. Just another little sample here, just to show you something that you could create. So, of course, cutting out with the Cricut machine, look at that, isn't that sweet? So think about, you know, if you know there's a new baby coming along, but you don't know if it's a girl or a boy, you don't know the name, you could get these plain little outfits in and then, as Emma was saying, just have them ready to go and personalise as soon as you know the details of the baby's name, just some sort of motto on the front there or some image on there, or perhaps you could go with colours to suit. Just wonderful. It's a lovely bundle, this one. £74 is a saving, 234.43. Split it into three payments again, item number 011. 
And then finally, our final bundle on the counter is the Joy. It's been popular actually this hour. I hope we're going to see this. I think we are. I think Emma's got a demonstration lined up. This is a really lovely machine. I do know that some people have gone for the Maker in the past and then come back and also bought the Joy because it's so portable, but it still does the job. You can make quick cards in five minutes and I've got some samples here you can do those longer banners as well if you want to cut a continuous length up to 20 feet you don't actually need a mat it's different to the maker with that you know that uh, that process there because with the maker you need in the mat this one you can run those long lengths through you're also getting the transfer tape you're getting various different vinyls in there you're getting insert cards as well you've got pens in this one let me just show you that lovely little sample oh this is so sweet this is absolutely gorgeous. So using the joy, that little area has been cut, using some of the vinyl that's in this bundle as well there. But of course, if you've got the maker as well, you can cut fabric in bigger pieces. You know, you can cut all those different materials. It is a great buy, this one. Three payments of £84.97, item number 551708. You do get pens in that one as well. I don't think I mentioned the pens there, but you've got a black, a gold and a silver as well. So an enormous amount of product there, including that wonderful stylish bag to go with that as well, all colour coordinated with the Joy itself. Right, Emma, are we going to see the Joy now? Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> I love Joy. It's so cute. I can't, I cried the first time I saw it. Did you? I just couldn't, oh. I, did, I did, didn't know what it was going to be, of course, and then I saw it and I was like, oh, I didn't even know I needed you and you're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> which just shows how much of a cricket geek I am. Um, <laughs> I thought I'd show you um, the card mat, which is one of the features of the Joy. This is a really cool, um, clever design by Cricut. It's only available for Joy. And this card mat means we can cut only the front of a pre-scored um, card. So we can pop... That's so clever, isn't it? A folded card in there, pre-folded card. Close up the front and it's only going to cut the front because your back of your card is protected in there. Um, Do you know and how many times have we run through a die cutting machine thinking oh I'll just cut the front of this card and we've got a fold in and we cut through the whole thing. Yeah. So you don't have to worry <laughs> about it at all. Not at as all. long as you no. took that away, that back piece of the card. Yeah and we talk all the time about um, our quick five minute cards for joy but of course if you are a more seasoned or you know really advanced card maker this is great for exactly for that for when yeah. you you know want to cut a little aperture out or we said earlier about shaker cards those kind of things and you just want to cut or a, a really decorative design out of the front of a card you can do that with joy yeah. um, but we do love to talk about how quick you can make cards too because it is cool so now, we're also saying earlier on as well, this is a great option if you've got wedding invitations or something to do as well, because you, you tend to work with that size card an awful lot, don't you? And if you've got a lot to do all the same, then you can set up your, your design studio with the, the design of your choice, of course. You can personalise, you can put dates on, you can draw it on, you can cut it into it as well. But you could really batch make quite quickly, couldn't you? Yes, Anna? you can. And that's another thing I love about this is I mean, I'm not the most organised person in the world, so I quite often forget birthdays or, you know, someone's had a baby and I haven't got a card ready. And especially I found that during lockdown when I couldn't get out to get yeah. a card, I could just make one and send it to someone. And it'd be personalised too, which makes it even more special. Um, so we're using the pen first to draw. Okay. Um, and you'll notice this is a difference with Joy. You've only got one port. So the, both the pen and the blade can go in the same port. Whereas okay. with the Maker, they have separate areas to go in. Uh, because Joy is so compact, they fit in there. We are drawing a little cat. <laughs> uh, holding a ball of yarn, I think, <laughs> in this card. Um, so it's going to draw some of the elements and then we'll cut out um, to finish. How and the machine it. there has just told me to switch the blade in. So it stops automatically and you can yeah. see on the screen it's asking you to change the pen to the blade. And then once I'm ready there I can press go on my device and then Preparing. There we off go. it goes. So again everything is thought out for you, you don't have to worry about it, it is just that simple change of the blade there and off we go again. Yeah. Oh, it's doing some of the words there. Some of the letters. There we are. Oh, that little little cat. It's obviously upside down as we're looking yeah. at it at the moment. <laughs> Good 
going to be cute. Oh, that makes it look <laughs> a bit better. Um, but remember as well, Joy can cut uh, really long lengths of material, and that's because with those smart materials, they don't need a mat. So Joy is the only one of the Cricut machines that has matless cutting, so it can feed through that really long length of vinyl, um, longer lengths of iron-on, so that you can batch make projects, or you can do really long uh, words or borders or banners. Um, it kind of opens up more possibilities. So there are things that this tiny machine can do that the maker can't do, which I think is really cool. Oh, so even is. though she looks cute, <laughs> she can really do does look cute. We're just watching this in as well. I can tell you we've had a lovely email in from uh, someone called Lee, actually. And Lee bought her machine back it before in March, before lockdown, I believe. And she opened it a few weeks ago, just two weeks ago, in fact. And she's been busy on it ever since. Why did I wait so long <laughs> to open yes. the box? It's so easy to use. <laughs> uh, so <laughs> she's... Oh, she's gone for the maker today. Oh, yes. now that's a treat. I do see a lot of people do that. They get the joy, they get hooked, they yep. become cricket addicts, and then they go for the maker. <laughs> okay. Aww. Let's unload. We can have a look here. So I'm just going to peel my, the card off of the mat. Remember, it is a sticky mat, so you need to be careful. Now, we were just saying as well earlier, if your mat gets a little bit fluffy or maybe gets uh, a little bit of pet hair or something on there, you give it a bath, can't you? You can. Like water. <laughs> yeah, but nice washing up liquid. Um, just give it a little bath. Leave it to um, rest in there for, <laughs> for half an hour. And then, um, yeah, just give them a nice rub with your... You don't want to scrub because no. you don't want to take any of the sticky off. And leaving it to air dry, that's the most important yeah. thing. And that will reactivate the stick. Um, but they are a consumable item mat, so eventually you will need new, but you can make them last. Um, and they will last you a good while, a good couple of months. Perfect. Well, more than a couple of months, definitely. Oh, I can see what's coming along here. This is such a cute design. <laughs> now, just looking at the mat that we can see there as well, you can see what I was talking about earlier as well. If you wanted to cut out in more than one colour, you could paper piece oh. if you wanted to. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you could use all of these pieces again, definitely. Um, so now I'm just popping in the insert and the back. And this is the great thing with these um, insert card sets that you're getting in the bundle, is you can mix and match these insert cards. So it's a really quick way to just pop a bit of colour in the back of your card. Lovely. And then so you get that shadow effect. Out for you. I've got some little bits still holding on there. That's where your tools come in handy as well for weeding yeah. out those little bits. Just help them out. Perfect. Just one example of, of many. How many did you say were designs on the? On there the is over a hundred and fifty thousand wow. images. Um, I can't remember how many projects, but that gets added to every week as well. So um, it's always amazing. going up and up and up. <laughs> Oh, and a lot of them. In fact, the vast majority, I believe, you can use that the angel policy does allow you to make to sell. You've just got to make sure that you look at the images with a little A or the designs with a little A because they will allow you to use those. And you can make, was it up to 10,000? Yes, of each image if it's, uh, yeah, within the I don't think you're going access. to reach that number, are you? I <laughs> really don't. Now, we're looking at the details on the screen for the joy. Uh, that's exactly what Emma's been using there, of course. You can see the advantages I there. need to have a it's had a moment up here i think i need a new blade mine's been working hard for six months and i didn't <laughs> think to put a new blade in today which i should have done um, so it's a little bit rough at the top but i could definitely save that but how cute does the cat look actually is that a point emma just while yes. we're there we've said about make sure that your cardstock or your vinyl is really well stuck down because yes. if you don't then you might find yep. it catches if it catches for another reason or you find little rough areas it might be that it is your blade that yep. wants changing think of it like your kitchen knives that's the best yeah. way to think about your blades. Um, how long would your kitchen knives, um, how long would you use them for before they needed resharpening? So I can cut all day every day for about six months before wow. I change a blade. And I'm cutting all different types of materials. Yeah. Whereas if you're only cutting cardstock or um, if you're cutting things like glitter, you might dull your blade a little bit quicker. Yeah. But it is, I always have a spare blade just in case. So another a great thing to pick up. And they're available on the website, yeah. of course. Now, then, before we go back to Emma or give any more recaps, we want to tell you about a few seven-day savers. Here's Janice to tell us about it.
Well, hello, everybody. So I'm here to tell you a little bit about our seven day savers. We are currently celebrating the fact that Ho Chanda have reached their fifth birthday, and we're looking forward to many more happy birthdays with you. So, what we're going to do, oh, I've got to tell you, because it is our fifth birthday, if you go onto the website, have a look, because you can get hold of a free birthday gift during it's a free gift with purchase during any live show. See full T's and C's on our website. Let's have a look at these Oakwood and Archer folders. So, we are talking a set of two die storage cases you're getting 10 magnetic sheets in there already now here's what's exciting because you can also add refills in there as well so you can extend on those but to start with think about uh, storing all of your die sets beautifully within a folder that will grow with you 24.98 saving nine pounds that is an utter bargain you're getting both those folders it's just one of the seven day savers 892 272 is your item number don't miss out Thank you, Yanis. Now then, back with the Cricket Maker, of course, we have got an incredible bundle for you here on the show today with a great saving, with lots and lots of goodies. But we also do have the Cricket Machine without the extras. So if you want to pick and choose what you go for, maybe you want different vinyls, maybe you want to buy things individually, you're still going to get the machine that does absolutely everything that you've seen. You're still going to get the mats there as well. You're still going to get the pens in there as well. Oh, sorry, the blade, the fine point blade in there as well, which is going to cut your vinyls and your cardstock. You've got the rotary blade also included, which is 360 degrees for cutting your fabric. So all of that for the price that you're seeing on the screen now. Again, three payments of 126.66, so splitting it down three ways. There you can see what you're getting. You even get a little starter kit, don't you, Emma? with the machines as well so you can have a bit of a practice before you get going so if you want to go for the machine without all of the extras with the pieces that you can see right there on the screen now then you can do that as well 091641 you'll still get your cricket cutie as well of course he's going out to everybody who orders oh look at him there <laughs> he may be yellow he may be a different color who knows who knows it'll be a nice surprise won't it there we are. Let's go back to Emma, though. We've got more to show you by the way of demonstration. Yeah, let's cut um, some of that beautiful shimmer oh, vinyl. That. Um, I'm going to pop it in the machine. I've already prepped the machine with what I'd like to cut. Okay. I'm going to pop that in there and get that going. And actually, whilst that's cutting, I'd like to quickly talk about the knife blade and the um, chipboard, if that's okay, and why I haven't demoed it today. Okay. Um, and that's because it takes a little bit longer, because okay. the machine does multiple cuts with the knife blade, so it slowly works its way down through the material. So that's um, kind of the magic of how it works, which means it just takes... Um, it can obviously it depends on the type of project you're doing, but it will take a little bit longer yeah. than a five minute quick cut <laughs> that we need to show you um, today. Um, I would suggest if you when you get your chipboard home, leave it out of the packet for 24 hours before you cut anything, just so any moisture can dry out from its oh, that's a good journey tip. around yeah. and then it will cut much nicer. Yes. It'll be lovely. Yes, because it's surprising, isn't it? Depending on difference in temperatures and when things are in packaging, it can cause a little bit of condensation. Yeah. So I can imagine it would pick up a bit of moisture. Yes. Just as that is cutting, actually, just to show you, when it does come to the chipboard that you get in the bundle, Emma has cut these out for it, so it just shows you just a few ideas of what you can achieve. It is very thick. I mean, these are two millimetres, the pieces that you're getting in the machine, but the blade itself will cut up to 2.4 millimetres. Even your wording, look at that perfect cut around the edge of the letters there so you know that's for a cake topper uh, three-dimensional projects such as this little fairy castle here <laughs> as well and of course once cut you can decorate in so many different ways so you've got lots of options there um, continuing with what you can cut as well with the maker of course we've seen the card stock so you can do your cards a demonstration that Emma did earlier on as well was this lovely little t-shirt again using your vinyls and the easy press was used to apply that of course we've got diaries we've got journals here as well so think about as we said earlier things for schools universities home we all like our notebooks don't we why not personalize it book lover i love that you know your home decor pieces your accessories personalize your mugs and things you know again for christmas you know buy some nice chocolates or some some hot chocolate and put a spoon of marshmallows in there or something personalize it wrap it up in some nice cellophane do you know everybody deserves a gift at christmas that's personalized i think and you can achieve all of that with your maker 
Right, what have been cut in then this time, Emma? Because I yeah. have no idea. <gasps> Um, a lovely kind of sentiment to go on this, I, I suppose, makeup bag. It looks massive, but I carry a makeup bag that big. Um, it says, be beautiful. Um, so I'm going to weed that right now. Um, and then we'll transfer it on using transfer tape. Ah, now we do have the, the transfer tape available. It does come in the Joy bundle, actually, but we can show you that probably on the website as well, or you will find it on the website. So if you need extra transfer tape, you can get that as well. Um, and the reason I'm not using um, iron-on for this is just because it's a plasticky material, yeah. so it would melt. So that's your general rule of <laughs> which vinyl do I use. If it's going to melt, I'd use, um, or if, of course, if it's going on a wall or a car or something, then vinyl. Um, but otherwise, iron-on um, if it's any of your fabrics and things like that. And of course, if you are someone that likes to sew, think about all of the designs you can use as applique pieces. If you make your whole garments or bags from scratch, then if you have got the easy press or you go for the easy press as well, you've got that. It just goes on. It doesn't have to be an iron-on fabric that you're cutting on the maker as well. You can stitch your applique on. You can cut out things like, I don't know, your little makeup bags, your pencil cases, glasses case, all those projects. If you think about the size of the mat that you've got here, you've got a 12 by 12, but you can get a larger mat as well. So you can cut individual pieces up to the size of the mat. You can see some more pieces here at the back. We've got fabric pieces, we've got more books, we've got uh, ceramic pieces there as well, cardstock, um, we've got uh, canvas bags again there. That looks, is that made of velvet, that little cushion there with yeah, love on it? It is, isn't it? So you can transfer across the vinyls onto all sorts of different types of fabric as well. Do you know your cups? Oh, imagine giving the children at Christmas little backpacks or something, or little gifts, all with their names on, so they're not going to fall out over who has what. You know, the little girl, maybe she's into unicorns and everything sparkly, maybe something for the boys with football on. Maybe it's the other way around, because it works both ways, doesn't it? Little girls like football, little boys might like unicorns as well. It can be anything, thousands and thousands of different images available to download, plus you can design your own, plus you can change the size of these, you can flip the images as well, so if you're facing, so for instance, the uh, zebra there facing left, you could have it facing right, uh, cutting out of cardstock, out of vinyl, out of material, out of leather, it just goes on and on. So it's a great way of revamping something you've already got as well and giving it a new lease of life, isn't it? I'm yep. just thinking, perhaps if you change the decor in your kitchen, and instead of buying new canisters, you can add some vinyl in the colour to complement your kitchen, perhaps I'll just some wording to go with it. So Emma's just weeding out the excess there, so we're revealing the, the wording that's being cut, of course. Yeah, we're almost there. Lovely. Nice big piece here. And again, you'd keep those pieces, those larger pieces, Emma, because you could punch them yeah, and use them on other them again. Yeah, of course. And especially if you've got more time to, you know, sit and um, do it nicely and <laughs> not uh, rip it apart like I'm doing. Could you, Emma? You know what, mm -hmm. where you're pulling away that bigger piece there? Yeah. When you set it up, if you could you sort of, if you wanted to bring designs like little stars or hearts in yes. and place them in that area so it cuts it at the same time so they're yes, already absolutely. done absolutely. You. you can use every single part of this um, so there isn't any waste. Obviously, for time... Um, and just ease of doing a project live on air. I haven't done that, but at home, yeah, totally, that is something I would do. Make sure that, you know, all of your bits of vinyl, because you don't want to waste sparkly material you. like this. And make sure you save everything. So if you alter things, if you resize or you add extra bits in, do save them so another time you can go with it again, because, yes, you are creating your own templates. So, of course, everything's ready at the push of a button, really. Yes, exactly. I've got two more bits to do here, and then we'll pop this onto our bag. You must get so many people visiting your home, Emma, who sees all the wonderful things you've got around. And how did you do that? How did you personalise that? How did you create that wording? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's no end, isn't there, to what you can achieve with these yeah. machines? Oh, yeah, totally. Um, I mean, but I will charge people. <laughs> So they don't ask yeah. me anymore. Or they've gone and bought their... Um, oh, I've just realised I've missed an E off of there, but we'll grab it in a minute. 
or they've gone and bought their own joy or yeah. their own machine um, so that they can make it themselves, which is really cool. Even my brother-in-law, he uses my sister-in-law's joy to make his own T-shirts because uh, he got bored of waiting for her to make them for him. So he just <laughs> picked up oh, Design wow. Space and well, the Easy Press and off he goes. There's a lot of the staff here at Achandra have got the Cricut uh, Joy or the Maker as well. Some have got the Joy, some have got the Maker, some have got both, I believe. Uh, that's not me, by the way. I haven't got the Joy yet, but I have got the Maker. Uh, <laughs> I have got the Easy Press as well. You never know. I might just have to. Um, I've got my credit still to spend who knows <laughs> I'm just going to save that E that I've just lost there so as this won't make sense <laughs> put that in place I think it was about there oh we're down to the last minute again Emma Can Ooh, we do we'll this? get it yeah Can definitely it? Um, so we're on the transfer tape onto my bag it's going to be wonky but we'll pretend it was a design choice okay obviously at home do take your time to uh, Make sure everything's where you want it. Obviously, I'm up against the clock, no, clock now. Give it a good scrape. And then we'll peel it back. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at that. Lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. And you've transformed that totally. There we go. There we are. Oh, you are the right person. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Emma, thank you so, so much. Don't forget to check those baskets out. Don't miss out on the offers. Don't forget your credits if you've not spent them as well. Oh, that's my final show today and Emma's as well. Don't forget <laughs> the Cricut product will disappear after 24 hours. Check your baskets out now. See you soon. Oh, another lovely show with Emma there. Coming up next, we're celebrating with Crafty Devils. Then, of course, Phil's back. Sentimentally yours, birthday shenanigans, weekend wow. Oh, I fitted it in. Then we've got the Fabazine one day special final call. Hi, I'm Donna, and this is my brother Simon, and we're Pearly Winks Craft Supplies. We've been crafting since we were very young. My mum got us into crafting and we've been loving it ever since. We have a good selection of inks. We started with our winks, which are just the water-based ink, and then went on to the pearls. We've added some chalks, we've got some glitter sprays, and then we've added some beautiful stamps to complement the inks. We've got a fantastic design team who help us with all our designs for the stamps and we've got a great range of inks which we manufacture ourselves here in the UK. Our pearl sprays and our pearly winks are loaded with mica so they give you amazing results on your projects. We hope that our products bring you as much fun, creativity and inspiration as they do to us. We love all of our products and we hope you do too. So make sure you don't miss our shows on Achanda. Indeed, it's Achanda's fifth birthday. Give yourself a stitch doing that. I've been down there for weeks. Now, it is Achanda's fifth birthday and we are looking at seven day savers. And now, they've just given me a little bit more time to tell you about another one. This is Oakwood 12 by 12 grey board sheets. Uh, 2,250. Micron is what we're talking about, and we're talking 20 sheets in total. £13.99 for all the sheets. You're also saving the £6 saving what you've got on here. Get them while you can. A seven-day saver is a time-limited offer. It works out to be... 70 pence a sheet. 423749 is the item number. Remember, anyone purchasing throughout the live hours will also get their free uh, free gift. Oh, who can forget the free gift? Right then, off I pop, lower level. Flexi order has arrived at Hachanda. What is Flexi order? When you place an item on FlexiBuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi order, which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments, so you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments.
After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping baskets, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly Flexi Buy payments, offering you the extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with Achanda easier. Hello, I'm Barbara. And I'm Julie. And together we're Scarlet Rose Crafts. We're a family run business, been in business for two years, and our aim is to bring new and innovative new products to the crafting industry. We've both been involved in crafting industry for many years, and we're continuing to move forward with our new company now. The Easy Mat Plate is our flagship product, uh, followed by our innovative Easy Shim product. Our range includes diamond trail plates, ultra-sized dies, cards and sticky sheets. We're constantly developing new and unusual products, so watch this space. On our shows, we hope to inspire you with our products so that you can carry on crafting, because our motto is, because we can. So don't miss the Scarlet Rose Craft Shows on Achanda. I'm back in the studio and of course we are in the middle of our fabulous fifth birthday event. Now we have got Mel back again for our second show. Hi. Hi um, what time were you on earlier? 9am. 9am. I know, it feels like a long time ago, <laughs> yeah. I know. Now, it was a really busy show at 9am. Um, now, everything is on a happy hour deal once more. Uh, so, as the name suggests, it's only for this hour that you'll get these lovely prices. Shop ahead, uh, because we have got the website here at Hachanda. And there we go. You can see all of those lovely bundles. We've got MDF. We've got some stickers. We've got lots and lots of art boards. Oh, I love those lights. They're so pretty aren't they uh, there's gesso you can get some uh, some sponges there's storage even uh, papers gosh there's so much and we've got magnets look at all of this so do, do get ahead and um, they're all fabulous happy hour deals marvelous now we've got this um, box bundle here and if you want to see how it was made Mel made it at nine o'clock I did yes in fact let's have a little look at this one this is so pretty how it's been made. That's gorgeous. This little box. Let's have a look inside. Can I open it? Yes. There you go. And you've got your sponge storage. They look like little eggs, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you could if you wanted to put eggs in there. Why not? Yeah, well, we chatted earlier on the show and we decided that um, there's some very nice luxury chocolates. Oh. And if you just um, put a bit of tissue paper around them, yep. um, you could put them in there and give them as a gift. Christmas, Mother's Day, birthdays, mm. anything. So. Lovely idea, loving it. So what we've got here are, uh, you, you make your two boxes there. Uh, so. Oh, was it just the one? Where did I get two from? I'm so sorry. So it is the one box, uh, and you are getting uh, all of your smudge, uh, smudges, sponges. <laughs> Great start, Alice. Great start. You can tell I've had a bit of time off. Now, the sponges are £12.99 on their own, so that means that the box is just £7. Um, when, there we go. We'll get you the uh, details on screen. So for £19.99, here it is. So you're getting your 12 blending smoothies and your MDF smoothie box kit. 19 362779 Now, if you don't need the sponges currently, you can also just make the boxes. Uh, that's where you get the two... Uh, that's where I was getting confused. That's where you get your two MDF smoothie storage boxes. And that is 14.99. Again, only up until the end of the hour. 582725 is your item number. Now, if you do want to um, top up on magnets, there's a lot of people like using stamping platforms, don't That's they? That's right, yeah. Yep, lovely. So we've got our magnets here, and they just pull apart, and obviously they're going to keep your cardstock and everything in place. Uh, 
12 stamping pl platform magnets and it's 11.99 and you have an eight pound saving so if you do want more now this is not on extended delivery because it's sold out just before the hour um, now it's 799249 and it will be dispatched from the 5th of September for all of those. So 1199 7992499. Then next, uh, we have got some gorgeous Christmassy peel-offs. I think these are coming back into fashion, don't you? They're great, just yeah. for a little add-on, aren't they? Absolutely. So you can see you're getting the uh, gold and the silver, you've got sentiments, you've got lots of you know snowflakes and bells and baubles and stockings and I like this one because you can literally build a scene here because you've got those little houses, very very cute indeed. I have just spotted the saving Mel. Yes, it's huge. Wow, twenty-nine pounds and ninety. Uh, sorry, and twenty-six pence off. So it's just nine ninety-nine, but only for the hour. I mean, again, great gifts, right? One seven five one three three is your item number. Next, then we have got grey board in all sorts of different sizes. So Mel, these are kind of your your blank canvases really aren't they Mel? They are, you can do anything with them, you can make little um, notebooks, mm -hmm. your little albums, yeah. um, 12 by 12 album as a gift for somebody, lovely idea, um, or just de decorate them um, as you wish. Yep, hang them, up, hang them on the wall, there you go. So you're getting 4 12 by 12 inch, 8 8 by 8 inch, 16 6 by 6 inch, 16 4 by 4 inch and 16 of your four by six so you've got a lot of your grey board there to play along with from crafty devils 15 pound savings so pretty much half the price at 14.99 item number is zero five one three zero six next now one and a half kilograms of mdf is what we have for you today look at this so all assorted shapes aren't they yeah all assorted so um really good for decorating your mdf plaques yeah um, so you get lots of different shapes and sizes. You can do all sorts with them. Loving these. I know I mentioned this a lot, actually, but you could make... Oh, let's see, you've got so much here. But you could make, like, a little... Instead of a shaker card, you could make, like, a shaker frame. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. just get a bit of your foam pad tape, a bit of acetate, stick some glitter, and yeah, away you go. And that's half price. It's £12.49, and pence, a whole kilogram of assorted shapes, 447491 is the item number. Then we've got a really good bumper pack for you. Again, assorted shapes. So we've got some door hangings, you know, um, pop over the door. You've got some lovely little plaques that are shaped. Yeah, I like the scalloped edge. I like it's this. quite posh. Yeah. Yeah, a bit different. A bit different. And these have got holes drilled in so you can make your plaques, you can make your signs. Uh, you've got some ovals, some rectangles, lots of different circles. You could make those ball balls if you wanted to. Uh, we've got hearts, hearts two different shapes, you can see you've got your sort of more traditional heart and then what I kind of call your folk heart. Uh, so with your MDF it takes so many different mediums. We have reduced the price by £15 only for this hour. It's £19.99, uh, nearly 40% of the stock has gone. 921271 is the item number. Then moving along we have got some round and oval MDF baubles. Uh, again, decorate up however you will. They'll take your acrylic paints, your decoupage papers, rice papers. You're getting 12 of each, and you've got a £10 saving. Item number is not uh, item number is not 9.99. The price is 9.99. 142004. And then, last the thing that we can fit on the counter because <laughs> we couldn't get any more out. We've got the art boards. Again, you've got some different uh, sizes but you can see lovely rectangles here. Lots and lots of different sizes. I won't rip the pack shot, you can see them here. Got one that's in a nice long strip actually. And you've got a 20 pound saving. It's 14.99, item number is 298777. Now some more items. Uh, if you want to use gesso onto your MDF, just to give it that nice base coat, uh, we have the black and the white gesso. It's 14 pounds and 98 pence. Item number is 423. 665 and we are over half the stock of this gun. Next we've got the LED lights which I adore these. Right, you're getting two meters on them and you can shape them as well. They're really pretty. Uh, 14.99, a 15 pound saving, 102, 
0.898. So these are your LED lights. Right, so you've got three warm white in colour and three sort of rainbow multicoloured. What, uh, 102898 is the item number. Now, if you like the cork top shaped ones, which you may have seen, because in gift shops at the moment, people are selling bottles that have been painted up with these sorts of lights in and charging quite a lot. I'd say just enjoy a bottle of wine and make your own. Um, £15 off, £14.99 is the price, 609465. Now, we've got so many lovely happy hour deals for you. Now, we are limited stock uh, on the stamps. This is 9.99, and you've got a £23 saving. Actually, no, 9.97. Shave off another couple of pence. 054843. Next, then. Now, we were really busy for this earlier because we have got some blackboard paint, 500 mils, 9.99 with a six pound saving. 016460 is the item number. And then one more thing is the glossy effect. And this is 9.98, you're getting the two 82 mil bottles. It's 3D glossy effect, in fact. 9.98, item number is 121675. Shall I do a quick mention of the gift with purchase? We've got this for you. Lots and lots of MDF tags. There you go. Gift with purchase on this show. Uh, so <laughs> as long as you're buying... Say that again. That's not the gift with purchase. For this I hour? Think, yeah, I think you get the extra large tags and you get five of them. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so I think I've decorated one at the back there. Um, okay. Which I'm going to show, um, hopefully. Uh, uh, but that's okay. the size you'll get in, and you get five of them. Apologies, apologies. 9.99, 4.5. Thank you, Mel, just to clarify. <laughs> 4.57.8.5.1. Right then. Okay, over to you, Mel. So you're using the hexagon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to do um, a little art board, which um, this is my first art board that I've ever done. Oh, so, live on air. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm going to use my gesso because. It's good to prime all your products before you um, use your expensive products. Yeah. So I'm just going to gesso. And this gesso is so lovely. Look how smooth it is. And you get such a big bottle of it. And what I like about it is the lid is not a clip-on lid. It's, it actually locks. Oh, OK. Um, so for going to your craft groups when you can go back to your craft groups right um, I think some are starting now as long as they're distanced yeah so um, really good like so you can take it with you you're not yeah. gonna have to worry that your lids gonna pop off and so it's a good size isn't it it's a really good size so yeah. you don't have you know you don't have to worry about being um, frugal with it mm -hmm. you can just do what I do and just slap it on <laughs> <laughs> Um, and if you do want the gesso, bottom of the screen, you get the black and the white for fourteen ninety nine. So the black's really good if you're using a dark colour, mm -hmm. and your white's just really good for everything, really. Yeah. Um, so and it gives it a really good coverage. So you see, that's it's just one coat. Yeah, lovely. And I just smooth it over, mm -hmm. so we get a nice finish. That's your gessoed bit. So, because we're live, put that to one side. You're very well prepped. And there's one I did <laughs> earlier. Excellent. <laughs> so, um, and then I'm going to, so I'm going to put a coat of paint on there very quickly. So I'm just using a chalk paint. Mm -hmm. And I'm just going to do it randomly. I it doesn't have to be for my project. I'm not a neat crafter. So well, do you I have just, a craft room? No, I oh, have not Well, I have an office. Right, okay. That doubles up as a craft room. Got you. <laughs> but is it messy? Oh, horrendous. Yeah. <laughs> and if anyone knows me, they know like um, at home I like everything in its place. Yeah. And yeah. Um, nice and tidy. Mm -hmm. And I'm always telling Mark off for uh, not shutting cupboard doors and you know, <laughs> things like that. Um, but my office is horrendous. Oh, absolutely horrendous <laughs> at work. So then I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to put that to one side because we're live on TV and we haven't got dry and time. I <laughs> love that. <laughs> so that's another one I did earlier. Excellent. <laughs> it's like magic, isn't it? So, um, and then I'm not going to use um, 
on this one. I'm not going to use any expensive, any more expensive paints. I'm just going to go with my gesso again mm -hmm. because it it doesn't just have to be a base, yeah. a base um, product. You can use it for other stuff. So you can hear that click mm -hmm. on your, and it's got a nice squeeze to it. You've got a big tub there. Keep you going. It'll keep you going for a while. And then I'm just going to gesso over the top. Okay. Not too heavy. There we go. We've put the details on screen for the gesso. 500 mils for the black and the white. 14.98. 15 pounds off. 43.665. It's like your makeup, isn't it? Like yeah. You buy nice makeup, and it's not cheap, is it? No. So you, you should prime. <laughs> <laughs> prime. So it's the same with like your MDF stuff. You mm -hmm. just save on your expensive products and prime. Lovely. Okay. Right. So then I'm going to let that dry. <laughs> You're going to have loads of so samples. I'm going to have loads of samples. Look. So then it dries like this. So, um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to roughly. This is cool because then you get a nice distressed finish on it. Yeah. So I just want a little bit of that grey to come through. Yeah, sort of knocking it back. And a little bit of a scratchy kind of effect on it. Yeah. So you can use sandpaper. Or, like me, just an old nail file, really. That's what I thought it was. Yeah. Why not? It does the same job. Well, it's tend to something you've always got around, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Never without mine in my handbag. No. And our oh, sandpaper's always like, you've got to buy big sheets of it, haven't you? You yeah. can't just... Well, I'm just going to lightly brush that off so I don't get... Just wipe my... There. And then I've got one of these lovely big stamps, which are really good because they come in a nice little wallet. Do they? That's great, that is. So if you've got a folder, you can put your stamp straight into your folder. Yes, I love a bit Keep of storage. Keep it nice and safe. So, and because it's a big stamp, mm -hmm. so I'm going to peel it off my acetate. And I'm just going to use the lid of my stamping platform. Oh, that's a good idea. And uh, you've got £23 off these stamps. Now, is that... Is it going to stick? the right side. Yeah. Yeah, it'll stick. I just need to... Because on your stamping platform, you have a rubber side and a clear side, don't you? Yeah. And just to let you know at home that these are super limited. Here they are. Limited stock for these. 997-054-843. Ink it up. Is this a, an embossing ink, is it? Um, this is a hybrid ink, oh, so you right. can emboss it, you can colour with it, anything. But any of your ink pads will do. Yeah. It's, um, I'm not doing anything too fancy with it. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to do it at an angle. But I want to, with this stamp, it's the haberdashery one. So I want to make ah, sure I get yeah. the scissors and the mannequin on my board. But, and again, it doesn't matter if the whole stamp yeah. doesn't come out. Okay. Um, it should do, but it doesn't matter if it doesn't. Uh, now, the stamps have sold out, but don't worry, because we can still keep the uh, hexagon, the artboard, on the side of the screen for you. So we can carry on, basically. So there. So I quite like the look where it doesn't... So I haven't put enough pressure on the middle okay. bit, but that's the look I like. Mm -hmm. And for this project, it works perfectly. Cool. So then I'm going to use what I love, which is my structure paste. Lovely. Which I, I believe you've got on the, on the website anyway. It's not in the happy hour, but you've got it on the website. Yeah. And then I'm going to go around the edges. Now with the uh, hexagon, if you're liking that, you can also get a circle. If you want to go for that, you could go for both because it's, you know, half price. There you are. So those are the hexagons, lots of them. 
Uh, and then there's the circles, $14.99 for either option, $499.974. Uh, oh, and you get 28, lovely, in total, right, good stuff. That's going to create great texture, that. Yeah, I love it. It's one of my go-to mediums, I mm -hmm. think, now. I just, um, no, I don't. So I'm using it because, obviously, the stamp is A5. Yeah. But And, obviously, to get a hexagon stamp would be a miracle, I think. <laughs> <laughs> this size, anyway. So I'm just covering up the edges. But I don't want them. To, I don't want it to be straight either. Mm. I want to add. It's going to be really tactile, also. Yeah. So I'm just going to It's good actually because when you've when it's dried, I mean you could change the color and spritz over it. Wow, yeah, that's it. The paste. Wait and see. <laughs> Nice. So. You're kind of making that look crackled, actually, just sort of the way you're it. It's got like a it. shimmer to it yeah. as well, I think. Yeah. And um, I just, I, I, I should have been a builder in a previous life, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think my point work would be very good, do you? <laughs> All is good. <laughs> so. Got to try not to get it on your fingers now. I know. <laughs> Yeah, that's looking real. I like that distress bit in the centre. I think that I really it. works well with this structure paste. Yeah. yeah. So then, clean yeah. This, I love this stuff. It's just <laughs> one of my favourite things at the moment. So then I'm going to leave that to dry. Um, I think you can um, dry it with a heat tool. Right. Um, but you have to be careful not to overheat the MDF. Mm -hmm. Um, because if you overheat it, it might warp a little okay. bit. So I tend to let mine dry, like for a few hours, mm. and then go back to it. So I could have a little display you going could. on, like a um, little beehive or honeycomb, be, dis a know, honeycomb display. Wouldn't that be nice one. on the wall, actually? So there's that. Look at that. That's one I did earlier. Very <laughs> nice. Look at this. It's Excellent. like a magic show. <laughs> so then I'm going to decorate with my mousses okay you, but like you said you can use all sorts with this you can um, your spritzes your polishes uh, we do have nearly six minute queues on the phone lines our fastest way to order is online at tachanda.com super busy that's good well now that's looking like cement actually uh, I could have been a builder. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. So just build up your nice your colours. If you have got any of the MDF from Crafty Devils from previous shows, love to see what you've been making. <gasps> Maybe you got the uh, Halloween. Oh, you know those boxes. I'd love to see what people have done with them. <laughs> Uh, all the Christmas ones, we had Christmas ones. We'd yes. love to see how you've decorated them. My favourite one, I think, was the Noel one. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. I would love to see what people have done with that because uh, we did get lots of orders for it. Um, you can send your pictures to studio at tachanda.com or pop it on Facebook. We like seeing what you've been doing because it's all about the inspiration. That's it. And people have different ideas, don't they? Mm. I don't know where some people get their ideas. <laughs> Lots of time on Pinterest or somewhere. Oh, right. Okay, so we've had a question from Margaret. Hello, Margaret. Hello, good afternoon. Um, so I think you were asking about whether you have to put a code in for the gift with purchase or why it's not on the invoice email. And um, Lot is telling me it literally just gets put into your order. So that's what will happen. I'm kind of assuming it. Well, I'm. Anyway, it just will come with your orders, but and it's five of those in that size, the large, large. So there we go. So apparently you should absolutely still get it. That's what I'm saying. There you go. Thanks, Margaret. Yeah, I think when we pack it all up, it just, just yeah. And I think you you get one per per customer, I believe. Yes. So, oh, bit of gold. Uh, I'll just mix it up a little bit. 
I love a bit of shimmer. It is my favourite. It just adds to the... I like to see a little bit of the texture paste underneath as well. Yeah. Just um, gives it that kind of different look to it, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? And then when you wiggle it, when it catches the light, that'll look really lovely. Yeah. So and I'm just putting it on with a brush. It doesn't have to be a certain type of brush. Any type of brush. Yeah. Just slip it away. As long yeah. as it gets washed. That's it. <laughs> That's yeah, it. just wash it after. It. <laughs> Otherwise it'll go rock hard. That's looking really nice, that one. But And you can build this up as much mm. as you like, really. Um, uh, don't forget as well, uh, the show is all about the happy hours. So there will be going back up at the end of the hour. At 3 o'clock, all the prices will be going back up. I mean, this one is half price. There's loads of advantage and um, things to take advantage of. Oh, yeah, and if you haven't spent your £5 credit, that is waiting for you. As long as you spend £25 um, or more. Yes. They're getting some really good deals today. They have been, haven't they? Have you got an, another stage yet? Um, <laughs> no, I'm going to finish this one. Okay, that's cool. That's my plan. Right, finish this one. So I just want to add another colour, I think, of mousse. Mm -hmm. Like I said, you can build up your colour. I yeah. just want a bit of a paler colour in there. And if you don't want to use mousse, of course, the MDF will take sprays, spritzes. It will take all your mediums. Yeah, it's very forgiving MDF, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Mm. Oh, now, see, I don't like that. Oh. So I think it's too pale. So I'm just going to change it. So that's the nice thing about this. Yes. If you don't like it, just go over it with something else. Okay. If you don't, it doesn't matter. Like with your MDF baubles and things, if you're deciding to change your colour theme each year, you can just repaint over them. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. the darker blue so I think it gives a makes the background look a bit more gray mm -hmm. do you know what Mel Adam was saying to me earlier because you know we, we've just been talking our Adam about how crafters we get messy this is true. yeah <laughs> <laughs> because Adam has started die cutting with his little girl <gasps> yeah bits of paper everywhere everywhere, everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> we um we use a lot of glitter and stuff at work yeah. as well. And, um, Mark went to the hairdressers. <laughs> was he covered in glitter? Well, well no, she just went, because, to be fair, he's not got a lot of hair left. Oh, right. So, um, <laughs> and she was like, do you know you've got glitter in your follicles? On your, your head. Follicles. <laughs> <laughs> on your head, your head follicles. And he was like, yeah, yeah I've run a craft shop. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe so. she was wondering what he'd been doing the night before. Yeah, well, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> she probably thinks he dresses up or something. Yeah, he does not. <laughs> <laughs> so once I've done that, mm -hmm. I was I've with this lovely stamp. I know we sold out now, but mm -hmm. for people who have been lucky enough to get it, yeah, you'll see on it. I don't know if you can see on the T. If I turn it around that way, you might be able to see a bit better. There is a mannequin. Mm -hmm. Um, a sewing machine, scissors, and a cotton reel. Right. So what I've done is I've stamped them out, that bit out again, and cut them out. Because I'm going to use them on my board. Uh, now, we are nearly half the stock gone for our hexagons. And don't forget, you can also get the circle option as well. So did we say there's 28 pieces in each one? Lovely. 14.99, 15 pounds off. 499974. Um, now the largest is 25 centimetres and the smallest is 10 centimetres, just so you know. So I've used my smoothies yep. to dab a little bit of ink on these. I'll just uh, quickly show you. And I've gone round, look at that, I've straightened my paint. Just to go round. The edges as well just to give it that mm. grungy kind of look yeah 
So that's smoothies are brilliant for that. Cool. Smoothies on their own, they're nearly two thirds of the stock gone. But of course, you can get them with the box as well. But that's on extended delivery from the um, 4th of September, they go. And that's at the bottom of the screen. Back to you, Mel. So then I'm going to just use my glue gun. And I've curled these a little bit with my pokey tool. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to stick it over the haberdashery, the haberdashery, the mannequin. Just to give it a little bit of... Bit of lift. Bit of lift, bit mm -hmm. of 3D-ness. Would you recommend a hot glue gun for this or...? Um, I think so. I think a wet glue, if you're not patient, takes a while to dry. Yeah. And if you want to get that kind of 3D look, a hot glue gun, you can build up the the look of it, can't mm. you? You can yeah. bend it into place and it dries quicker. The only thing is you get these lots of little like sp spider webby bits that you end up pulling off everywhere, don't you? I think if you use a heat gun quickly, they'll dissolve. They'll dry, yeah. yeah. I think so. I'm a bit, I need to use my heat gun more. I don't use it enough, I don't think. Oh, I'm addicted to mine, embossing. Mm. So, and then I'm going to stick some little buttons, I think. They're cute. Yeah. Everyone's got, this is just from my craft stash, mm -hmm. but I'm sure everyone's got buttons in their craft stash. My mum has um, a button tin absolutely filled, and it's in this really, like, ancient tin, and it's like, ah, oh, I'm never getting rid of that. My nan used to have one. And um, when I used to go, I've got glue all over my thumb. Um, <laughs> when I used to go to my nan's house, yeah, um, I just used to put my hands in the button tin and play. Yeah, there's play. something about it, isn't it? Yeah. They're so tactile. Yeah. Getting glue everywhere. Our, our director's just said she keeps hers in a tin of biscuits. Obviously, the biscuits, the biscuits must have been gone. eaten. Yeah. <laughs> so glue those. Do you see my spider web? I'll pick that off when it's dry. Mm -hmm. Um, and then in my stash, I have some florist bits and pieces. So, just going to cut. I don't want it that wide because it will take up too much room. Okay. And I've used a spritz. It was green. I used it. I used it on the smoothie box earlier. Oh, lovely. And it was green, and I've just spritzed it to give it a different colour. Mm -hmm. So, I'm just gonna cut that in two pieces and this is where where you've got that distressed look you can just cover it over a little bit yep nice so angle it as where you want it and glue it down it's cool stuff oh i need to get some of that in my crafty stash so handy yeah nice and extra bit of texture yeah and I've got that one lovely heck it watch your fingers yeah hot glue gun see lots of <laughs> <laughs> you can't see on the on the screen I don't think but there's glue everywhere now and then I've got some flowers in my stash that I'm gonna add Are you all right yeah, I was just looking. I've got, I've got one of these already done. I don't know where I've put it. Oh. It's here somewhere. It's because, if you were watching the show earlier, yeah. you know, I've misplaced my glasses. Oh, uh-oh. I hope we find them for you. Well, I don't know. They could be at home. Oh, OK. Yeah. As long as not, don't, don't start hunting for glasses, because okay. they could be they could be back in Devon. Right. Devon, lovely part of the world. So. I'm just thinking. I've got yeah, in here <laughs> somewhere. somewhere in here. Somewhere. What are you after? The one that I did that's finished. Totally. Oh, have I put it behind me? Uh -huh. mm. Now I'm. I'm oh, searching the set. It's behind you. It's behind me. There it is. Oh, it's over there. <laughs> okay. So um, that's my finished one. What I've done yeah. is, um, because I know um, some, you can't always get the sentiment that you want. Yeah. 
So what I've done is I've printed my sentiment out on my computer. Yep, lovely. But because I wanted it slightly bigger, mm -hmm. so and um, because my printer doesn't take thick card, right? I've printed it on paper, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use uh, my <coughs> extra wide. Yep. Um, we can give you the details for this. This is on extended delivery, and it's your double-sided tape. 210 millimetres um, and you get 10 metres of that and then the other one is 105 millimetres ah there you go they look like candles don't they uh, and you get 20 metres so you'll get 30 metres in total and it works out at 43 pence per metre I, I'd like to confess that I did the math but I didn't do the math <laughs> oh right the tall one's the size of an A4 good to know um, Right, back to you, Mel. So um, your A4 is really good for putting on your A4 card. You can glitter. Yeah. Um, use your gilding plate. Indeed. All that kind of stuff. So hopefully this is going to peel off nice and easy. But like I said earlier, I forgot my glasses, so I'm not sure I can see. <laughs> Bless you. So that peels off. I've got mm -hmm. the bin down there. And then I'm going to stick it onto um, our 300 GSM card. Yeah, just Which created is your own card stock there. Perfect for um, stamping on. Yeah. But really good, gives a bit of structure to your paper. Because so many printers now don't take mm -hmm. card. card. No, they don't. And um, if you want to print print something off, you think, oh, well, I don't want it on paper. So I'm just going to cut this out. Mm -hmm. So happy. That's cute. I thought seeing as I was a haberdashery. Yeah, themed. Yeah. Um, just while you're cutting that, we have actually got the finished sample in the set. There you go. Isn't that pretty? Really liking that. So it's just a different way. Yeah. So obviously you've done the flowers and that different, but it just mm -hmm. shows you it doesn't have to be the same all the time. Try and be tidy as I go, <laughs> unlike at home. <laughs> <laughs> so, have my sample back here. Then, mm -hmm. I've got my corner punch. Kind of <coughs> if it will. Yeah, it's because it's thick card stuff. Yeah, now. exactly. I did it earlier and it nearly flew off the counter. <laughs> It's nice to round the corners, it just it, it finishes it off, like you say. Yeah, it just yeah. gives you... Not everyone likes straight edges, do mm. they? No. Nope. Oh, that was a tough one. I know, is it going to go? Yes. There you go. And then I'm just going to ink the edges. Mm -hmm. I think that then ties it in. You really, uh, it draws the eye in. It, and it softens the yeah. harshness, doesn't it? I mm. always think sometimes white card is quite a harsh yeah. um, finish. <clears throat> and just put a little bit over the whiteness to nice. dirty it up. Um, and if you want the smoothies, they're on the screen. You're getting 12 of them for 12 294 And then we've got our lovely foam tape. Which I think you've got um, some on the happy hour as well. Oh, we can bring you the details. So if you do want the foam tape, here it is. $14.99 for a lot, Lottie's saying. Here you go. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> you've got adhesive, the, right, you've got five rolls and then you've got ten sheets of your foam pads. For $14.99, item number is 431846. Now you're getting 9 mil and an 18 mil, so different thicknesses. Those are for the rolls. And then you've got the foam pads, also different thicknesses. Uh, you've got 5 mil, 12 mil, and 24 mil, to be very specific. Uh, 431846. I'm going to use another bit of this because I love this stuff. Yep. I've, you know, I've had this in my craft box probably for about six years really yeah I'm not used to oh well it's getting its <laughs> debut so and then i want this to be a little bit higher so. 
do. So fantastic. what I did with it, just to change the colour of it, yeah. um, before I spritz it, um, I gessoed it. Okay. Um, just to hide the green. Yeah. And then the spritz took really well on top of the gesso. Good. Angle. How to angle it? I'm going to do it that way. I'm going to tuck that bit underneath. Yeah. Oh, it's solid though now. Underneath isn't it? my flower. Yeah. Do it there. And then I might add another flower. Mm -hmm. You've colour toned this brilliantly. It's kind of similar colours yeah. to my front room. Oh, really? Greys and blues Grays as, and blues. as mm -hmm. my favourite colours at the uh. moment. I have. Oh, I want to decorate my bedroom, but I keep thinking, oh, I don't. The whole do I house paint it grey? grey? Do I yeah. paint it grey again? Or <laughs> do I choose a different colour? But I'm drawn to a pale grey. Okay. So, and there you can add some more buttons. But Yay. it just goes to show all your different things that you can do with it. Fab, do you want to lift it up slightly? Great stuff. There you go. Yeah. Thank you, Mel. Uh, so just while you get set for the next demonstration, yep. um, we'll do a quick recap then. So first off, you, we have got the smoothie storage. So you'll be able to make the box and it does come with the smoothies and you're getting 12 of those. Now it is an extended delivery. Uh, 19 99 is the price. Look at this. And here is the version that Mel made earlier on at 9 a.m. I'll just move that out of the way. Now, the um, sponges on their own are 12 99 at the bottom of the screen. Uh, so that would make it just £7 for the box. If you do want two boxes, it's 14 99 uh, another fabulous uh, value. There we go. Uh, then we have our magnets. So if yours have broken, you just like to have more in your crafty stash. Oh, yes. Oh! No, really. L um, Lottie's telling me earlier, somebody emailed in to say that one of theirs had got caught on the roller in the die cutting machine. <gasps> oh, yeah. So uh, hopefully the die cut, did the die cutting machine live? Oh, it survived. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I'd be so heartbroken if I ruined my die machine. Anyway, uh, these are 11 99 and it's being dispatched from the 5th of September. And you're getting 12 of them. There you go. Oh, yeah, this is true because Phil Martin started using four now. There we go. I think he's coming up next, actually. 11.99, item number is 799249. Then we've got some Christmas stickers in the gold and the silver. Uh, they're proving really popular, these. We are half the stock gone, so you've got sentiments, you've got like little houses, you've got all things associated with Christmas because there's. Um, Ball balls and bells and stockings and all sorts, and you're getting 30 packs. Ooh. And if you imagine how many elements are on each one, how many stickers, that is a lot. And you're only paying 9.99. Works out at 33 pence per pack, uh, and you've got a 29 pounds and 26 saving, and it's 175133. Remember, everything on this show is a happy hour. So you have got 20 minutes, well, less than 20 minutes. Oh, what have I kicked? Uh, to get them at this set of prices. And then we'll move on to our grey board. We've got an assorted set of sizes. Four 12 by 12 inch, eight 8 by 8 inch, 16 6 by 6 inch, 16 4 by 4 inch, and 16 4 by 6 inch. So there is a lot to keep you going there for your blank canvases. 1499051306. Then, if you just want MDF to play with, we've got an assortment of different shapes, and you've got one and a half kilograms of it all in here, which sadly got dropped all over the floor by accident earlier on because there's a lot in here. Diamonds, all sorts of different shapes, what I always call rooftops. I know there is an official name, but I can't remember maths. Um, oh, rhombus. Is that the right one? Is it? Is it? Uh, no idea they're saying, but you could say that. Uh, oh, she, she could be right, they're saying. Uh, 12 pounds and 49 pence, half price. Item number is 447491 is the item number. Then we have our bumper pack. 
Uh, you've got hearts, you've got circles, there's the door hangings, different sizes. So you've got one that's got the full round, if that makes sense. And then you've also got the one that's, um, it's almost like half a heart, half a heart shape. There you are. And oval plaques are here with some holes drilled in so you can hang them up. These plaques, I always think these look really nice and posh, I don't know why. So you're getting 30 round tags. Um, how many? We've got 15 door hangers and 20 plaques and some are heart shaped as well. Uh, you've got what I call your traditional heart and your folk heart. This is a big bundle. £15 saving, it's 19.99, 921, 271. Then we move on to ball balls. You have got your sort of oval shaped ball balls and your circular ball balls. 12 of each. Oh, it's so nice to, you know, make your own ball balls and hang them on the tree. Wonderful to paint up. Oh, Lottie's saying this is a good idea. If you've got the cricket, if you've already got one or you've got one from the previous hour, you could personalise these. Oh, oh uh, Lottie's had a cracking idea as well about your Pentart mirror spray. I remember Leona using that and it's cool stuff. Oh, and did, did Catherine use it as well? Oh, we think so. Brilliant. 9.99. Item number is 142004. And then last but not least for the counter, because we've got loads more on the show, um, we have got some different sized art boards and you get a real assortment there. There's a £20 saving. Item number is 298777 and you're paying 14.99, but that is only up until the end of the hour. Pretty much 15 minutes left to get your happy hour deals. More items. We've got some masking paper. So if you want this, it's 9 99 with a £5 saving. This has now gone limited. 133994. We have got some double-sided tape. This one is on extended delivery. It's going very quickly again. I do need to get some of this, really do. £12.98 with a £17 saving. 40% of the restock stock has gone. 925792. Then if you want large MDF tags, right, these are, uh, how many have we got? 20. Excellent. And they're 100 by 200 millimetres, 9.99, half price, 377.789. Okay, next then we have got the uh, blackboard. It's the blackboard paint, 9.99 for 500 mils. So it's your blackboard paint, six pounds saving, 016460. How many happy hour deals have we got? This is amazing. Have we got like 27 happy hour deals? Wow. Uh, then you have got your foam collection and you're getting the rolls um, and it's 14 pounds and 99 pence. 431846. If you need something stronger, we do have the red liner tape and you've got six rolls of your 12 mil, six of the nine mil, and then five meters each. Wow, 14 pounds and 90 pence. Item number is 195634. And then last but not least for now, we've got uh, double-sided tape, six rolls of the 12 mil and six um, of the 6.9 mil. No, no, it's I was gonna... Six rolls of 12 mil and yeah. six rolls of nine mil. Okay. That's just, I think that's just written up a little bit wrong. Uh, yes, we'll get that changed. Yeah. Thank you. It did seem a bit odd, didn't it? Yeah, I don't think there is such a size. No, I was like, this is very precise. <laughs> there you go. We'll get that sorted for you. Anyway, double-sided tape. You need it in your life. Um, right over to you, Mel. What are you doing for us? So I'm going to, so you get a free gift with your um, purchase in the happy hour. Yeah. So I'm just going to decorate your free gift. Okay just to show you oh good we'll see the size then which yes is marvelous because it's a substantial size yes it's, it's really nice and I'm using um, the lovely papers lovely um, that you get on the happy hour and I would say they are really nice papers I love the colors mm. they're um, they're not too bright they're quite muted cool and they all coordinate together nice I have them here you've done some boards for us Mel thank you um, you have got the stripy pack, as you said, 12 colours, 48 sheets, 160 GSM. Are these strobing a bit, I wonder? <laughs> and then we have got the spots. 
Again, 12 colours, 48 sheets, 160 GSM. Yeah, good colour range there. They just, they all coordinate lovely together. So I'm just going around. And I get yeah. a little bit scared of craft knives. Oh, well, I use a, a big knife at work all the time. Yeah, you used I think, to it. Yeah, I'm used to it. I think the only yeah. person who gets scared is when I've got it in my hand, Mark gets scared. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and of course, if you're not a fan of craft knives, you could just draw around it and cut it out that way. Yeah, this yeah. is just so much quicker. Yes, of course. So. And it doesn't have to be neat because um, I'm just going to use my nail file on it to do the edges. But I would like the glue to dry before mm. you start filing, really. Yeah. So then I'm going to use my red liner tape. Now, this tape is really good because it's extra strong. Mm -hmm. So it's really good for your ribbons, mm -hmm. um, your heavy cardstock, um, boxes. Yeah. Perfect for boxes. Anything that you um, want stuck, sort of like permanently, yeah. Use your red liner for, and it's very easy. I'm addicted to it, red liner tape, because I do lots of gift boxes. Yeah, and it just sets them straight away. Now, it does come off very easily, but like I said before, live TV, live always. TV, and I haven't got my glasses. Bless you. So I can't see. I hope you find them when you get home. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I do need another eye test, so there we go, look. Perfect. But even without my glasses, it wasn't too difficult. So I want to put another piece on there because um, my ribbon's a bit thicker than that. So I'm just going to put a bit of ribbon where the join is to hide the join. And it's... It's red liner tape, mm. but it comes out clear. That's great. So we get asked a lot of questions when we do um, the retail shows and that about this tape. Uh -huh. You know, mm. what's the difference yes. and does it come out red? No, it comes out clear and it's super strong. So again, I've been in my craft stash mm -hmm. and got some bits and pieces out of it. And for everyone that's been watching, yeah. we'll know that um, a week before lockdown, we were a dog-free house. Oh, no, and, what? what? Tell me the story. And now um, the whole family, everyone in the family's got a dog. <laughs> really? <laughs> so there's three dogs now. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> so all, not all in my house. I was going to say, no. right. <laughs> but Christmas is going to be fun. It is. <laughs> so I'm not sure who's going to get the turkey, us or the dogs. Probably the dogs. <laughs> Probably. So I've done that, and then I'm going to get a little stamp. Um, and these stamps are from our Gypsy Meadow range, oh, lovely. which you have online. Are you using the Super Smooth stamping card? I'm using the Super Smooth Excellent. and the magnets. magnets. Yes. So they are really strong. Mm. So, and the, the stamping card is lovely, and it is, as it says, super smooth. Uh, so you're getting 50 of the A3 sheets and 100 of the A4. 300 GSM, very good for construction as well. 19.99, saving five pounds, but you've only got eight minutes left. The A3 is perfect for if you're making boxes and stuff. Yeah. Um, like you said, for construction, and it's such a nice, um, card for stamping on. Lovely. Make sure I've got all my things. Oh, That's cute. Do we still have these stamps on the website, do you know? I believe you do. Okay. Yes. Let's have a look for those. They're, they're from our Gypsy, Gypsy Meadow range, so yeah, I believe you've got the whole range. Oh, good. On, online. Mm -hmm. And their sentiments are, I would have to say, the sentiments are lovely. Nice font, range. actually, I'll just see. Yeah, there's um, so many different sentiments in one set. Mm -hmm. 
and the fonts are lovely and they're not all the same so you're getting a quite a good variety that's good you have got Mel uh, about two minutes to so say you know but I've just spotted we have got one sample. Made yeah earlier. I just spotted it <gasps> so corner punch yep yeah. you like a hole punch don't you oh, I do <laughs> or a corner punch and again I'm going to use my smoothie mm -hmm. I really don't like harsh lines lines yeah so your smoothie is just perfect for just going around those edges mm, lovely Uh, smoothies on screen there you go 12.99 for 12 of them so just over a pound each if my maths is correct <laughs> two nine four five four one but great because you get 12 you can just different colors yeah for each Keep of your rings for each yeah different color rather than having to rinse them and wash them and yeah can't be can't be bothered with that can't be doing all that <laughs> and then Right, so Mel, because we're running, we're out, running of time. out of time. Yeah, we've got the finished sample just at the back of the studio, um, so you can see sort of where you're going with it. Oh, that's yeah. adorable! Isn't that cute? So, and you could use your magnetic clasps mm -hmm. and mount that onto um, your A4 board. Yeah and um, put a nice bit of ribbon around it and have it as a note board in your kitchen. Oh, that's a good or, idea. you know, by the door so yep. that you don't forget the dog food. See, that's lovely. Thank you very much, Mel. Uh, really Thank quickly, you. when are you next in, do you know? Oh, um, September. There's uh, something. A couple of... Uh, eight, 18th, I okay. believe. <laughs> 18th. Right. We will see you then, Mel. Okay. Right, Mr Martin. because Phil has brought for us his Sentimentally Yours birthday shenanigans weekend. Wow, that is a lot to say. Uh, and then, of course, we've got the final call of the one-day special. Then we are celebrating with Daisy Chain Designs. Hi, I'm Hayley from Craft Yourself Silly and we're really excited to still be working with you guys here on Hachanda. We were there from the very, very beginning and we're still bringing you lots of really exciting soft crafts. We design and manufacture all of our kits and all of our fabrics here in the UK and we love bringing them to you. So if you're an experienced sewer or you're just starting out in soft crafts and sewing, join us. There's tips and fabrics for everybody. Make sure you don't miss our shows and come and craft yourself silly on Hachanda. Hello everybody. So, seven day savers during our birthday weekend or birthday week celebrations, we know we're going to give you something very special indeed. Take a look at this. It's aesthetically so beautiful but also incredibly practical. If you're looking for a quality glass cutting mat with a metal, uh, you've got a metal lined ruler as well, so it has got that metal edge to it, so great for your cutting. It's not going to cut into uh, the ruler or damage that. You are getting your ruler, you're getting your large cutting mat with loads of different uh, formations with the measurements as well, so all your key card, si uh, card sizes are accommodated in here. $14.98 is your price, saving £9, 
Tales, brought to you by Oakwood and Archer. This is a really beautiful addition to your craft room, all courtesy of our seven-day savers. Uh, just to remind you as well, do have a look on our website, because if you make any purchase during the live show, then you'll be in line as for a birthday gift. So do have a look at the full T's and C's on our website, and lots more seven-day savers to discover. Hello, my name's Stuart, and I'm the Managing Director of Oakwood Archer. Oakwood Archer is a family-run business, and my son and my daughter work very hard with me to bring the best craft items to you in the UK. We specialise in high-quality items brought into the UK from all over the world, including brands like Kaiser Craft, Stampendous and Impression Obsession. Working with Achanda is fantastic for us. It gives us the opportunity to bring all of these brands and all of these products from all over the world direct to you, the crafter in the UK. Our products include stamps, dyes, papers, buttons, trimmings, ribbons and album making kits. Just about everything you need to be a good crafter. So please, don't miss Oakwood Archer Shows on Achanda. This is Els from Elizabeth Craft Designs. Elizabeth Craft Designs is a Colorado-based company. It's a family company, so husband, son, daughter all work in the company and then a fantastic team of designers because a company cannot exist without a great team around yourself. What we would like to share with you is my passion for crafts. We love all the concepts we have, so we have from cute till classic and beautiful designs. We love our journaling planner line and we are going to bring you our ideas, our passion and we hope to transfer that passion to you. So please join Elizabeth Craft Designs here at Hochenda. Yes, indeed. Good afternoon, one. Good afternoon, room. I hope you're well. Right, we're going to go straight in. No messing about this time. Um, I've got. Oh, I know. No messing about this hour. I've got a lot to tell you. First of all, it's birthday, as you can tell from the green drapes. Then. We've also got urgency on your weekend wow. Now, it's meant to last a weekend. It kicked off on Friday. It went like the clappers with our Scott. Then our Catherine came back this morning. Well, she sold out of it and left me nothing. I was going to use another word then. I guess I didn't. There, so now, we've now worked out. It's back on extended delivery from the 12th of September. When it's it has gone... It has gone. This is not one of these where we'll make phone calls because the man that we make the phone call to is currently standing next to me. <laughs> and he's told us, in all known terms, once this is gone, this is gone. This is your weekend well and a third of the extended delivery has already gone. What are we looking at? We are looking at a brand new collection that once broken down is ridiculous value for money. You are looking at a per stamp set for £9.15 pence once you break down that overall price. You've also got it on two flexible payments as well. And let's introduce the man himself. Uh, it's our Phil Martin. How are you? Uh, well, thank you, stranger. Good I afternoon, know. everybody. It's my um, last hour. Oh, and Julia takes over tomorrow, if there's anything left, obviously. Well, it won't be. But yeah, be it's been really busy, so thank you, everybody. This I'm is good, not you. No, I'm good, thank you. Go Very on, well. Go good, well, as, as yeah. well as you can as be. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But this is not you. This is this different. is not the Phil Martin I know. This is different. It yeah. is. I have actually done medleys before, but I've never done a floral themed medley collection of stamps before, uh, which is obviously something different. It's a little bit fresh. It's a little bit funky, but obviously it's done with my style. So you can apply these stamps to whatever your style is. You know me, I like pretty, I like my, my pretty balanced cards, but I also like to do the other end of the spectrum. As long as I've got control and the stamp isn't too dark and too grungy, I'm absolutely happy, and that's why I've brought you with these. They are I've, I've designed them slightly stunning. different to how you would normally see montages and collage stamps because they are traditionally quite heavy, this. and these are not. These are quite the opposite. They are exquisite. Aren't they? 
even just stand out. I know. <laughs> a bit of Matt and layers. I know. I know. So this was this was the idea. The idea was to have the floral element as your focal point. So you've got six absolutely gorgeous flowers in these. You have the lily. You have the daisy. You have the hydrangea. The dandelions that you're looking at now. Uh, what else have we got? The lily rose, and there's another one. The lily, and go on, here we go. That's better, thank you for that. The rose, the dandelions, the lilies, the daisies, the iris, that's the one I forgot, and the hydrangeas. So they are all the focal points on your stamps. However, you can choose them not to be if that's what you want. You can choose the music in the corners to be the, the yeah. focal point, or the tiny elements within them. You've got so much control with these, they're, they're so much fun. Well, they're stamps within a stamp, and this is what I like about these sorts of stamp sets. For the sheer fact, yes, you've got the flowers, and you say, yeah, I love the flowers. But then you're thinking, well, I don't want to do a flower card. Maybe that's not for him, but I want that element from that one, and I'm using, going to use a focal point from that one. This is what you can do, and as Phil said, you've got full control over what you achieve. Um, and I'm going to put it out there, the TV does not do these any justice whatsoever. When you get these home, they are stunning. I've watched two hours now of the weekend, wow, just to see what we had on the show. And I walked into the studio and my, my mouth hit the jaw. I was like, oh my word, these are beautiful because there is so much you can do with them. You are getting six stamps, uh, six sets, sorry, uh, for £27.47. And, and once they have gone, they have gone. 40% of the entire stock. And, once it, and I keep saying, I can't say enough. Once it's gone, it has gone. And for the money that you're paying here, £54.94, pence, two flexible payments of £27.47, pence, that breaks all of that down to £9.15 pence per set. But then, we can do better once again. If you've got your £5 from yesterday, as we are in the birthday event, remember, anything you spend, you're going to get that £5 voucher to spend off, it takes it down to £8.32 pence per set. It's worth doing. <laughs> And then we've not even thrown in the free gift, which is, first of all, I was shocked that it was the free <laughs> I gift. I was doing a free gift. Yeah, first of all, <laughs> Phil, giving a free gift, never. Um, but for That's what it is... That's been on bread for the rest of the week. Oh, my word. That's one of my ombre paste. I know. Now, the reason I've done this is because, I mean, you know I love my ombre blending paste. The reason I've done that is they work really well with these stamps. And Julia's just on a Facebook Live. She didn't use the paste, but I'll be doing one next weekend on my Facebook page where I am using the paste with the stamps, yeah, to show you how they work. So for adding texture, for adding dimension, it goes so well with the montage style of these stamps, yeah. This is a £6.50 pot, yeah, that I'm giving you with these because I want you to start seeing what I see when I start putting my cards together and using all these different products. Mixed media but my way. And that's what we like. Yeah. So it will be, all those colours I showed you, you could get any of them. Okay, so you're going to get, it's a random yes. choice of a pop brand. Yeah. I thought I'd show you all the colours just so you sort of knew what you were going to get. So you're getting one of these as well. So in theory, take another 6 99 off that price as well. You can't go wrong. It's one of those why not deals, as it were. It really does pay for itself. £54 and £94, something else that will pay for itself. And you've been waiting them for months. They sold out... They came back, they sold out again, we've got them back, but with a twist. Now you're looking at three weeks extended delivery, which I know we don't normally do, from, from the 21st of September. Now I know what you're thinking already, because I would have done the same. That's a long way away. First question I asked, we walked into a meeting, I said, it's all well and good giving me the pens from the 21st, but I'll wait till you have them back in stock. Phil said, this is the only time you're going to get them, this year. If you want set four of the brand new pen collection, the collection you've all been waiting for, and if you're like me and you said, yeah, I'll wait, I'll wait to the coming, they won't be there. They will not be there. The only way you're going to get them is get them now. If I was you, £29.99 is what you're looking at for these. Remember, you're getting your fine and your large water tip brushes as well along the bottom. And these are the colours that you have been waiting for to add to your collection. Not only are you going to get pens, you're also going to get the colour dots to add to the casing. So now you're going to know where every single colour that you reach for every single time. £29.99, pence, one, two, seven, four, seven, nine. As I said, and I'll say it again, this is the only way you're going to get them now. I know there's a three-week delay on them, 
but the only way you're going to get them this year is if you get them now and then. What's three weeks? You've not had them for the last two months. What's another three weeks? Okay. We've had another sellout on the show as well. Getting quick, if I was you. Uh, the Super Smooth Hot Press Watercolor Card has gone. That it sold out while we were doing the openings and introductions. Uh, we've got it back on extended delivery. You can see how busy we are now. Uh, from the 1st of September is what you're looking at. £11.99. This is your super smooth hot press. If you're going for the pens, this is like one of these why not? They go hand in hand. And it's normally nine times out of ten, the emails that we see on the Facebooks and things like that, all oh, my pens don't work as well as they do on the TV. Maybe you're not using the right card stock. Maybe you're not using the right terminology. The terminology is the paper that you're using. This is going to be the right one. £11.99. Pop it in with the pens. Pop it in with your stamps. Everything's split onto two flexible payments. Bob's your uncle, as it were. Let's hand over to the man himself. Not Bob. It's our film. <laughs> <laughs> is this your first hour? First hour, I yeah. I can tell because of the energy. I'm like, this this is my second and I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> this is my first day back from a few right. days. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is something slightly different. We're going to be using the brayers, we're going to be using oh. some paints from Indigo Blue, and we're going to be using... I've just borrowed Lou's blueprint sketch because I forgot mine. So colours you wouldn't normally see me put together, but do you know once I'd started prepping this card, I absolutely loved it. This is the hot press watercolour... I'm looking over my glasses. Sorry, everybody. I don't mean to do that, but I can't actually see the monitor if I don't. <laughs> Um, this is actually the hot press watercolour card I've used here and the reason I've used it for matting and layering and for die cutting is because it's a slightly different shade, it's not pure white, so it needed to all match for me. So what I've done here, I'm just going to take you through what I've done before I start stamping. Are we overhead or do you want me, there you go. So I've done my matting and layering, just, I can't remember what the sizes are, but I'm looking at it knowing me it's 23 by 18, so the base is 23 by 18. I've then matted down with the, um, this is the cobalt blue cardstock that you will get on the website if you go and search by brand. And this is using my lemon zest premium cardstock as well. But look how gorgeous they look together. Yeah, and then I've taken another piece of the watercolour card and I've die cut it with the double debossed rectangles. So if I just tilt that, you'll be able to see that we've got the double debossed. Just got the double deboss going on in the yeah. corner. Look there, yeah. And what I've done is I've used one of the new embossing folders and I've just embossed half. This is the beaded swags, yeah. I mean, that looks amazing just on half, just on half nice. doesn't it? Yeah. So uh, I've done some boards. I'll let you, when you do your bit, I'll let you show everybody the okay. boards. So I've just done that halfway. I've then cut myself from the new boarded eyes. This is from the Perfectly Pretty set. So we've not got to them yet, but we will do. So the perfectly pretty set is the one that's got the scallops. And I've done one of the base dies with one of each colour. And then I've just done the same pretty one. And we're going to make this a double border, OK? All the way across that card. Before I start that, I've got my matting and layering from the double deboss dies. And then the top one is the watercolour card in the elegant eyelet rectangles. And we are going to stamp the new Flora Musica dandelion stamp on this. And then we're going to get all inky and splatty and what oh, have yeah. you. So this is where I do all my stamping because it's not, it's nice and clean underneath, look, yeah. 45% <laughs> oh, of the Julia's stamps have now kill me. already She's gone. <laughs> Poor old Julia tomorrow, she'll be playing with pearls. <laughs> She's just done and it, by the, if you've not seen it, Find Julia on Facebook, she's just done, I've watched nearly all of it, apart from when I had to come in here, an amazing demo on her Facebook Live with, with the new stamps. Well, no, she had, I tuned in when we were talking about mats and layering and where to put stuff. Yeah. She said, take <laughs> photos. Very good. Right, so one of the things I haven't done, and I can't believe I've not done this yet, I'm not going to do it now, but I'm going to do it before I go today, is I'm going to just do a little close-up of all the stamps. I'll just flick and show you close-up from me. But what I want to do is just show you how these will all work with the dies look. So you know that the A6 is going to it's going to more or less fit perfectly in there. Oops, which is exactly what I want. Get that back underneath there. And I'm going to stamp this with the Onyx Black Versifying Claire. No, it's not a Claire. I always get the two mixed up. It's just the normal Versifying in Onyx Black. Because we're going to spritz over this, we're going to bray over the top of it. And we're going to make it look very pretty and very funky indeed. So let's just pick that up. Hang on, I know what's going to happen. See if I can get these on now and stamps in position. How much are we betting that I get this car finished? 
Um, <laughs> I'm going for... I will get this card finished. I will. I 65% promise you. 65% of the card will be done. And we'll just I've place gone, stuff I've on gone close from, to the end. In days gone by, it used to be three demos an hour. <laughs> Then we've got to two demos an hour, then it started to get to one and a bit, and now it's one. But what I always, always, always do is it from start to finish. No, it's, which, yeah. is, which is nice. Didn't the first one take you nearly a day, the rose one I watched this morning? <laughs> <laughs> it might have done, it felt like You started like it with it. Scott, you finished it with Catherine, the presenters <laughs> yeah, later. Yeah, yeah, it's true, it's true that. And yeah, that was the quickest card. <laughs> Anyway, right, so we're just gonna we're just gonna stamp this. And as soon as I lift this up and you see all this gorgeous detail, you're gonna be like, wow, these stamps took me a long time to do. Not so much because of the content, because a lot of these little a lot of these little images, I've 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 had them for you. I've told you before about my big A3 book. I've got loads and yeah. loads of doodles in it. It's what I do when I've got time. Uh, but all these little like little hearts, silly things like that, they get used a lot. And they will feature throughout the stamps, oh, yeah. That. But the hard part for me was making this balanced, so I don't do, you wouldn't put my name next to Grungy, you wouldn't put my name next to Mixed Media even, because I, you, envis you envisage it being dark and, uh, yeah, and too Yeah, too I, know, I know what you mean. The hard part for me was getting the balance of these right, so if you, as you're looking at that, you can see that that is not dark and gloomy. It's, there's loads of white space in there. However, if you want to do dark, you, you can, can easily yeah, do that with absolutely. these. Absolutely. So I'm just going to wipe this stamp because I can't have dirty stamps and there's a final stain my stamps. So I can't do it. Sorry. You've got to watch me do it. 50% of the extended stock has now already gone. I've said it before. Once this has gone, it's gone. And I, you know me, I don't like to be pushy or anything like that. That's not what I'm here for. I'm here to get you best possible deals possible. And if you're liking this stamp collection, you think, oh, I love them. I'd love to have a little go. Don't wait till tomorrow. Do not wait till this time tomorrow when no doubt I'll be saying, actually, they've gone. Unfortunately, they went last night. They went yesterday when me and Phil were presenting. Uh, get them while you can. 50% of the extended stock has now gone. £27.47 across two flexible payments. You're saving that £8. But when you break them down per set, it's actually working at £9.15 a set. If you then go with your £5 off that you get because it's birthday, it's actually £8.32 per stamp set. And you imagine how many stamps you're going to get from one stamp set. And your pens, get your, just get your pens. You love the pens. So let's do, we're going to, I'm just leaving that to dry for a second. Versifying uh, does just dry really quickly, but I'm going to do the sentiment because we're going to do lots of inkiness uh, all at the same time. So these are the new trio frame sentiments. I'm just going to flip them over. I think they've been busy as well. These are brand new. These are designed to be, um, you can use them exclusively, or they work really, really well with the Ticket Tape Tastic that I brought you uh, a few months ago. Different font, same sort of style, but different altogether because you've got trio, you've got three frames, look, yeah? So you've got three different oh. choices of how you cut that out. So you, you've actually got more, as Julie was just saying, because if you matted it onto another frame, you've got four and five if you keep going and so on and so forth. So we're going to use this, we're going to use the Inspired Sentiments. I love this one and I had a lot of fun deciding on which words were going to go in this, in this set because you think of inspirational, you're always going to have to create, the inspire and everything like that. But what you've got here is this very first one, which is the one you're going to use the most. Freedom 2. Freedom 2. And now you can actually, that opens up a whole new world of how you use your sentiment yeah. stamps that I've brought you in the past. Yeah. Like. So, Freedom 2, and then you just go for it. So, we're going to do that. We're going to have Freedom 2 be. Is this going to be another collection? Is there going to be add ons to the, these? There wasn't going to be, but when I did my, face, my Facebook Live last week and I asked people, do you want the relatives? Do you want the extras? It was a unanimous yes. So at some point, what I will probably do is there's, there's no point me now bringing you these back as a one day special because I've used the two that, that are the main part of it really. I'll probably bring them back to you in a couple of sets at a time so that you can just collect them. So we're going to have Freedom 2, B, no that's not B, that's and, Freedom to B, and we're going to have, we're going to have Beauty, no let's have Strong. Freedom to be strong. How about that? So that just opens up whatever it's you really want that smart. to mean. Like you get like older and wiser and things yeah. like that, which you don't I normally know. see I in I a stamp know. set. 70% uh, of these stamps have now already gone. You've got, uh, the pens are currently... Oh, no, they're not. Oh, you've got Cheeky Freedom on this as well. What, on the new stamps? On the new stamps. 
Yeah, see, I don't know about these things till I get here. <laughs> I must, I must, I must speak to somebody. <laughs> yeah, I would. Right, so I'm just literally stamping them. This is scrap from my uh, hot press watercolor card. Uh, don't throw any of this away because it's just too precious and it's fa it's fabulous. And we're going to be braying and all sorts over this in a minute. So we're going to create completely unique sentiments from that. You know what I'm going to do to these stamps, don't you? Wipe them clean. I have got two sets, but it's just because I like to keep them clean. I, I, you know, in, like when I watch Leone and I see her with the stamps oh. and then she, they're covered in ink and then she's like, just putting them over there, I'm like... <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> right, so we've got that going on. Now we're going to start brayering. So you've got both brayers on the show. I've put them purposefully as a set of two. Because when I, when I use brayers, depending on what I'm doing, depends on which size I use. So small areas, obviously, you would use the 4-inch. But when you're doing big areas and you want to cover a larger space more evenly and quickly, oh. you need the bigger one. So we're going to do that. I'll just use You can see a bit. Look at this. Oh. I will just say I have got a lovely clean one <laughs> in my bag. So we'll start with, a, we'll start with the image first. And we're going to use Blue's um, Blueprint Sketch. It's got a butterfly in it, Lord. I don't know. I don't, are you saving that, Lou? It's got a little butterfly in it. <laughs> I'll save it just in case. So what we're going for here is a scratchy, a scratchy look. I'm not trying to cover the whole thing because I really can't see the point in that. So I'm literally just taking a little bit of the blueprint sketch. It's not, it's not even. It's not meant to be. And I'm just going to roll over the top. So you can see that that colour is going to tie in really nicely with yeah. that. Adam's like, Phil, this what is, is that? This is not Phil. I'm, I'm used to flowers and butterflies <laughs> and a bit of glitter. This is, this is not the film Martin might know. It's putting everybody on edge. <laughs> I've got St John's on standby outside. Do, <laughs> we're going to do the same with the sentiment as well. I've taken a little bit of ink off because obviously I want you to be able to read that. Now on my other demos, I've done two colours and I've done... Um, so on here I would use a yellow and a blue, but I'm purposefully just picking the blue out in this. And what we're going to do now is get the... You're, you're in, everybody's intrigued. I've never, I've never I love known it. you this quiet. <laughs> it's, it's clean messy. I've never seen clean messy before. <laughs> clean messy. It's a thing. It's a thing. And if it, if it wasn't, it is now. <laughs> clean as you go. Clean as you go. This is what... This is Jesso that's on here. Uh, this is gesso that's on here, and I'm, when I, I'd left it to dry and it wouldn't come out, it will. So if you if you get your brayers in a state like this with gesso, just get an old nail brush, bit of hand Give soap scrub. and scrub. It, trust me, it comes off. <laughs> I've tried. And we're going to do exactly the same thing. So the uh, gesso is Indigo Blues. It's amazing. I mentioned it yesterday when I used it. For somebody who's used gesso over the years, this is the best one I've ever used, and I don't say that lightly. You will get it on the website. So what we're going to do now, you see, see how that's still a little bit wet? Yeah. The gesso now will tone that down, and it will make it a slightly lighter shade of blue. But I'm not doing what everybody else does, where they put the gesso on a mat and roll it and bray it. I'm putting it on uneven and haphazard. I'll do this, and then I'll let you no, recap. It's all right. We're all intrigued. This is a demo in lots of different stages. That's fine. Is that all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm taking it, I'm just taking it from there and I'm just patting it on. You, and you know I've got a tissue, I'm not putting my hands in it or anything <laughs> like that, that's just crazy. That's crazy talk. <laughs> <laughs> just so on your fingers, no, don't be silly. That's never going to happen. Right, so all, all I've done, look, is I've made it patchy. And I'm doing this because people that have followed me for years will probably be in the same mindset as me, thinking, oh, do you know I don't do that? But as soon as you see me do it and you see it differently... I suppose so, once you've done it once, then you get, you get, you sort of break your comfort zone. Yeah, you think, oh, actually, absolutely, I've absolutely. On that one. So what we're going to do now is just tone down this with the gesso. So if I do the top half, and hopefully you'll be able to see, that it's now made that blue. Can you see that blue there? Lighter. It's a lot softer than that blue there. 
and you can just keep going until you get that as like in fact i'll do that while you give everybody I'll do some numbers because you've seen me do that you don't need to keep seeing me do it right we'll leave our phil uh briaring with his jesser we are ridiculously busy at this time of the day what time is 22 minutes past three is what we're looking at on a saturday afternoon and 50 percent now of the stock of our weekend wow it's meant to last the weekend you are getting six stamp sets brand new for our fill um this is not something we see normally from our fill but they are beautiful and i'll say like i said at the start of the show the tv does not do them justice you can use so many smaller elements out of these for example i know i've showed this sample and i've got loads of samples to show you but the flowers for example you take the flowers alone out of there. Fussy cut them out and then use them in your cards. Use the backgrounds for other items if you wanted to as well. Uh, literally stamp them out and emboss. How beautiful is that with your emboss that you're getting here. Now remember we are talking two flexible payments of £27.47 and pence, if my memory serves me correctly uh, with that as well. Uh, but then, let's break the price down for you, because this is where it really works out. So you are looking at £54.94, OK? Unextended delivery. And extended delivery, we're looking at the 12th of September, because it sold out yesterday. And once with this stock's gone as well, this is all we've got left. From then, that works out to be £9.15 per stamp set which is phenomenal value for the amount of stamps you're getting in one of the sets alone. With that £5 off voucher that you've received already, no doubt, it then works out to be £8.32 per stamp set. And remember, you are getting all six. The only way now of getting all six stamp sets is going for this large bundle. 346303 is your item number. Dispatch from the 12th of September is what we're looking at as well. Right then, while we've got flexible payments on this, this is a good opportunity to start adding to your basket. Don't let me poke or prod you in ways you don't want to be poked and prodded. I'm not here for that. I'm here to get you deals, and this is the best deal that we can offer you. So, these pens sold out when they were launched yesterday. They were bought back, and they sold out again. Phil's made a few phone calls, and he's managed to get some more. But, and unfortunately there is a but after this, we're on a three-week extended delivery. So we're looking from the 21st of September is when they'll be dispatched out to you. Now I know what you're thinking, that's a three weeks away. But let me tell you, once these have gone, it'll be one of these, they won't be coming back this year. So if you want set four to finish your collection, this is the only time to get them now. 127479 is your item number. £29.99 is what you're looking at. Once again, you get the two water brushes in there as well. And you're getting 24 of your brush pens, the super fine nibs that you're getting on them as well. You've loved them. You don't need to me to tell you about these. You've already got sets one, two, and three. The way of only way of getting set four now is going for them today. Twenty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. One, two, seven, four, seven, nine is your item number. Remember, you're going to get free gifts as well. Uh, one per household when you purchase is your ombre paste. Now, I mean, there's many different colours of this, but you are getting this worth six pounds and ninety-nine pence. Bear that in the back of your mind as well when we're looking at the prices, because in theory you could take it off because it is a free gift because it's birthday. Then we. We've got the stamps that we saw our Phil using as well. Very busy for these. Over 70% of these stamps have now gone. These are the trio frames. You can leave them as they are. You can cut into them if you wanted to give you another look, to give you another frame. So you can have that frame that's on the skew if, if you wanted to, which is a slightly jaunty angle that is there. You can have that deep black one that's just at the back. I think they're beautiful. I think they're nice just stamped out as they are. Because it gives you something quirky, it gives you something different. And the sentiments in there that I've not seen on other stamp sets. Um, I absolutely love them. £26.08 is a freedom price on this. 620265 is your item number. Or £28.98. Pop that into your basket with your weekend. Well, you're good to go because that will split the cost of that onto two as well. Uh, and you've got your freedom price as well. Remember, if you're not a freedom member, freedom has also gone down in price. So it's well worth having a look at £5.97 is what you're looking at now. Now, right then, embossing folders. Now, we saw this on the back of what Phil was doing. It's this top one uh, that we saw that we used at the moment. Now, you are getting all three of these, and I want to show you the size. Now, when I watched this earlier with Scott, and I watched it with uh, Catherine as well, I thought, oh, they're nice, nice little folders to run through. They are huge. It's the first thing I said when I walked into the studio. I went, oh, they're bigger in real life than all. <laughs> but uh, they are massive. So you'll get, I love this one. I love that top one because you're technically getting two embossing folders in one with that because you're getting that beautiful top and then you're also getting the lines of the bottom as well. If I hold that forward, you can see. 
26 pounds and 97 pence is what you're looking at for these uh, there's three in total that you're looking at as well look at this absolutely beautiful is what you're looking at and then um, I love this as well look, using smaller elements of this like, little doily look for maybe to go around the edge to go around the card if you wanted to just to do a little border 26 pounds and 97 pence is what you're looking at three four three four two three is your item number for those as well and there is so many things that uh, you will use these for you know you know your embossing folders but then there's so many new things on this show, which is what I'm absolutely loving. I'm like a kid in a sweet shot, is what I'm looking at. Uh, so, what we're looking at now is we're now looking at dies, is what we're looking at. Now, once again, these are not any ordinary dies. These are dies within dies within dies, as it were. Uh, you are looking at uh, 017523 is your item number. Seven, uh, 76 pounds and 97 pence is what you're looking at for these. But what are we talking about? Right, let me show you these individually. Let me show you the boards because it makes more sense. So, this is your perfectly pretty board and die set. So, you're getting this beautiful scallop. I absolutely, this on its own is beautiful. But then you can start matting and layering with the three other dies that are in there to give you this look underneath. So you now got that pop of colour that you use this for and then you've got the beautiful decorative look. So you've got hearts, you've got stars and you've also got like raindrops if you wanted them to be. That's your first set. From there we then look at your second set. The delightful deco border die set. This time we're looking at the sort of triangles, sort of like bunting that we've got here as well. Lovely shapes and lovely designs. Work wonderfully with some new dies I've also got on the show. Then we go into your strips. Now you can use these for so many things. That in theory could be split down the centre and that is two. You fold that in half, you're good to go as well. It's the same with these. Um, I don't like to use the word, but quite masculine which is what I like as well. Absolutely beautiful for masculine cards, because how often do you look at cards like this and you go, oh, it's a little bit, it's a little bit feminine, they wouldn't like that, but these, you're good to go. Very, very masculine, I love them. You can use them for female cards, it's entirely up to you, but they're good little choices of cards in there. They've all got double debossed in them as well. Oh yeah, they have. All of them, all of the different, but yeah, yeah. You, now come on, you know I'm not gonna do just border dies. They're going to have oh, more detail than They've that. got the double debossed lines in there as well. So we're yeah. now going to work with your dies that we've also got. And so maybe you've already got them at home. Everything go, everything that Phil does works together. You know it does. And if it's not right, it doesn't come to TV. Because um, that's how picky Phil is. And we love him that way. We wouldn't change it because you know you're buying into quality every single time. 50% of the stock here, by the way, has now already gone. Two flexible payments on this. £38.49 is what you're looking at. Uh, let's look at the website. Might as well. Everything's on there for you. Loads is on there as well. We've also got pens on there. Uh, your water brush pens. There's your embossing folders. Uh, we've not even spoke about the ombre pearls. This is set five of your ombre pearls, sixteen pounds and forty-seven pence. What are we getting in set five, Phil? Last set. So this is the last set of the ombre pearls. Uh, so you've got three brand new colours. You've not seen any of these before. Uh, I think if I remember, let me just put my glasses on. I think yeah, there's about there's approximately four hundred in each jar. So that's four, eight, twelve. That's twelve hundred individual flat back pearls. These are two toned. I'll let you show everybody when we come back. So brand new colours: velvet teal, lemon fizz, and secret escape. They are stunning. They are. What have I got now? I've got lime fizz in my hand. At so the lime fizz is like a lemony, a lemony colour, and a. And a limey colour, oh, no, it isn't, it's a turquoisey colour with a limey colour. And you, you can see the fit. flat backs on them as yeah, well, which makes them. Two different sizes, so you've got 8 mil and you've got 5 mil in there. Um, the 3 mils that I used to do in my individual solid colours were a little bit too small for the ombres. You didn't actually see the benefit of the two the two tone. But the way well, you've seen us using them on just about every sample that we use. They're, They're gorgeous, aren't they? Um, the get them while you amazing. can. Very busy across the board as well. I'll just hold this part uh, while you go to fill. I'll try and decant these back in. Over 60% of the stock here has already gone to all. Busy across the board. I'm not, I'm not just using the word to fill time. We're busy. <laughs> right, so let me show you where I got to while Adam was taking you down the counter. So I've just... The, these, these are the sentiments that I stamped, yeah? 
and I brayed over them a little bit with the white gesso so you can see we've got some some areas that are a little bit softer but can you see I've gone in with my what's called a blending brush pens on the outer frame I'm going to cut them out they won't look <laughs> it won't look like this permanently so I've just done that with that I'm just going to go around the edge of this again uh, so this is my main image that's got the dandelions and all the all the work, uh, all the stamp underneath it. So I went round the edge with a bit of kitchen roll and the gesso. I'm just going to do that again because I want it a little bit softer still. This is the beauty of this technique. So what we're doing is all about the layers. Um, so it, and it is all about the layers. So we can now soften this as much as we like you can take this as, as soft as you want the color is already on there we're effectively taking off until or covering up until you get to a stage where you're happy the other way you could do this is by using a different tone of blue but then it wouldn't have matched my card blueprint sketch perfectly matches the cobalt cardstock nice. which is why I've done it that way so we're just now look just a little bit on the edge yeah a little bit on the edge of the tissue and I'm literally so where that goes on really white Remember, this gesso is so good, it's translucent, it's already drying look, and it, it will be softer than that, and that's exactly the look I'm going for. As that dries also, it shows you more of the stamp that's underneath, so you'll start to see all the detail that's in there. You've never seen me do this, have you? I did actually do it yesterday with a different... I don't know where it is. There, look, with the daisies. Yeah, that's just, that's just the same techniques, but just a different colourway. There you go. So and that, that, I'm happy with that, but what I need to do now is that's very blue because I only used one. Oh, look at that. Look at oh, that. oh, medic. Gesso oh. on his hand. <laughs> <laughs> medic. St <Saint> John's. <laughs> Medic. <laughs> Medic, anyone? I like why no one comes running though. This could be a serious thing. Not one person has moved in no, the studio. I know, I know, they like really. Right, so <laughs> what I need to do now is I need to bring some of the yellow in. So in the absence of the uh, yellow ink pad, which is what I would have done had yep. I have remembered to bring... I brought every colour by yellow and blue. Yeah. Luckily, Lou had a blue, so but she didn't have a yellow. So we're now going to add the yellow elements in directly with the watercolour blending brush pens. So remember, you can use these direct. You can go over gesso with these. You can go over paints with these. It just depends what kind of paint it is. If it's an acrylic, because these are water-based, it, it won't settle. Okay. It will, however, give you colour that you can rub over and it will, it will go around the um, acrylic paint. But I'm just going to go in, look, and add some of my yellow. I'm literally going in. And, and it's not... I know, are. It, it's gorgeous, isn't it? So all I'm doing is I'm just adding little tints of colour. I'm not finished just yet. Let's just do this that says postcard. Let's just do some more on the butterfly. Am I right? I was right in saying that these pens won't be back this year. Uh, no, they won't be back this year because uh, on my original shows I said that there wouldn't be any stock until the the end of this year. But that stock that I'm talking about for the end of this year is what we're doing in the three weeks' time. So there won't be any more now until next year. Next year. Uh, not of set four. Uh, well, actually, none of the sets will be back this year because I'm not going to bring you set one, two, and three until I've got more of set four to bring you them all one final Together. time. Yeah, yeah. So that's that. I'm quite happy with that. I'm not going to add any more colour to that. So that has now made it absolutely tone in with my card That's behind nice look that. do you see what i mean about it not taking anything away from it. in fact if anything it highlights it more but we're going to do some flicking now other things you've never seen oh, oh, i've never with. seen you flick unless you watched the show <laughs> yesterday no i do i, I think what's the start now when i do paint flicking i don't do what what you might see k or leona everything to where they just <laughs> and it goes everywhere i'm putting my kitchen roll out because i don't want it everywhere and this was a lesson learned the hard way when I did it the other day and I sent picture, uh, Julia a photo to text and I put, I got it on my glasses, I got it on my t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to cover this up just because I don't want it everywhere. Right, you can do this, if, if I hadn't have used gesso on this and I've just used a softer ink, you can actually do flicking with your watercolour pens. Just put the ink on there, uh, get a wet water brush and just tap it, yeah? Oh, okay. However, because I've got such a strong colour already as the base, it's not going to work. I'm going to use 
these paints from k and alfie that are amazing i'm very lucky that i know them because i texted alfie and i said S send me some of your paints you know how you do <laughs> yeah, <can I? laughs> and he sent them me all which i thought was fabulous so i've now got a lovely cabinet full of these so i'm just going to explain to you what i'm using here these are translucent paints if you go on the website you will see you will see all the others that they've got metallics and, and what have you i've chosen the translucents because i'll get the color but as it dries you'll be able to see through it yeah so i'm literally just gonna flick i even treated myself to some of these look some oh, of these look i bought two i bought two sets julia were laughing her head off i texted her and uh, she said i said i've ordered two sets but of course you have <laughs> one clean obviously one for you so i'm going to do the yellow first and i'm just going to do a little ooh, a little bit there's obviously a lot of paint in there and i just want a little bit on there and I'm going to water that down. Remember, it's just translucent, so the more water you put with this, the more water you put with this, the more translucent it's going to be. And this will do... Oops, I don't know what I've done to that poor thing. You can tell it's my last show. So I squeeze a bit of water out. <laughs> I've never known you this quiet. I'm, I'm engrossed. I'm, I'm so I engrossed. I, I can't quite believe it. <laughs> Everybody I was probably in shock. I hope you've already had your, your dinner. <laughs> so now I'm just flicking some paint on there, look. Yeah, I'm not bothering with another brush. I'm just using my hand. If it's not flicking in, oh, it is. That's actually just the way I want it. I don't want great big splats of this. So I'll bring it up and show you when I get a little bit clear. These paints are amazing. So you can, buy, you can find these paints if you shop by brand, um, but I remember launching some of these paints um, a couple of months ago, and they, they last forever as well, don't they? Well, when have you ever known me say things about another brand yeah, no, that's the way true. I've just said that? Uh, I don't know whether we can get close enough. I want you to see these little flicks of yellow in this, and then I'm going to do a little bit with the blue. Look at that, look. It's all in the details. The colours are gorgeous, aren't they? That's yeah. Nice so I'm just going to do the same with blue. So if you need to... Shall I do... Yeah, we can do that. Uh, so, what we, we are phenomenally busy. We, we really, really are. So remember, not only are you getting a stamp set, a complete set is what you're getting with all the flowers on there, with the music notes on there as well. Uh, you're getting the six stamps in there. But you just look at the detail. Take anyone, Hannah, anyone you want, and just look at the detail that are on these stamps. Just look, just look, you've got the music notes at the top, you've got the postage marks on there. Then you've got the big blooms of flower that we're talking about. But then maybe you're thinking, well, the music notes, I'll go for the letter element in there. So you've got the letters and the notes and the fountain pen. Then you've got, you've seen the rings down the side that match with the dies that we've also got on the show, you see. Then you've got the key with more rings that match with the dies again to do those beautiful borders. Then you've got the clocks at the bottom with the, the handwritten note that may have been written from the letter and the inkwell that's at the top of the page but then you've got a complete stamp if you want to use it as a whole stamp you really really can uh, you've got things where you can now do things like this oh, is that stuck down is that gonna move look at that well, obviously it would stand like that but just use them as a whole or fussy cut elements out of them to do things like this it's entirely up to you. You're going for Phil's border dies as well. So now you can start massing names. And these are the ones I was talking about with the little perforation holes around the outside. So now take these that are going to work with that stamp set that, we're currently looked, that we looked at in more detail and start building them up. Quick and easy cards. You see, we've got the pearls on there as well that we showed you earlier that are ridiculously busy. Quick and easy cards that you can achieve. It's all achievable and you can do this. £54.94. I know what you're thinking. £54.94. Fair enough. Uh, £27.47. Let's make that even easier for you. That now means we're talking at about £9.15 per stamp set. Let's make that even easier for you. With that £5 voucher that we received yesterday, don't have to add any codes. We'll gift it to you on purchase. That takes it down to £8.32 per stamp set. £8.32. For a combination of cards that you can do so many times. Uh, 346303 is your item number. Then you also get your free gift included as well. You are going to get the most beautiful, beautiful of free gifts that you don't see that often. This is the ombre colours that you're going to be getting. Now you won't be getting all these colours, you'll be getting one of these. 
But even one's going to last you an awful... Oh, I nearly dropped him then. It's going to last you an awful long time. Reflex is like a cat. Then, the details that are on the side of the screen now are for the pens. Now, I know I quite say this quite blasé, but I'm, and I, I honestly mean it. You've lived without them for so long. What's another three weeks to your schedule? But when they get them home... You are going to complete your section. What are you talking about? Another three weeks. They sold out last night in record time. We got managed to get some back from our film. They sold out again. So we're now looking at the new shipment that is coming in, which is from the 21st of September. Three weeks' time. But this will now complete your set. It also, in the set, you're going to be getting your sticker dots in there as well. So you can now label up the edge of your cases so you know where every single pen is every single time. 24 colours. Different colours to the three sets that you've already had before. Very busy for these is what we are. Get them while you can. 127479 is your item number. Something else that's busy as well is the sentiments that you saw Phil use. 80% of these now have already gone. Uh, we are looking at sentiments that I've not seen before as a complete sentiment. Things like older and wiser that's in there. Make a wish. Um, special day. Lo uh, love you loads. See, little elements that you can sort of add to a note. Look, love you loads. Things like that. Uh, freedom to. I love the freedom to collection. Uh, freedom to colour. Freedom to create that's in there. Freedom to bloom. Freedom to grow. You've got so many more options that you can use. £28.98 is what you're looking at. 620265 is your item number for these as well. Uh, we've also got the dies as well. The ornamental borders that we've got on the show. Very popular. You're getting all three of these is what you're getting. You're getting all three for them for £76.97. Now, once again... I know they are considered purchases at that sort of price, but we can make that price even better for you. Why pay everything when you can split the cost onto two flexible payments of £38 and £49? Half the stock has already gone there. 017523 is your item number. Right then, Phil, uh, we're back with you to the end, I think. OK. Oh, that's brilliant. When you say that, does that mean I've only got, like, a couple of minutes or something? You've got ten minutes. Oh, that's plenty. It says so. It said. Right, so I'm literally <laughs> just cutting the uh, sentiments out. And easy, easy peasy to cut out, I'm just doing them with a pair of scissors. Obviously, you've got choices when you get these home. I've cut these right up to the outer frame of the stamp. But you could obviously leave a little bit extra on. Yeah, you could obviously leave a little bit extra on, which then gives it another look. You could mat it, which I have done on most of my samples. You could mat it onto another piece and then cut it again, so you've got another border another look so they're just going to be invaluable i'm just going to do the last one that's just drying nicely i flicked it with gesso and i flicked it with the blue paint um i'll tell you what they're called again in a minute so what we're using they were the indigo blue ones you can shop by brand for those same uh, with the gesso as well yeah, translucent paints are the ones that i've used for this but on yesterday's card the, the daisy one i used some of the metallic paints because they give you a lovely pearlescent sheen so, you could, you could tell I've not paid for them, can't you? Because <laughs> I can't tell you how good they are. And I wouldn't actually, well, A, I wouldn't use them if they weren't good enough. And B, I wouldn't be, are you showing everybody? So it's the same background that we did here. Look at that. That's, that's just done in exactly the same way. The only thing I did differently was decoupage the daisies and that's left nice. them just plain coloured. That'd be nice as a kitchen tile. Yeah. Right, okay, so let's get these borders put together now. Just while that's, I'll let you have a look at that just while it's still drying. If it's not dry, but when I finish sticking the card together, I will give it a quick blast with my heat tool. So, can you see we've got little flecks of the blue acrylic paint in there? Yep. And I've gone quite yeah. heavy with the gesso. If you look where the postcard is, you can see there's a big blob of gesso on there. There you go. That's just drying. It, it just adds to the effect, but for me, the important part is the thing about that is the stamp. Because it all starts and finishes with, with the stamp. stamp that's underneath and on top as soon as I added colour. Right, so let's get these stuck together. All of the new border dies come with the, I've called it plain, I think. I didn't know what else to call it. And I wasn't actually going to do this. It's only when I started thinking how I would use these. And I'm like, you know what? I want to be able to have the lovely lacy effect and I want to have the colour underneath. I don't want to be sticking that onto a piece of scrap card and cutting around it because it's never going to look professional. So this is why you've got that in all three sets. This has also got the double deboss detail. I've got glue on my finger now. Look at that. When have you ever seen me this dirty? 
you have and they've just paid days. Right, so they've all got <laughs> they've all got double deboss detailing and I've done that because it just makes them special, it makes them different to all the other border dies that you've seen before. And I will just point out, as I did with Catherine, all of the border dies, so all three sets that feature this kind of styling with the circles and the hearts and will be tying into something I'm bringing you soon. So this, this I already know from my initial delivery of the um, border dies that I've not ordered in all. So you, you've, you've been warned. <laughs> so I'm just adding a little bit of glue on here. So you know when you said 10 minutes, I bet it's not there anymore, is it? I'll try and be quick with this. I can't, see, I can't, I've got no help. I'm having to do all this manual seven, work myself. You've got seven minutes. It's just, that's just ridiculous. I'm into, I need a mat and layer. <laughs> It's <laughs> an official job title. <laughs> Matter and Alera. But I am determined to finish this because this is my last hour. I can't wait to see what Julia's got in store for you tomorrow afternoon. Hopefully, there'll be a bit of stock left for her. Uh, get in early, though. Julia's got a 7 o'clock show tomorrow. If you want to get in early, um, I would get. If you're not getting them now, I'd, I'd definitely get them tomorrow morning if they're still around, that is. She is three and seven, three and seven tomorrow, Julia. It's always good to watch Julia at seven. So you might both be just tap dancing at seven <laughs> tomorrow night. Right, okay, so I'm going to stick these layers on. Um, so the border dies, I don't know whether you've noticed this, but all of them are 20 centimetres wide, so just shy of eight inches. So 20 centimetres wide, and they're all three and a half centimetres deep, all of them, which now means if, you, if I wanted to, if I'd got more time, I could start overlaying with these. Oh, so if we cut more, and you, right? Yeah, it looks gorgeous, doesn't it? You can actually do that with all three sets. So if you've got, if you've got the Delightfully Deco and the Perfectly Pretty, for example, all you're going to get, I will show you, remember this is a different colour, it's just to show you, you will get a different look again look by mixing them. Yeah, do you see what I mean? Yeah. I've designed them specifically that way so that you've got loads and loads of choice and, and scope for building your own designs up with them. Right, I'm just going to stick these on quickly and then trim off the edges. Stamps, the beautiful, beautiful brand new stamps. Uh, was that 60? 60% 60 of the stock has now gone on the stamp. The details on your screen, 346303 is your item number. At £54.94, pence. you're getting both of them as well. They both come together. Of this set? Oh, of this one. Oh! I followed what I saw on the screen. I was kind of. Uh, so don't follow me. I follow you. Uh, so the weekend wow. So sixty percent of the extended stock now has already gone. So I thought that price was high. Uh, sixty percent. <laughs> I thought I didn't say that earlier. Uh, Fifty-four pounds and ninety-four pence. Two flexible payments of twenty-seven pounds and forty-seven pence. Three four six three zero three is your item number. If you do want the other set, eighty-five percent of them stamps have now already gone. They're the ones. Uh, um, I'm very busy on them. We'll put the details on the screen. Let's go back over to Phil. Right, so I'm just trimming off. Oh, obviously I didn't hold it long, you know. Famous last words. Uh, so I'm just trimming off the excess. This is why I wanted eight inch borders because I favour, well, you know I do, big cards. Um, but the point, the point of if I had borders that were too small, it would then be twice as much work for me to make them fit on a big card, as True. opposed to a big border die that I can trim down to fit a smaller card, which is just cutting it and then chopping it. Yeah, does that make sense? It makes sense. And I suppose I'm glad it does to somebody. If you're using the smaller ones as well, the smaller you go, then you've got more excess to use on other cards yeah, as well absolutely. to make tags that match and things. So obviously, you would leave that a little bit longer. To look how beautiful that looks. So for me, as my, a bit of a perfectionist that I am, just in case you didn't know, Never that little guess. join in the middle, even though you're not going to see most of it long, it bugs me. <laughs> so I've got a strip of card. I'm just OCD and I know it. I, I make no apologies for it because it's just how I am. So I'm going to cover that up nicely. It fits just nicely in between the two little debossed border lines, look. Hold that in place. Now, does that not look neat? That does look neat. Ah, it yeah. looks like a wraparound. It does, actually, yeah. It does. Four minutes, stop it. You said seven. <laughs> <laughs> and they right, normally take time really off. That's the full time thing. you've been given as well. <laughs> <laughs> you said seven four minutes ago. <laughs> 
Right, let's get this stuck together. I've got to get this finished. Luckily, my flowers are done. But I just want to show you what I've done with them. This is because I'm having to do manual work, like take off the backing off my phone tape and things like that. Put an advert out on the socials. So I can't wait till we're all hopefully back to normal. So I'm having it this way on with the scallops facing the right oh, way. Yeah, that means I've got to do more work then, though. <laughs> I mean, that just looks pretty before I even start. Uh, I'm going to just pop this on with glue. I would normally, as you know, foam tape all of this, but I don't think I'm going to have time. Do, do, do. Like three so, minutes. Oh, before I forget to tell you, if you're not already a member in my little Facebook group, uh, you can apply to become a member. You have to ask to join. It's called Crafting with Phil Martin and Sentimentally Yours. Um, I do check profiles before I accept people. <laughs> 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 Only because I want this to be a, a quality group where it's for inspiration and it's for sharing ideas. It's not for it's not for moaning about things and that. There's enough moaning and that in the world. No, that is true. So oh, where, where are it is well, a happy place. I'll have to see if I get accepted. <laughs> I've got no hope of getting into this little group. <laughs> <laughs> so crafting with Phil Martin and sentimentally yours. Uh, all the design team post all their work in there. I do mine. Julia does hers. So there's lo and all of the members are really active. It's a it's a lovely little group. Oh, if Julia got in, I should be able to get in. <laughs> So normally, as you know, I would have a little bit more foam tape on that, but we haven't got time to be messing too much. Two minutes. So this is not quite dry. Do you know what? I'm just going to be really naughty and do this. I would never, ever do this, by the way, because it's going to splat some of the paint off, but I want to get that on there. Oops. I would normally leave that to dry because the paints do dry with a little bit of texture, and that's kind of what we're going for. Oh, yeah, look how beautiful is that frameable. is. How gorgeous are these colours together? It's just so beautiful. Right, so I'll just stick these on a minute and a half. Do, do, do. Right, I'm just sticking these on if you want to tell anybody anything. Let's quickly tell, some, uh, tell you all about the pens that we got on offer as well. So this is set four of the pens that we're looking at now. Um, beautiful, beautiful pens. You already have set one, set two and set three. This is the final set in the collection that you will be after. £29.99. It's on a three-week um, extended delivery uh, from the 21st. Only for the sheer fact it's sold out and Phil's waiting for the stocks to come back here. And that's the only reason that we've got that. Uh, get them while you can because they're not going to be around for the rest of the year so this is the only show that you'll be able to get them on obviously the weekend wow shows so the only time you'll be able to get them uh, very busy ombre pearls are at the bottom of the screen as well let's go live back to phil for the cards well, so obviously i've not stuck my flowers on so i'll titivate them later but how gorgeous is that? that so you've got the freedom to be freedom to be strong you've got the flowers where i've used the embossing folder on them so you've got texture running through there that's the classic flourish I mean, I, I think that's gorgeous. You imagine replicating that in pretty colours as well, Beautiful. pinks and, and lilacs. And, and it all yeah. started with your stamp An hour from your ago. weekend. Wow. <laughs> and now Phil is off. I finished. Well done, though. It's been beautiful all demonstrations. Absolutely stunning demonstrations that we've got. Um, remember, you can watch all these back on Rewind as well. And where did it all start? It started with this collection. And you can achieve these as well. Thanks, Phil. It's been a pleasure. Thank you very much. Uh, Thank you, everybody. Weekend Wales back tomorrow now, uh, 3 and 7. I'll see you in a minute. Don't Yanis's legs look good there. Now, uh, coming up next, the, oh, you don't want to miss this one. It's an absolute stonker of a Fabazine. Oh, I love it. Well, hello, everybody. So I've got a minute or so just to tell you about one of our seven-day savers, and I think this one is an absolute corker. We are talking red liner tape. Now, we've got three key sizes here, ranging from your 3 mil to, ooh, to your 6 mil, and then you have your 9 mil. So great sizes to work with. You're getting eight reels of each. That's 24 in total, saving six pounds. 
that is an utter bargain and it is a consumable it is something we absolutely use as crafters so if you do want to pop this into your basket 612 206 is your item number uh, great way to stock up now take advantage of that six pound saving you can also see the other seven day savers on our website or use the hochanda app now i do need to tell you because we are celebrating our birthday in style there is a gift on purchase uh, during any live hour you can see the full terms and conditions on our website but have a gift from Ohchanda and enjoy it. It's just a big thank you from us for supporting the channel for five years and hopefully many more years to come. Hello my name is Catherine Sturrock and I bring to Ochanda my company Character Crafts. Character Crafts brings to you our laser cut designs. Each design is designed by myself. We cut them on the laser machines here in Doncaster and bring the products to you at home. Character Crafts is suitable for all ages and all abilities, so I hope that I can inspire you and help you along with your crafting. I like to show you how to use different paint techniques and different techniques to bring the characters alive and use various mediums to decorate. Um, and I also use air dry clay for decorating with the flowers. So make sure you look out for the Character Craft Shows on Achanda. I hope to see you soon. Dreaming of a crafty world, Dorothy and Wasabi slumber. Achanda's fifth birthday will be a time of wonder. La Blanche and All and Create. Wow and Rowan Dean is going to be great. Sentimentally yours, Clarity and John Next Door. Pink Frog and Daisy Chain. Who could ask for more? We'll credit your account with £5 to spend. Seven days of celebrations. The fun will never end. One day specials with all of your favourite guests. All at a socially respectful distance from the Wicked Witch of the Haley West. From fabric to paper, to glitter and pencils, pens and stamps, inks and stencils. Join us in August. Nowhere will be grander. Happy fifth birthday. There's no place like a chanda. Hi, my name is Blanche Siegmann. I'm the owner of the company La Blanche. The company La Blanche is a crafting company located in Germany. For over 20 years, I'm designing and selling stamps, paper crafting products, and home decoration. As a passionate crafter myself, I make sure all our products are of highest quality and easy to use. We produce a whole range of products. We produce paper products. We have also shrink sleeves for your jars, glasses. We have home decoration products paints and wall decals, everything, the whole range of crafting we produce for you. I hope you enjoy watching us at Hochanda and Crafting with La Blanche. afternoon well it's 4 p.m. which means this is the final call of today's one day special of course we're launching a brand new one in a couple of hours time now what we've got here is the Fabazine issue 3 I do like the name very much like the name um, that uh, Hayley here she is has brought I'm over out. here Hi. Lovely. just cutting some bits That's out ready for enough. the next one <laughs> um, now your Fabazine issue 3 um, enables you to make 12 projects which you can see an array of here uh, we've got like little what you call it thread tidies uh, look at this with the tulips um, we've got a little storage pocket with pockets yeah your cushion at the back there Alex yeah. is on its side you need to this go that, that way 
That's it. Keep the other way. Oh, other way. That's upside never down. Do it that way. There we go. <laughs> oh, Boom. thank you. Sorry about that. <laughs> so the Fabazine is all about kind of learning different techniques and doing so within twelve different projects. Right. So you've got one huge piece of fabric, mm -hmm. which is two meters by a meter and a half. Right. And there it is. on there you have printed all of the elements that you need to create all 12 projects. The only one that doesn't have fabric with it is the one which is the template. Yes. Um, and that one kind of is, there's always a project in there that's designed to use up your scraps. So that's the one that is in this one. Oh, okay. Um, but you're getting 12 different projects. You get all the bits and pieces you need to do them as well. So things like straws for yeah. your fabric flowers, zips, uh, press studs, all the little bits and pieces that are already in there for you. Excellent. So look at this. I really like this apron. It has to. I love the fabric. That's cute. That's <laughs> well, because we can just make up the fabric. I mean, the Fabazines are designed to be a real kind of mixed bag. What are you laughing at, Phil? Fabazines. Okay. <laughs> I wish I'd thought of it. <laughs> <laughs> he says he wishes he'd thought of it. <laughs> he does indeed. Look, we're looking at all these projects that you can make. Look, there's the little thread catcher. That's cute. A little little card wallet just to keep them safe. Look at that beautiful um, quilt. Now you get you're getting a clamshell template yes, too. Yes, and this is a, a kind of an easy clamshell. It mm. actually works into four little squares, and then you sew the squares together. So sometimes clamshell can be quite daunting because you've got those large mm. curves to do and you're dealing with kind of three or four curves on each piece this simplifies it by just dealing with one curve at a time yeah and it sews together really easily marvelous we've got string art in here we've got these mug rugs mug hugs whichever one um embroidered uh, doodles oh he's cute is he a toucan he is a toucan he is uh, this is a gorgeous cushion isn't it look at that um, so all of these wonderful projects, 12, as Hayley said, in total. Um, you can, of course, spread the cost, two payments of £20, or you can go for it outright at 507152. Now, it works out at £3.33 per project. So you can see you get your MDF de there. You also get your templates, straws. There's some skeins of thread. Um, we've got some... Is it nails we've got in here, even? Oh! <clears throat> okay, for the string art, that is. At £10 saving, we are nearly 80% of the stock gone, and it's 507152. <clears throat> individually, and we've done that because um, this is how we would normally sell them. We'd normally sell them all individually, and that's kind of where we don't just make these figures up when we say there's, you know, £120 um, worth of projects within there. It's We've actually broken down the projects as individuals, put them together and then put the price on them and then packed as many as we can Amazing. into one sheet of fabric because this is the fabric here I'm just going to move that out of the way for one second and you can see it is just it, it's layers and layers and yeah. layers and layers of it there is absolutely mountains of it and uh, it comes to you all as one piece so you're not going to lose any bits everything is guaranteed to be there good stuff uh, 507, as I said, 507152. Now, we have got some happy hour deals. I'm loving all these happy hours. They're great, aren't they? So, the first one then that we've got, oh, she's very pretty. Um, this is the. Um, oh, is this a flower foot? If yeah. we get time, I will. Um, oh, that's not the happy hour price, though. So bear with. I'm sure Meg's going to fix that. But um, this is the flower foot. If we get enough time, mm. I will uh, demonstrate this one. I do want to get the flowers done in this hour, um, but once we've done that, then I'll, I'll try and get the flower foot done. Excellent. Oh, We've also I got the quilting cotton. Oh, are you talking about the picture? Oh. Um, right, £27.95. pence. you are saving how much? £37. I mean, pounds. The frustration is, how yeah. do you make it look any better? Are the pictures, I know. That's the thing. It's not exciting. Well, it's essential, though, because it it's white quilting cotton, and it's exactly the same weight as we print on. Uh, the only difference is one is treated to go through the printer yep. um, with extra kind of uh, extra goodness, goodness that will help the uh, the ink to stick and uh, be completely colour fast and that is the same type of fabric but without that extra treatment added to it. Cool. At £37 saving but only up until the end of the hour. 438256 is the item number. Uh, so you can give us a call 01733602000 or you can check out on the website at herchanda.com. Right, we've got a gift with purchase so you'll be able to make him up. He's very cute, isn't he?
So you just need to make a purchase during this hour uh, of uh, obviously any craft yourself silly items. So what you'll get is the panel. Yay, there it is. So this is your gift with purchase. He's cute when he's made up, isn't he? And instructions. Are actually 9.99 on their own right so, uh, even if you're getting something like the uh, what do I mean uh, the flower foot yeah which is 9.99 right you're almost getting kind of you know two projects for the price of one there with the bear as the gift with purchase cool thank you Haley. all right I shall pass over to you what are you gonna do this hour? okay so we are going to do one of the fabric flowers now I managed to squeeze seven of these onto the one fabazine panel so and um, these are super cute all i'm doing is starting with one of the long straight pieces and i'm just pressing um one end over so i haven't got any raw edges so i'll just tuck that under there we go so i'm just pressing that one end over and then we are going to start to assemble our flower so that's step one and then we need step two, which is actually to start putting the leaves together. So we're going to do the same as we did with the uh, pressing of this edge to top and bottom mm -hmm. of this one. Because um, oh, I, should have, I shouldn't have moved my thing, should I? Hang on, see if I've got a little bit of... Ah, there you go. I've got a little bit of batting here that I can use just to protect the mat from the iron. So I'm going to press top and bottom of these. Okay. And this will all become clear in a second. All we're doing is just making sure that we haven't got any raw edges hanging out of, on the finished item. So that's top and bottom of there done. Mm -hmm. Now these, uh, I will admit, these leaves are from my prototype one. Yours will have a, a graduated colour on. Oh, okay. So they're a little bit fancier. Oh, nice. A little bit fancier. You can see them on just the on the piece behind you there. If you just lift them up a little oh, bit, you might on. be able to just see, and um, they've got actual a kind of graduation through them, which just makes them a little bit, a little bit more realistic, I nice. think, when yeah, you I put like them that. on. So we're going to pop these face to face, and we are going to sew all the way around that outside edge, and then there's only one more bit of sewing with the machine for these, and then the rest is hand sewing. So let me just line these up. And pop a couple of pins so in. So a beginner project to this? Yes, I would say definitely a beginner project. It's a good mix of um, hand sewing and machine sewing. This no, one I like as well. my hand sewing. Yes, I know you do. Yes. So this is why we've done this. We saved this one for you. <laughs> uh, and the embroidery doodles, I think, are right up your street as well, aren't yeah. they? All right, so pop a little fixed stitch on there. Oh, my pedal's miles away. There we go. Um, uh, just keeping uh, a nice even distance from that edge and you can set doesn't matter what seam allowance you use as long as it's the same yeah um, we would recommend quarter inch but if you're comfortable with a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller then that is fine too I think some of the time it's down to your machine as well and mm. what the capability is of your machine so I'm gonna come down the other side and then this needs to be turned right side out so let's get rid of that last pin could you hand stitch this bit? Yeah, absolutely. If yeah. you wanted to, you could hand stitch this piece as well. Yeah. That's it. Done. So, oh, I've got one more bit to do. So this is the bit that will become the head of the flower. So what we need to do with that one is just fold it in half so it's face to face and then sew up. Oops, where are we going? There, <laughs> there we go. This sew up this edge here. So along there, mm -hmm. that's where I'm going to sew next. Good. It was all over the place there. <laughs> <laughs> so this is this quite a quick project as well? Yeah, this is quite a quick one as well. There's there's some quick ones in there. There's some that take a little bit more time because the um, bag that we did in the last hour, that took a little bit more time because there was a little bit more prep involved. But you could easily get that one done start to finish mm -hmm. within an hour, hour okay. and a half. Good stuff. There we go. And that one's that off. So we're going to turn this one right side out and that will become our flower. And turn this one right side out. Let me get rid of this. Oh. This one will become our leaf. Uh, just trim those off. And pop this one right side out mm -hmm. as well. And, and that then, reduces the bulk, does it? Uh, yes, it just yeah. reduces the bulk on the, on the top edge there. 
So this one's a little bit more fiddly because obviously you've got quite a narrow gap at the bottom there, but you just need to take your time yep. and get this turned right side out. So, uh, can you give me a minute to do that? Indeed and then we can. Uh, you can do some numbers. I will do as some we like numbers. to say. <laughs> do some numbers. <laughs> Uh, right then, so as you can see, these are all the fabulous finished samples with the um, projects that you can make within our Fabazine issue 3. And you also get some extra bits and pieces like your templates and you get straws and all sorts. Oh, that's yeah. in there as well. You get a whole lot. So you'll be able to make the apron. Next up, we've got, oh, he's brilliant. He's a doorstop. Ah, excellent. Yes. Then you've got a nice little bag, could be a wash bag. And that one's a reversal. I'm going. I'm too. I'm not quick enough yeah. when the pictures are up. So <laughs> the um, the bag is actually a reversible one. So you can choose which way round you want it. So you right. can have it that way round with the darker on the outside. And what I've actually added is um, I've, I had a little spare gap that right. I found on the Fabazine. So I added a little panel nice. that had lots of the kind of matching shapes on. So you could um, use your um, satin stitch maybe mm -hmm. or a scribble stitch to yep. applique those on or you can have it this way out I which like is the way. kind of brighter more geometric one so the zip you'll be getting in there is actually the cream one yeah uh, because we thought that matched better overall with that side excellent thank you um, <clears throat> so we've got the uh, bag Bye, Phil. Bye. Bye. <laughs> uh, we've got the fabric flowers and yep. the mug rugs. So the fabric flowers are the one we're doing at the minute. The mug rugs can be literally a 10, 15 minute project to cool. get those done. They can be so quick. Or if you want to do more to them, you can always add some quilting onto them and, and you know, get a bit more adventurous. You can take it to whichever level you're at. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Then we've got our little tidy. I like this. So you oh, can this is your... super cute. Have you had a go? No. Okay. Um, Meg showed me actually. So it pops down, does it pop That's in? That's it, and then it kind of pops, the bottom pops in. Oh, so on, you on. can kind of uh, catch all your threads yeah. and then secure them if you need to get rid of them. There or you go. just keep them, you know, keep them secured and out of the way mm -hmm. to get rid of uh, when you like. Lovely, and then it pops up. Cool, lovely. And then the next one, we've got a little card pouch. It's a really sweet diddy one, actually. It is, and we put a little tab, and in that little um, tag that you can see on the side there, that's also included in your kit, so you don't have to go and find that. And this one looks at using those kind of more rustic-looking external seams as well. So, mm -hmm. you, you know, there's a variety of techniques within there. Cool. Here's the next one. We've got the quilt with the clamshell. So we've even got the template in with the magazine for you. So it just makes life a bit easier. But I mean, I love this. How nice are these fabrics that have been used, actually? They look really beautiful. Oh, yes, wonderful with the batik fabrics. I'm sure that we'll find I think we've got someone. those on the show somewhere yeah. as a pick and mix. Cool. Have a look at the website. And here's the next one. So this is string art. Interesting. So this is, we started in the last hour, but what I quickly realised is you can't bang nails in in between people's shows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So unfortunately, I've not been able to, uh, to finish that one to demonstrate it, but it's fairly straightforward. You're putting the nails in and then you're wrapping the thread in between the nails to create. Yeah. Uh, you, know, you can either do it like that where it's a bit random or uh, there's a sample that Patty's done where it's a bit more um, uh, glitzy side to side yeah. and it looks like water. Ah, this one, have a little look yes. here. It's cool, isn't it? I'm gonna give it oh, a somebody's wiggle. pinged some of the strings off, look. Oh, oh. you can see, isn't that cool? Being, looks like, it doesn't look like water, it? Love that. Uh, so that's the string art. Then we've got our mug rugs or mug hugs. And then next we've got our embroidery doodles. And do we have any more? Oh yes, the cushion, the cushion. This one, and the final project is this cushion. Lovely. You are saving £10, only up until 6 o'clock uh, this evening, and you can spread the cost to payments of £20. 507152 is the item number. Now, next up, we have got our Frank's friends. Frank and friends. Here he is. I love the um, fabrics, they're great. So here we go. 
So it all coordinates together. It's yeah. three projects, um, and you're getting absolutely the three slightly bigger projects, and uh -huh. you're getting absolutely everything in them. So right. you're getting your batting, you're getting uh, the felt put in the middle of the scissor keep, you're getting the zip to put. So you don't have to go and find anything for these. Everything is included, and you're also getting 13 applique ducks as well wow, to add yeah. on to other projects. You can see them all up the top there. Cute, aren't they? Look at this. I like the colourways. And it's quite, it's quite a big piece of fabric. I think it's about um, 150 centimetres by about 80 or 90. It's a, it's a good chunky piece there. Yeah. And look, this is what you can make. You've got your sizzy, sizzy, scissor pouch. <laughs> that looks so cute, doesn't it? Pop your scissors in. And you can also make this so little you turn purse. it round. Yeah. Ah, Frank and friends. <laughs> That's cute. His and friends aren't white ducks, though. His friends are fawn and white ducks. They're brown and white ducks. Oh. But I designed the fabric before we got the ducks. Oh, I see. Fair <laughs> enough. Because there is a real Frank. There is a real yeah, Frank. Yeah, there's a real Frank, and he has real friends. His friends are Boris, Bertie, Biscuit, and... Uh, ooh, Bumble. That's the other one. And um, uh, how many Instagram followers has he now got? Uh, oh, he's got about 160, 170. <laughs> Love that. And so we have got the That's bag more than some make. people. Yeah, this is two. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but you can see you get your materials as well, plus the zip. £21.99. pence. Item number is 779364. Now, if you want both, if you want the One Day Special and Frank's Friends, you can get it. Nice big bundle. It's £58.98. pence. Um, and I'm sure you can spread the cost, yes. Two payments of £29.49. <gasps> is £29.49 enough to use your thing, your £5 thing? Yes, it is, yes, yeah. Because it's over £25. There you go. So you can use your £5 credit. Uh, just to stress, though, it's a, it's a one-time only thing, if you know what I mean. It's not accumulating. One per customer, that's what I was trying to say, yes. 032375, no, 376, 376, <laughs> my numbers. It's because I've been away for a week. <laughs> you just forgotten how to present yeah, completely. Yeah, what happens. <laughs> <laughs> uh, some people would question anyway uh, my presenting. <laughs> However, uh, we have also got some seven-day savers for you. This is one of them. Let's take a look at what it is uh, because we have organza. <laughs> Well, indeed, it's a Chanda's fifth birthday, and have we got some seven-day savers for you. This is just one of them. Now, I've got a few seconds uh, to tell you why we're here. We are talking about organza fabric, 29 centimetres by 25 metres. Now, you can take a pick and mix of any two of the colours that I've got in front of me. We've got things like the red, the deep Christmas red. You've got the emerald green. We've got the gold in there. You've got the rose gold as well. You've got the white and the silver as well. You're saving £7 on these, the price. £17.99 for any two of 25 metres in length. 426152 is your item number. And any purchase during the live hour, you will also receive a free gift as well. Terms and conditions are all on the website. Don't miss out on another cracking little birthday present. Now, which one shall I have? Which one is he going to have? Got to have the emerald green because of the event. Um, right then, so Hayley, where have you got to? Okay, so uh, we are just starting to put the flower together. So we've done the uh, leaf that is turned right side out and pressed. We have done the start of the flower that's turned right side out as well. And now we're going to start attaching the stem to the paper straw, which is going to hold it nice and rigid. So if you want to put um, a little bit of... Uh, just temporary glue on here, you absolutely can. Even something like one of those glue sticks will do this. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold it over and that pressed edge is what we're gonna create the seam with. So to start it off, I'm just gonna put the needle inside that edge. I've got a good knot on the end of there, so you're not gonna see that because it's gonna fall into the fold. I'm sorry, Jimmy, I need to be on the mat a bit for this, so. Um, and then what I'm gonna do is uh, same technique as you would with a ladder stitch. So in and out of one side, and then we're going to pull it tight. Just make sure that stays underneath. Now, if you didn't want to stitch this, you could just glue it. Mm -hmm. If you if you really were that adverse to stitching, mm -hmm. 
then you could just glue it. But I think it's nice to have it as a completely sewn project. So we're just going to work our way down, yeah. keeping those in line, <coughs> in and out of one side. Oh, I'm trying to get my hands out of the way. <laughs> Don't worry. There we go. In and out of one side, in and out of the other. Yeah. And that is what we're going to do all of the way down. So I'm going to need a minute or so just to work my way down the rest of this. Um, and then we shall start assembling. Cool. Shall I show our gift with purchase? Why not? Why not? I've got some good tips actually for, yeah. for that. Um, when you uh, when you get it, what I would say is uh, do all of your kind of embroidery first. So don't cut all the pieces out the panel. It's really tempting to go straight in and mm -hmm. cut all the pieces out the panel. Yeah. Don't do that. Okay. Embroider everything first then cut your pieces out of the panel and when you cut them out if you immediately put either a zigzag stitch mm -hmm. or some kind of um there's plenty of stitches that you can use maybe just a, a a blanket stitch around the edge just to secure the edges mm -hmm. while you actually construct it because you don't want to have anything fraying on you while you're trying to put it together cool so um yeah or leave yourself a little bit extra because we mm -hmm. we've lived in, we've left a quarter inch uh, seam allowance on yeah. the panel but if you want to cut the pieces out and give yourself a little bit more wiggle room I would definitely do that you can always trim away the excess a little bit later and here's the panel there you are um, so this is your gift with purchase and you can pop him together and yeah give him as a lovely gift it's really pretty now <clears throat> we have also got issues one and two available for you we've brought them back so you can see what you can be making and we've got cushions oh he's cute oh oh does he have a name oh that's the flappy turtle so in number two <laughs> you've got uh beach embroidery you've got the flappy turtle there's yeah. hedgehog pin cushion oh. there is the okay. the piece on the front there that's a spiral cabin um, oh it's nice piece that you you actually um it's like the folded paper piecing that you do where you fold the paper and then you sew along the line and then you tear it off. Yeah. But it's fabric, so it's uh, completely solid when you are done. You've got your uh -huh. weaving loom in there, yep. you've got your uh, jelly bean lunch bag, you've got your lotus flower template, mm, and somewhere. you've got your, it's on the, the box, the little box thing that's next to you. That's it. Ah, and you've got the purple sorry. box, the little lotus box that matches with it. Um, oh, what else is in there? Oh, there's another embroidery in there. It's got a couple of little birds on that oh, one. Yeah. I think it's behind the loom. You've that. got a little, um, a really cute little pouch, little zippy pouch. That's the one. And that one kind of all folds out. You've got your notes and crosses. You've got your mug um, tidy. Cute. Have you just spotted the mug with a pin cushion from Meg? <laughs> um, and then you've got the cushion as well, the Victorian tile cushion. Mm. So this one is great for your free motion and following all of those designs. It's good as just a practice piece, but you can just do the, the bare minimum like we've got on there where you've just stitched the, the squares of the tiles in and done like a fake stitch in the ditch. Yeah. Or um, you can go to town on it. Now, if you look, turn that around and look on the back, Yes. With that one, we even cut buttons to coordinate oh. with the pattern itself. Oh, so <laughs> so the back with a slightly smaller cushion mm -hmm. will close completely. Yeah, and the buttons that are in there actually match the the pattern on the uh, fabric as well. Uh, I think the buttons are here. Cute little smiley faces. Um, so that is issue one. Ah, that's two. Sorry, that's two. We've gone backwards. Oh. <laughs> and then I number see. one is the one next to it. So that one is your uh, test patch template, yep. your camper van um, template, your uh, pop art lady who's got the organizer with her. There's a feather notebook. There's the hippo. There's the rose pouch. There's the pencil case. Um, what have I forgotten? Oh, there's uh, MDF cross stitch embroidery. Cool. There's, uh, yeah, Scotty Dog Bunting. Oh, I always forget that one. Cute. I Two payments it. then if you want to spread the cost of £39.99. £10 saving for issue one and two as the bundle. And it's 401394. So look how many people 
Uh, how many people, how many projects, sorry, you can be making? <laughs> Well, with all of them, then um, you don't necessarily need to use all the components of all the projects together. You can always kind of mix and match right. them up a little bit okay. as well. So you can, you know, you can spin these even further if you want to. Lovely. A reminder of the happy hour. Let's have a look. So first off, we have got the flower foot bundle. It's there for you, uh, and you get mini project and, of course, instructions. It's nine ninety nine, and you have. About 35 minutes remaining to get it. 310298 and another one. We've got the quilting cotton. This is the five metre piece and it's got a massive £37 saving. Please stock up on this, it's your essential. You know, it's only 27.95 at the moment. 438256. And in number three, yeah. you before you actually went ahead and sewed the, the little kind of wash bag that we've got here, if you cut out two more pieces in the white quilting cotton yeah and got yourself a second zip oh good you've got two bags nice instead of one so there's a lot of that white quilting cotton's a really good way to make a lot of the projects that are in there go an awful lot further cool right i'm almost there i'm about halfway along this and once you've got about halfway along it becomes a lot quicker and a lot easier because there's a lot more kind of supporting the fabric yeah and it's just exactly the same it's just a ladder stitch um, and we're just slowly pulling this together i mean i'm stitching this in bright red thread but if you have a look there, you can hardly see it because of the, the type of stitch right. that I'm using. And that's really, I mean, it's bright red thread. Where's the reel of it? There it is. That's I like what the I, red and the green. That's what I've been using to stitch it together. But it's so you can see stuff. Indeed. Um, so I need another probably uh, two, possibly three minutes just to finish this up. Actually, can we, can we get a... Okay, give, give us a minute. I'll, I'll try and get a bit further down and then we'll, we'll get it finished off. Not a problem. So, of course, this is your final call for the one-day special. It will be going back up in price at 6 p.m. And it's uh, the Fabazine issue three. And again, all of these wonderful projects that you can be making. Now, it works out at £3.33 per project. And let's go through the projects that you can make. Um, so here is the actual bundle. You get your extras, not just the magazine, but you've got that um, the MDF with the uh, what should we call it on jar. Uh, you've got <laughs> the string the art jar. That, that's the what should we call it jar? Yeah. If you have a look on the back of the um, magazine, it's got them all on there. Look, it's oh, a little yeah. list. You can just read it out. That's all right. We've got pictures though. <laughs> <laughs> 